Whoa. I didn't realize that was going to be in tune. Oh! Hi! Hi, hi, hi! That was pretty cool. Unintentionally. Kaiser. You know what's also Ooh. cool? The cheese slice cheese. slid around to the back of my head. Kaiser. Hi! Hi! Welcome, welcome. Hi, Natalie and Lulu. Cabbage as well and Dara. Sheesh. It's a Dara. A Dara ball. Mm, fox of the silver variety and the cat. Oh my god, this. Jeez. The squeeing long cat looks really adorable. Oh my god, I've been streaming too many days in a row and my voice is dying already. Hi! How are you doing? Omni as well. Did I say pine? Welcome, pine. And Nianyan. I think I completely ignored both of you. What a disgusting. Talented, you creature. <laughs> no, not talented. Inspiring Yuki, exceptional Yuki, whoa, whoa, whoa. What? You are really appreciated by all of us here supporting you. Ah. Uh, <laughs> thank you very much. Uh, I need to add heart and wow to the list of words that she can't read. No, thank you very much. Heart, wow. I swear to God, I'm going to train her to be able to speak if it's the last thing I can do. Yeah, exactly. It sounds like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold back there. Um, hi. Welcome. Um. Yeah, I'm, I'm really sorry. Oh, Jakku! Hi! Welcome. Hi. How are you doing? And... And then, then there you go, Jakku. Your slap sounds... <laughs> Your slap sounds has to be like, it has to be like the most used sound on the entire stream because although there are random cheese sounds, this music needs to calm down a bit. Although there are random. <laughs> yeah! What a slapper, jeez. Isn't it funny how you can say that slaps and it's a good thing, but as soon as you call someone a slapper, that's a bad thing? Uh. Wait, what? No, no, that's a good thing. This is your last one. Blah 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 blah. Oh, I'm back. Hi! Anyway, this. Um, I don't exact. <laughs> you can see the spray coming in from the bottom right. You can see the actual spray particles, <laughs> not the. Not the bottle. But hi, Jacko, how are you doing? Yeah, although there are many, like, cheese sounds. Um. Unfortunately, there is there is no cheese sound of Jaku's adorable voice, so we just have her slapping herself as a cheese sound. But the the slap sound is cheese. <laughs> the slap sound itself is like one of three, and they're also randomised and pitched each of those. So yeah, recorded by Jacoba like fucking I don't, a long time ago. I don't know how long ago. Like I don't know, like one and a half years ago at this point, I think. <laughs> <laughs> it's because I, I don't know, I I think you offered, right? I said I need like a slap sound, I should record it, and then you recorded it or something, I don't actually remember. But yeah, welcome in everyone. Hi Carly as well, I was gonna say hi Carly, and then I got rudely censored by Carly. Nuge as well, hi, welcome, welcome. Um, Primo, hi, hi, welcome, welcome. Time is sh moving, it is, this music needs to calm down. Although I like it. Um, 1900 o'clock. What would that actually be? Let me work that out. 1900 times 24. No. What would it be? 1900 divided by 24. That's 79 days in the future. Um. But yeah, hi everyone. I'm very sorry. I'm streaming the same thing all week. I never normally do this, but this is the thing I really need to get done. And as such, I'm going to be concentrating. I'm going to try to be concentrating on this quite a bit today. And it's going to be a bit different. Um, maybe I'm just going to try to be focusing on the work slightly and then neglecting everybody. No, I'm not going to. I'm not going to be neglecting people. I can't do that. It's, that's absolutely stupid. I might as well not be streaming. However. However. Oh God. However. I'm going to slap on. It's going to be different music. Well, I mean, it's going to be all of my usual playlists mixed together, plus a bunch that I've never been on stream because uh, there's been speech and stuff because 
Uh, I mean, like, vocals in it, um, which I don't normally do when I'm... Uh, you know, I don't like... Ooh, I don't like having two voices saying things at the same time, whether that's my voice and someone in the song or not. Yeah. But I feel like I've been, you know, because I'm streaming so much, people are probably getting sick and tired of the, the same music. So I'm just going to slap on everything that I have that I'm able to play <laughs> from months ago without getting in trouble because, you know, it's, it's licensed. So, yeah. Um, and I'm just going to try my hardest for uh, to get this in like a working state today um, even if it's like not well like you know maybe not super high quality the uh, atlas and stuff um, just because uh, it's needed tomorrow evening so I'd rather have it be um, face of the big ice cream <laughs> scoop <laughs> kind of is it looks like this Hairy ice cream. Oh, yeah, it's kind of, kind of gross. Let's not think about that. Um, yeah. So I'd rather have this working at all than, you know, not. <laughs> I'll I'll do it in a state where you know uh, I can just modify the model in Blender, the FBX file, and hopefully, you know, just have that. You know, uh, eat, blah, blah. how am I, what am I trying to say? I'll get into a working state, even if it's not that good, and then once it's in that state. I'll make sure that I can just keep on improving the quality. And at that point, it's like, it's already working, but the quality just improves. Is what I'm trying to say. So essentially, you know, once I've done a bit more addressing, I will like re-export it as an FBX file. Hopefully it'll just update in Unity and everything will be perfect. Just joking, every time I export from Blender, all the material slots get shuffled around randomly. So I'll need to do, you know, a bit of unjumbling of all of the materials but yeah yeah words are hard but yeah hi everyone i really hope you're all doing all right thank you very much for being here nuge those were some very kind words as well um yeah so basically i want to kind of try to atlas as quickly as i can um everything that's remaining which uh, is the roller skates. The roller skates are probably going to go onto this texture. And, um... Uh... Probably the... Actually, I'm not sure. Well, are we going to the visor in this one or not? Maybe not. Um, but I, I was reminded by my brain when I was trying to sleep that I actually have eight material slots at my disposal. So, um, it, oh wait, that's kind of useless though, right? Hold on, wait, okay, one moment, I actually have to think thing three for a second. Here's how stuff is on, on Unity as it is right now. Um, uh, Yeah, you know what? I think I will try to put it down onto two textures. Uh, no, Jolene. <laughs> I think it is kind of... Um, um, also, welcome, Jolene. I think I'll try and aim for two textures. Because although in VRChat I can use the Poyami shader, which can use different UVs, that is like the layouts of the, of, of, of the things, like... Uh, why am I not seeing it? Am I going crazy? Uh, oh, there we are. Now they're showing up. Was, what did I do differently? I thought I just switched to this and then back. And, okay, anyway. Although um, it can have two different layouts, for example, this layout and this layout. Um... Uh... If I were to use this in the future as a VRM file for like VC face, then um, the VRM shader can only use the very first set of UVs. So, yeah. I think I would like to try to make it be compatible with that in the future and not have to do this all a third time. <gasps> 
Crooksy? Oh, that was crazy once. Don't worry, Dara. Also, hold on a second. I just realized I missed a redeem at the very beginning, which was... Hydration from Fox Self. <gasps> oh my god. I almost, I almost forgot that. Sorry, Fox. I'm doing it now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ghost. Can't deserve that. <laughs> Neglecting redeems. <clears throat> What's on you? I debunk. Yeah, and there's the poster check for Daria. Yuck. Oh my god. The cheese just flung itself. Couldn't get up earlier to comment. Was busy being cuddled on my chest by a kitty. No worries. Early access cat. Work now, make better later. <laughs> oh my god, it actually kind of is like that. <laughs> Um, yeah, well, it's more like, I guess, alpha or beta. Uh, it'll be beta version. It'll be usable, but not as good as it could be. All right, now I'm snatching all music. I'm pressing Control A, delete, and dragging all folders. Look at it go. Oh, actually, I've been on drag them. Actually, why the hell not? There you go. Look, it's going through all music. Okay, it's added. There we are, and we now have a playlist with 17 hours worth of music, apparently. Why doesn't it tell me how many files? Oh my god, it starts with Nanobi! Ah! Alright, fine. I, th I literally just dragged all folders on and it starts with Nanobi in shuffle mode. Amazing. Fubar really knows what music I like. I guess we're going to be doing a hype atlasing then. Feels weird having Nanobi for such... You know, for not like a fast-paced game like Cyberhook or Trackmania. The progress bar popped up on the stream when I clicked the button on my computer. <laughs> Sorry if that confused you. Alright. Sorry, that just sounds really annoying. He's playing Trackmania on the second monitor at the same time. <laughs> So this music I was feeling like low energy before I started streaming. I spent like 20 minutes trying to psych myself out to press the start streaming button. Now I'm now I'm hype. What the fuck? Give me more of that shit. None of it. Um alright. Uh oh, uh, I've done one thing off stream that I haven't shown you yet. Which is this. So there was originally uh, an Ahoga there, do you see it? There it is. Look, it's coming out of the ear. That's not good. That's because the ears were added later. And unfortunately, you know, uh, this is easy to see if I do this. It was like that. And then when I added the ears, oh no, it's in a terrible place. So easy problem to solve, right? <laughs> right? All I have to do is click on armature, pose mode, show the bones, and then I can just drag this arge wherever I want it, right? Jesus, it really does lag a long time when it's trying to select the bone. Look, click. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> that was really fast. Click. Oh, it's only really slow when it's doing hair, apparently. So look, I can just drag this to wherever I want it, right? You would have thought so, but what the fuck is that? What is this? What are those? Jeez. No, they're not cheese, but hybrids. Good guess. So, uh... <laughs> so I actually wanted to put it as cat shows before. Uh... So it's like coming out of the same part of the head as this front ahoga here. Like the parting, if you like. But the waiting doesn't really allow me to do that <laughs> very well. So, you might ask, rightly, why does it look like this on, on, on the final version that you made on Unity, Yuke? Well, here's the thing. Oh my god, this is such a <laughs> such different music now. It's all playlists smashed together. So yeah, what I did was, um, oh my god, I'm trying to get this to orbit around the head, please. Good now. Oh my god. So, um... What I ended up doing was, in Unity, uh, because this was a super late change, unfortunately, after I'd already got 
all stuff ready for like VRM stuff. <sighs> and I couldn't go back into Blender at that point without like redoing everything because the Blender Unity workflow is absolute pain and can barely be called a workflow, more like a work blockage. Um, I ended up just uh, removing the Ahaga from the original thing by setting all the bone scales to zero. Actually, zero point, like, z I think was it zero point zero zero one or something. Because if you make it precisely zero, then uh, there's weird, something weird Jeez. happens. No, hi, Okami. Okay. Jeez. Good enough. Something weird happens with the VRM shader and it starts having, like, really bright sparkles randomly. Um, and then I loaded the original VRM in Blender, deleted everything that was not the Ahoga, and exported just the Ahoga as an FBX file, brought it into Unity and positioned it how I wanted it. <sighs> so that's what I'm, that's, that's I'm going to be doing here. That's in fact what I've already done. I've brought in another Ahoga. Just from this. I literally just... Uh, exported just the Ahoga from this as an FBX and re-imported it because I'm crap at Blender and don't know how to do it other ways. Um, and I'll now That's proceed. So shabby. Let me pat your head. No, it, it's pretty. It's it's pretty goddamn shabby. It's extremely janky. I'm sorry. Hi, Nooch. Exclamation mark. Uh -huh. And hi. Hi, Cab. Did I say hi to Cabbage before? I can't remember. Thank you for the pads, though, Nuj. I'll take them. I'll take them. Oh, it's a rotated one. Oh my god. I'd literally never seen anybody use modified BTTV emotes until... Until you did. I didn't even know it was possible. Um... Um, 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 um. Okay, so I'm gonna, like, delete. So I can do better than just scaling the bones down to zero. In Unity. Um, now that I'm in Blender, I can actually delete the mesh that is the Ahaga. I can if it shows up. The hell? Oh. Hair! There we go. Wait, did I post the... No, it's separate. You always turn everything else off for a sec. Body, you as well. Alright, just the hair. Exclamation mark goes after the letters. Does it? Oh my goodness, okay. <coughs> so... We can edit the hair mesh. If tab would do anything, we could edit the hair mesh. There we go. If I press L, it's probably going to select everything, isn't it? <gasps> Ooh, okay, nice. It just selects this. In that case, I could delete this. Boop! Done! Wait, I didn't delete them. Did it? What did it delete? Vertices. What? <laughs> huh? What is this then? How is it left faces but not vertices? What? How is that possible? What the? F huh? Oh, like half of it is. Wait, the Arge is made of two parts. Of course it is, because it's flipping Vroid. They never close their loops. Wait, no. Then it should just be one thing, but just not. With the final sides merged together. This is actually two separate halves of Nahage. Let's try again. Wait, what is... There's something... There's, look, there's a black dot right there, but it's not selected. Look at that! What's going on there? <laughs> Hold on. What is this? <laughs> oh my god, look, there's like... How do I zoom out? There's like two faces at the very end of the Ahage that were not part of it. Not... Linked apparently. Why? Why am I being squished? <laughs> <laughs> it looks so funny on OBS though. Ah! Oh, when I mouse over it doesn't look funny, but the, the tiny icon looks funny. The, the tiny emote even. I'm cooking some meat, so when the cooking stream, I'm not averse to a cooking stream. I would need. I would require a lot of preparation though, and for me to be like alone in the house because I don't think most people would um, enjoy my entire streaming setup being moved downstairs into the kitchen. <laughs> uh, no, don't 
and squish the long yuk's tail. Okay, is there anything at this end that's also not selected? Yes, there is! Oh my god, Glenda, please! Look, there's a dot right there. That's easy to see. Oh, wait. Hold on. Why do I not see? Hmm, I don't see it now. There we are. Music of the vocals. Never before on my stream. There's a whole bunch of Monster Cat songs that I actually really quite like, but they have lyrics, so I didn't use them. Usually. Um, I should probably turn it down slightly, though. Because it will still screw up my head. I only have one language processing center. Alright, let's delete the verts. Please disappear this time. Nice. LP. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now I should be able to delete the bonus as well, and they shouldn't affect anything else. Please. Please tell me that's the case anyway. LPC. <laughs> well, linear predictive coding. That's already a thing. Can we make this transparent, please? Okay, there is only there are only those bones. Hopefully, when I remove them, it's not gonna break everything. Um, and before you accidentally delete the foot without seeing, no, do not the feet. All right, so hopefully, if I move my. Uh, I'm really being tripped up by the lyrics. Hopefully, when I move this head around, pull the toes off. Hey, now! That's. 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 fox abuse. Look at these eye bones. <laughs> ah! <laughs> uh. Wait, what am I trying to do? Pose mode, yes. I want to make sure this, this still all works. Yes, I haven't yet put done anything with this new Ahage yet. So it should just work. Yes. Alright, so somehow I need to merge this. Or not merge, not merge, not merge. It needs to be its own unique bone names, because otherwise when I merge it into this, it'll take the same weird weighting that it had before and have that long string stretching into the middle of the head, which I really don't want. Why does that look so... oh, is it because... oh, it's a bone. Okay. Um, Yuke's an all-star. Hey now, oh sorry. <laughs> hey now, Yuke's an all-star. Okay, okay. No, wait, what? Why? Why are you saying that? I'm confused. Uh... Okay, where's the... Oh, okay, here it is. It's probably gonna have the entire goddamn... Oh, it's only the hair. Oh, it's actually only got the very bones that it needs! That's nice. I thought it would have the entire... Oh, wait, maybe Vertex Creep. Maybe it has all the Vertex Creeps. No, it only has the Vertex Creeps that it needs. Wow. I seriously thought that this was going to... Um, have, like, the entire goddamn every single Vertex Creep that's in the original. I thought it would have exported all of those as well. I thought we would be looking at this kind of list of crap. Then I'd have to delete every single one except for the three that I used by the hair. Or four. I can't remember. I can't count. How many? Four. So this thing here is... Oh, not that one. Uh, wait, let me go into weight paint mode, actually. <laughs> wait. Let me go into weight paint mode. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Did I say hey now? Oh, okay. I'm sorry, I have zero memory! <laughs> it's 
squashed boot. Ice stalks for long range seeing. Yeah, they remind me of um, Macron, this the end boss of Quake 2. Ooh, it does look like blue hair, doesn't it? Okay, so the four way, bleh, the four vertex group. Uh, this one, this one, this one, and this one. Hold on a sec. That's a bit weird, isn't it? There are four wait, wait, so four vertex groups or weight groups, you know. But uh, there are five bones. So how does that work, Yuke? One, two, three, four, five. So it's head, hair one, hair two, hair three. And these bones are head, hair one, hair two, hair three. Wait, what? One, two, three, four, five, six bones? Oh, there are six bones. Oh my god, I really can't count. Yeah, exclamation mark hick. Or well, hiccup is actually a, a thing. It's very far behind. Because it didn't exist at first, so... Okay, so head, hair one, hair two, and hair three are the only ones that we care about. Hair four? There's nothing weighted to it. Hair eight, end? <laughs> uh, yeah, Unity needs like an extra bone at the end, doesn't it? So I'll... Oh yeah, right. <laughs> I haven't applied the pose yet, so it's going to be down on the floor. One sec. That confused me for a split second. Jesus, what is this mess? Hold on, let me just... Let's go inside my own bone. Here we are. Oh my god, okay, this is actually really annoying. One sec. Can I get rid of this crap? Okay. Um. So we'll have this one, which is head. Hair one. Hair two, hair three. We'll have to keep this one for Unity, and this one is doing absolutely goddamn nothing, so goodbye. Pick your hair up. It's bad enough when I have to step on the hair when I went in the kitchen all week. <laughs> That's slightly relatable. Yeah, I'm sorry, I dropped my ahake on the floor. One sec, let me pick it up. There we are. Ooh. Wait, where's it? Where's it? There it is. Okay, so I need to make sure this is positioned exactly where I want it. Which is probably not, but let's at least try to get it close. I guess I can do fine tuning in Unity, but I really want to do as little work in Unity as necessary. Um, just material stuff, basically. And, you know, all the VR chat specific stuff, setting up of animations and animators. Hi, oh, come on, Kai! Look, it's an Ahoga! It's, it's... In its raw form, the creature that exists on top of some people's heads. Here it is. <laughs> Boop. Wait. Uh. I need more. Boop. No. no. <laughs> there we are. There it is in its natural habitat. Atop someone's head. How are you clunking? Do as little devil cube stuff as possible. Yeah. Devil cube. I like the way it's called. You're calling it devil cube. I guess because the icon is a cube, right? Yeah. But Blender's the thing that starts you with a cube, a default cube. By default, though, I did something. <gasps> wow! Thank you! Hi, McBanana! Thank you very much for the sub! Welcome, welcome! I mean, I had already welcomed you in the past, but. Now, welcome to the... Having a silly cheese slice next to your name club. <laughs> I'm glad you're not bad, clunks. Yeah, I did something that might be called heresy among Blender users, which is... I deleted the default cube, and then I made that the default project that opens when you load Blender. So there is no default cube anymore! Cheese. Uh. Um... Good, yeah. Also the... what is it? Didn't it also have like a camera and a light or something? I removed those as well. Now I actually have an empty project when I open the 
the program like any sensible program all right uh, i'm all right thank you clunks sorry i'm fiddling with my hair and my hands can't be tracked at the moment so i look like i'm weirdly moving around all right i'm back um uh yeah i'm all right um i kind of half asleep maybe a quarter asleep now maybe a third asleep let's call it a third i was half asleep before i started streaming and the very first track that played was uh will i have the history if i go back yeah the very first track that played was this which, which, which gave me a lot of energy so then i woke up anyway that one's finished now Um, so my tiredness is gradually increasing. Um, okay. I'm sorry, I know you're of the, the much m more, or oh, the much less selfish, the much more, wait, what's the word? Much more selfless group of people who don't put background music on their streams because people can then put whatever music they want. Uh, a couple of reasons I do it. Um, <laughs> one of them is just selfishness and, I don't know, another one is to do with making it slightly harder to rip my voice, rip my voice, in order for like, you know, training stuff, which is slightly ironic because I've already trained my own voice. <laughs> <laughs> Not from my streams, though. I did dedicated hours of recording for that. So it's very energizing. Oh, right now it's not. When I'm playing a high energy game, it is. It was very weird for, to me for to be hearing the the high energy, happy hardcore playing when um. Yeah, she's still cupping out as wow correctly. I know Noonj. I'll I'll train I'll train her some more. I have actually got like another hour of training data that I need to run through her. Um, just haven't been bothered yet. Unfortunately, it didn't contain the word wow, I think, so. Yeah, it was very funny to me when I heard, well, like, very weird to hear Happy Hardcore when I'm doing blending stuff. It's so associated with hype games like, well, gotta go fast games, like Trackmania and Cyberhook. I haven't played Cyberhook for a while. Did I reach a dead end in that game? I can't remember. Did I, like, reach a skill issues part? I realise I've just been rotating a camera around in Ahage for the past five minutes. I guess I should actually do something record yourself reading the dictionary oh my god <laughs> might take a little while might not be a totally bad idea though what was i trying to do oh yeah right um right i need to apply this pose that's on the ahoga this is a two-stage process first is Okay, okay, <laughs> I gotta actually remember how to do this. Um, where's the. Oh, I'm being silly. There it is. So, firstly, we effectively apply the pose of the bones, basically, say that that's the default resting place. Because right now, when we go to edit mode, clunk, the ahaga falls onto the floor. <laughs> oh my god. So, what I've done today is I've literally thrown all music into one playlist so unfortunately there's going to probably be some sudden changes in music there's no hugger down there it's inside a bone i can't be asked to show you right now maybe i should have excluded some music <laughs> some other guy cooking i hope it'll taste good me i hope it's not poisoned so much I'm sure it'll be alright. I think I'm going to be pressing skip a whole bunch. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to specifically make a playlist of the music that I don't usually have. So I'm going to delete all of that. I'm going to throw on this vocal or for self folder. And I'm going to throw on, I guess, trance? Hard, day, hard dance? Do we want drum and bass? It's probably going to be a bit intense. Happy Hardcore? Yeah, maybe. Uh, this one? Oh, 
What kind of music is in here, actually? One sec. I'm sorry. I'm doing stuff I should have done before I streamed. Started streaming. Ah, my fucking ears! Oh my god, I've got two bits of music playing. Shut up, Fuba, for one sec. Oh, that's that, okay. Uh, and there's unsorted. Slap that on there, I guess. Breaks? What is breaks? The hell, what genre is breaks? I've never heard of this in my life. Also, why is Media Player Classic not loading? There it is. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. Almost done. That sounds nice. Alright, fine, I'll drag you two on as well. This is only a playlist with... Oh, it's a 4 out of 33 playlist. That should be fine. Alright. Alright, it should be okay. Wait, there's a bunch of tracks in here that I did not want in here, I'm realizing. Uh, okay, whatever. Just deal with it, Yuke. I've been looking for a good text-to-speech model, but I can't find any good ones. I've resolved to doing TTS to voice to voice. Ah, using... Uh, what's it? RVC? Retrieval based voice cleaning or something. I mean, that's not a terrible idea. Um, it can. The, the other. Oh, shit, sorry. The, uh, sorry, I was stretching and then I elbowed my mic. <coughs> RVC is annoying? What's wrong with RVC? I'm curious about what you're using if it's not RVC. If you're doing voice to voice. Yeah, the interface does suck. Also, on, on my... only on my computer, seemingly no one else's, I have big stuttering issues. As in, uh... I think it's playing the audio slightly too fast. So every, like, few seconds there's, like, a break, like, a little gap where it has to wait for more audio to come in. Yeah. It's annoying. Tried different sound devices, settings, like... Even trained my own one, even trained one explicitly with a different sample rate. I, I couldn't find any way around it. It's like really, really subtly faster, but I'm assuming that's why there are tiny gaps every now and then. Because it doesn't sound like it's missing any speech, it just sounds like it waits for a tiny amount every now and then, and yet doesn't fall behind. So I'm assuming it's like fractionally too fast. The QI lists of a VC. What have you used then? I'm using something that's already packaged together called Voice Cloning App, which is Tacotron 2. Old Faithful. And then I'm running it through a, um, a Unity mixer channel to make it sound clearly robot-y, otherwise it gets confusing about what's me and what's not me. Um... Hi, I'm the old faithful Tacatron 2. Hi, I'm the old faithful Tacatron 2. Okay, that was pretty terrible pronunciation. Emphasis. This is what I tried before, so I generated the speech using fast pitch. What is fast pitch? I'm imagining I'm going to be, if you're looking for GUI list things, are you using Linux? And then I'm expecting that there's a bunch of things that are Linux only. I was really sad because recently Facebook um, made a... Uh... It sounds nice. Have I ever heard this song before? It sounds nice. Recently, um, Facebook released a multimodal um, neural network that can do uh, like text from any language into speech in any language, or or directly from speech in one language to speech in another language, or text on one language to text on another language, or speech to text. You know, any combination of any language and whichever way around of speech to text, or both or neither. 
Uh, no, it's called... What is it called? Uh... Seamless communication. Um, but unfortunately, it uses a Python library also made by Facebook called FairSec2. And you look at the GitHub page for FairSec2 and it's... Yeah, we have zero plans to support Windows for this. And it doesn't support Windows. Well... Guess, uh, guess Windows users can't can't communicate then. So yeah, kind of sucks. Like if it was written by someone not in Facebook, you know, if they were using a module not FairSec2 made by someone else, then there would be a chance that uh, maybe Facebook will would make their own thing, right, and stop using this thing that doesn't work on Windows. But since FairSec2 was made by Facebook, it's like. Well, they clearly have made their decision and they're sticking with it, right? <laughs> so, yeah. Sucks to suck, I guess. I'll stick with Whisper and um, not do text to speech, I guess. They're using RVC too, which is why it's never going to work properly on Windows. Ah, uh, it works fine. I seems like an audio issue. I doubt that that's FairSec 2's fault. Like, it just seems like a wrong sampling rate issue. I'd be very surprised if that was a FairSec 2 bug. But, but yeah, it works because somebody decided to compile it. Clearly not Facebook. I've, I don't know anything about FairSec 2, by the way, other than the fact that it can't work on Windows. So then I was just like, well, all right, I'm out. <laughs> I'll delete these two virtual environments that I've set up in trying to get this thing to work. It works, but it runs on CPU. Really? Okay. I mean, I couldn't get it to work. It wouldn't install, so... And if a Python library needs me to compile, that's the point where I realize, okay, it's never going to work. <laughs> that's like getting to the 20th page of Google. You, you know it's never going to show up. So I'm playing around with this, because as I'm rotating it, I'm seeing these things that look like eyeballs, and they're like looking around like that. And it's amusing. My, my very stupid cat brain. I actually once got one thing to, one Python module to compile, and I couldn't- I thought I was dreaming. I'd never managed to do it before. But I was actually able to get like the visual... Uh, like the CMake thing for Visual Studio set up and blah blah blah. Correct stuff on the path environment variable and then it actually compiled. Um, never before, never since. Don't even remember what it was. Hello, York, the best VTuber Fox Sisters. Wait, oh, best of. Ah, York of the best VTuber Fox Sisters. Okay, I can accept that. If, if Happy and Cat are Fox Sisters, then I can be a sister of them as well. But I'm not a Fox. I have a confession. <laughs> Don't worry, you're in a safe place. Alright, can I stop fucking rotating the camera around this? I said I was going to try and concentrate and get stuff done. I've done like nothing! I had to try multiple times to get fair sec working. I don't Jeez. blame you at all. Why? Jeez. Oh yeah, right. I'm okay. Uh, half asleep. Apparently not in a mood to be thinking and processing stuff in my head. But I kind of want to get this done, so I kind of have to. <laughs> mm. That that's a cute lucky moon. Chibi doki, ah. Uh. Right. What am I trying to do now exactly? Merge this into the main thing. Oh yeah, right. Apply the pose. Right. <laughs> that's what I was doing. So, uh, we will apply, pose, wait, how do you do it? You've got to be in the pose mode then, I guess. Apply, pose as rest pose. Boop, that's the first half. The bones are now locked in place. Okay, I clearly shouldn't have done it that way around. Let's try it the other way around. Let's first apply the modifier to the mesh. Boop. Okay, nice. 
Now we apply the pose as rest pose. Nice. Seems to be working. So now when I go into edit mode, the ahage should stay on the head. Nice. Wait, what am I editing? Oh, not the mesh. Can we fucking switch, please? There we go. And hopefully, pose mode still will actually affect the, uh, the ahage. Oh, <laughs> gotta reapply the... Okay, that scared me for a second. I've gotta reapply the the modifier on here. Armature, this one... Okay, it should work now. Let's make sure it still works in edit mode. Yep. And pose mode. Hey, there we go. Nice. So now this is in a state where I wouldn't mind combining this into the, the hair. So let's try. Click that, click the hair, control J. No mesh data to join. What? Try again. No mesh data? Shift J? Alt J? J? What do you mean no mesh data to join? Huh? Do I have to do it with the mouse in the right hand area instead of the left hand area? Let's try that. Join. Shift join, alt join, J for join. The hell? I'm gonna join these two things. Is that not how you do it? Am I crazy? Why is it saying no mesh data to, to join? Like, there's a mesh right here. Do I need to, like, manually do it one by one? Oh, I see the problem. This thing here is, uh... A thing that looks like a running person, and I was trying to join it to a thing that looks like a triangle. Let's try it this way around then. But wait, how would I do that? Oh, I need the... Okay, so if I join the meshes together, and then what, do I join the armatures together? Let's try that. So join these two together. Control J. Okay. So now all the hair is this. Nice. Not sure I could launch anything with admin anymore. Hang on. Even reinstalled Windows because of C14 and disk issues. I couldn't figure out because I broke my Windows installation. Oh no! No! no. Cat girl Vichy were you? Thank you, Okami. Thank you for calling me when I am not the best, but at least the cat girl Vichy were passed correct. Uh. Alright. Now for the armature part. There is a pose, but I've applied the pose, so I should probably be able to delete that, but I guess you can't delete poses? Nope. Okay. So we'll just try to merge the head thing onto the armature of this? Question mark? Hmm, I think this was called- I think this will cause problems because the head if the head is named the same as this head and we try to merge them using a CADS plugin then what it's gonna do is use the head position on this armature, isn't it? Which is gonna reintroduce the problem of this string of hair going towards the back of the head because the head bone is near the back of the head, somewhere. Is it this one? It's probably this one. Yeah, it's that one. I think. I, I think it is, anyway. Uh, so what I probably want to do is rename this bone. Let's call it, um, Big Ahage Root. I deleted these bones. Okay, so hopefully, maybe I can now just parent big ahoge root to the head 
of this. Well, these are different. These are different. Do I have to join first? Maybe I'd have to join first and then parent after. Let's try joining first. Join. Nice. Okay, big Ahage roots up there now. So now I should be able to parent. Big Ahage root to the head. Uh, P? Control P for print. Set parent to object or bone. Set parent to bone. Didn't do it. Didn't do jack. Oh, do I have to go in edit mode maybe? Join this to the head. Parent. Keep offset. Did it do it? It didn't! It's inside the head now. Alright. Still looks correct. Yeah. I, I think it's worked. Question is, will it move with the head now? Wait, there's no way this could work, is there? Shit. I forgot a stage. Oh my god, I forgot a step. I forgot to rename the vertex group to big ahage root as well, so isn't it still going to be parented to the head, if at all? Oh my god, thank you, thank you for the pants I told. Um... I don't think it's going to go bald. It's going to probably not move or move weirdly. Wait! It looks like it's moving correctly! Hold on. I don't understand why it's working, but it's working. <laughs> okay, if I move this bone, like actually move it, not rotate it, does it just slide out? Oh, it's not very good. Mmm, it's not doing what I wanted it to do. Um, thank you for the hydration imposter jack! Mm. What's that? Wait, what? Um... 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 What? What? Did the head pad work? Or did it... Huh? Why is the hand stuck? Wait, not there anymore. There it is. What's going on? Why, why is this hand here and it won't go away? <laughs> uh... Oh, fuck. Ah. Oh. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Thank you for fixing it. Um, I can't say I've seen that before. Still there? I don't see it there now. What the fuck? How did that happen? How did that happen? <laughs> what? Man, my streaming setup is uh, has some fun. Uh... Okay, let's try hydrating then. Wait, no, I didn't start hydrating in the middle of that, though. Okay, it, it does mess up at the end. Which I guess is fine, but... Didn't get stuck. The hand controlling Yuki as a puppet. <laughs> Wait, hold on, gotta get the finger working. Hold on, hold on. Rarely get to listen to Hardstyle on stream. Even though there are only four decent hardstyle tracks on Monster Cat that are licensed for use by streams. Alright, undoing all of this, getting it back to the separate Arges. Eventually. Okay, here we are. Armage is back, just getting the mesh back. She says slapping controls at a million times. Oh, come on. Mesh, come back! Mesh! I'm waiting for the mesh to reappear in this list. Jesus! Okay, there it is, finally. 
All right, vertex groups. So I should have renamed this. Wait, maybe when I re wait, when I renamed this, did it automatically rename the vertex group? Let me check. Uh, big I'll get root. Oh, it renamed this. Okay, well then, that's a bit worse because I don't understand. I don't understand why it. I don't understand why it, um, the hair was stuck, you know, because normally when I move the bone in pose mode, like so, I can just slide it out without a weird bit stretching. So, uh... <laughs> Okay, so the armature, vertex groups, big again, this one, this one, this one, these all... I'm gonna rename them. Big... Ahoge... Zero one... Zero two... Zero three... Zero four... Okay, let's merge them together again. Just in case... I, I don't know, maybe in case the bones were still somewhere in here Please. and that's why they were stretching. Oh my god, the... the... Claudio said she is in a similar way to how I was saying. Hi Mocha! Thank you for the pets. But not for the cheese. Oh, hold on. Just before I was streaming I was messing around and I made up a new... effect. You, there's still no redeem for it. Do you want to hear what it sounds like? It's kind of funny. It sounds like this. Yep. <laughs> yeah, it's this. <laughs> I swear the laughter it just sounds hilarious. I fuck self. Right, I'm back. No, not. I've got. <laughs> I misclicked. I tried to turn off. <gasps> Holy yuk! Wait, we've got another hard style track immediately after. Is it even. It is on shuffle! Wow, what are the odds? 1 in 53, actually. Well, more like. 3 in 53? 4 in 53? actually quite high. How many channel points for this? Uh, I don't know exactly. What should it look like? I mean, I guess I could be like wavy, really wavy. Like stupidly wavy. Uh, hmm. What should I? What could it be? I'd like to do one where I just sort of go like all jelly and flipping around, but I'm not sure how to. Wait. I do know how to toggle that. Hold on. It would just be one dynamic bone component. Oh my god, that would use so much CPU though. Because you'd be controlling hundreds of bones. All right, uh, new redeem for wobbly voice effect, uh, one dynamic bone at root. Oh, but that wouldn't, uh, this will require a lot of work because I'm going to have to make a system then that lets it blend in some of the original, some of the motion tracking data and not others. Otherwise I'll just go limp and I won't be able to move. Like, it's all or nothing, you know? Either the tracking overrides all my bone positions, or it, um... It wouldn't, like, uh, it wouldn't do anything. Um, I already have a system to do that. When I have bits thrown at my head, so that my head can get knocked to the side like that, it, um... It actually smooths it slightly. 
the motion so that my head can go like uh, and then gradually come back. But I need a system then similar to well, I actually made, it, made a class in Unity for this called a gatekeeper <laughs> class um, that is currently used. Um, if anything wants the music to be paused, then the music will be paused. Only when everything agrees that it should be unpaused, the music turns back on. So I could make a system like that. Where, you know, if I'm having gems thrown in my head or if the wobbly redeems in use, then it will use smoothing. Otherwise, it'll not. I don't know. It's one of those things that sounds like it should be easy, but uh, I find it difficult. Um, where she's knock the cat. No, don't no, punch the cat. Stop this. The person I read into yesterday, Cat's Return, was um had a flipping redeem where you could shoot her. It's like, why is it? Why are they all so violent? Says the person who made Yeet and Cheese redeems. But yeah, it's so much easier to think of violent redeems for some reason. And so much easier to implement. Like, actually implementing IK for proper head pads is harder. Cheese is better than shoot. Thank you! Th thank you for not, uh. Thank you for not wanting to shoot me, Rocket Tech. I'm suddenly. Very, uh, reassured. Okay. <gasps> Post. <laughs> Timing with the music. Enjoy the goofy redeems. Yeah. I guess the calm ones are not so goofy. All right. Let's try this one more time. Let's merge this into here. Join. Did it do it? Yeah, no, because I've got to be in edit mode. Try again. This. Into this. Join. Did it do it? No. Join while my mouse is on the right hand side of the screen. Nope. Shift J. Shift J. What? Oh my god, why can't I. This? Into this. Join? Did it do it? What the fuck? Transparent Zahog has moved up here now. I'm so confused. I'm so confused. What's actually happened? Wait. It just did what I was trying to do earlier. Interesting. I wasn't trying to do it this time. It just did it by itself. <laughs> okay, whatever. Anyway, if I move my Ahaga now, what happens? In pose mode for this armature. Oh, there, there's big Ahaga. Um, I guess if I keep it unparented, then I, it should be able to move like normal, right? Pose mode. Yes, okay. Now if I parent it to the head, is that when all things go wrong? Wait, edit mode. Back to pose mode. Wait, I don't want to move that. I want to move this. Oh, okay. Wait, it's not parented at all. Hang on. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait a minute. The Ahaga is not moving. I just noticed. Was it like that the whole time? It's got a modifier on as well. Can I see the modifier, please? Oh my god, why do I have to leave this just to be able to see all the modifiers? There you go, Blender Rants are starting. Modifier. Oh, it's an armature, but it's not linked to anything. Okay. Boop, there you go. Let's try it now. Pose mode. This one. Drag. Okay, the Ahage moves! And it doesn't drag this long string from the head anymore. Nice! So theoretically... Shh. Wait, is it parented to the head? Yeah. So hopefully if I move the head... The hugger moves. Yeah. Alright. If I move the root of the hugger... Yes. Any other 
halfway up the Ahaga bone. Oh my god, Blender, please respond. Yeah, alright. I, I, I think it works. I'll keep it like that for now. How many bones do we have? 137. We can have up to 150, right? Bones? Where are my bones? Where are my bones? Bones, 150. Nice. Zuma yay. <laughs> I really stretched one fist. I would be a wobbly you can enjoy it. Alright. <laughs> I mean, I could just make it a much easier to do effect. You know. It's a lot of bones. 150? Yeah, 150 you can have while still having a B-rated good. Which is nice. It's not that many. Well, I, mm, yeah, I guess it's, it's fairly average, I'd say. What I've got now is fairly average, at least for what's coming from um, Vroid. I don't think I have any bones which are not from Vroid in here. I think it's... Oh, wait, no, that's a lie, sorry. These ones, these ones, and the, the tail bones, they're not from Vroid. That one's on. It's probably a bit late, but I guess I should make sure that the, the fox ears and tail move as well, right? They are parented to the armature, so they should. I guess let's just double check, huh? Let's turn everything on make sure it works before I get back to doing what I should be doing. <laughs> or my, I mean, before I get to it. I can't get back to it if I haven't started it yet. Okay. Uh... Tail moans. Hello? Oh, I'm not in pose mode. Boop. Tail bones. Nice! Ears. They still work. Ah, the mask and the visor are not parented to anything yet, are they, actually? Now I think about it. If I tilt this head back, if I do a shaft head tilt... Yeah, the mask and visor are still not weighted to anything. These rollerblades should be just fine still. Yep, nice. The chest was okay, wasn't it? I removed some bones there, but yeah, that's okay. The hands are all right. I removed the fingers inside the gloves. But they seem to be all right. All right, let's, uh, let's wait the vertex, sorry, the visor and the mask to the head so that they move with the head. I forgot that I hadn't done that yet. That's, yeah, I've been neglecting these completely. So we're just throwing them in. Um, Alright, visor. It has no vertex groups, so I cannot wait it to anything yet. I want it to be weighted to the head, which is named J Bip Head. So if I just make a new vertex group for the visor. Let's go into edit mode, select all the verts, add a vertex group, call it G bip head, and assign all these verts to that group. Boop. And it should be as simple as that. Let's see if the visor now moves with the head, shall we? Armature. Pose. Uh. Oops. Huh. Oh, right. I need to. Add an um, armature modifier as well. Armature, move with this armature. There. Let's try it again. Hey! Nice. Do the same for the mask then. Wait. Wait, I kind of want to do the same merging thing in here. Wait, this actually has bones. Oh, just one. That's interesting. But yeah, how, how, 
are you doing in then? I hope your work's not going too badly. I know you said that it's that my stream can keep you entertained when you work. Ooh, look at this mask. Is this scented? Yeah, I think it is actually. Let's look at it from above in orthographic mode. The fuck am I looking at? Oh, I guess, okay. <laughs> I can't see past the hair in orthographic mode. Let me turn off the hair. And the flipping... It's not centered, is it? Interesting. Huh. Oh, embarrassing. Is it clipping through the head at similar positions on each side? Oops. No, it's not. <laughs> Look here. It clips before the hair there. Post. And inside the hair here. Hi, Chris! Hi! Your stream is coming to listen to while running tests. Nice! I'm glad, I'm glad. Slow testing. Well, hopefully it's not too stressful. Right, um... Wait, this makes less sense. Look, the mask when viewed from this angle is a little bit to the right. Know, right? The nose is here, the mask is here. You see that? Yet, when we look from this side... What? No, wait. I think that makes sense. No, I think that makes sense. I think that makes sense. Okay, let's try to move the mask. Which should be very easy right now, because it's not... Uh, it's its own object. It's not... weighted to anything. Well, it's pretty weighted to its own bones, but... We can do away with that. <laughs> Thank you, Asenta. And for the pads. Oh god. No, I dropped my neon juice. Now it's gonna not be very fizzy anymore. Well, wait. I can already squeeze the bottle that much. So. It's barely fizzy to begin with. Nearly empty though, so. To be expected, I guess. And do the hydration as well. <coughs> oh my god. Sorry. All right, so this is an ortho view from above. Let's just drag this mask. Oh, there's the origin line as well, that's useful. So if I do this. Oh, look how centered that nose is on the origin line. We've got this black origin line down here. Center vertex there. Perfect. When I'm zoomed in this far, it makes it look so bad <laughs> for the mask. All right, let's move this mask. G for groove. I want to groove the mask to the side a bit, so I'll groove it. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think I'll do. Okay, now does it look more equal on both sides? Let's have a look. Okay, so it's ending right there, right as the hair begins. Let's flip to the other side. Okay, nice! It's the same on the other side as well now. Hell yeah! Right, I'm happy with that. So let's make the mask part of the main object as well. <coughs> let's try to join this... Uh, person icon into this person. Like, wait, before I do that. Let me check what the what bone says. Head and head end and surgical mask is there. I kind of don't want any bones for the mask. Or I guess if I want to hide the mask, I could... I could give it one bone just to show and hide the mask. That can be scaled down and up. It's an efficient way to hide it without needing a blend shape. Yeah, let's do it that way. Yeah. That is the way we'll do it. 
And um, it had occurred to me that the blend chips, the shape keys for this mask, which you can't really easily see, but essentially on the inside of this mask, there are many layers. Do you see those there? All these little layers. They almost look like layers of a filter or something that you'd breathe through. But actually, all these layers here are for different faces to be shown on the mask. This is how a cat's, cat, cat can um, show different expressions on her mask. And each one of these blend shapes moves one of these forwards. Like that one, for example. This one moves that one forwards. This one moves the next one. The next one. This is all of them, right? That one and that one, yes. Um, but it's quite a lot of uh, texture space for this. So I think I'm just going to do the smile. But it wouldn't cost any texture space to have the smile toggleable. So we could have it be no mask or blank mask or cat face mask. Uh, was it that she wanted it to be... Hold on, let's see. Was it that she wanted it to be uh, blushy and mask? Yes, blushy and mask. Okay, in that case we can merge the blush and the three mouth into the same blend shape. Because right now the blush and the three are separately toggleable. I could just keep them separately toggleable. It's not really a big deal, is it? Yeah. Yeah, sure, let's do that. We'll have the blush and we'll have the three mouth. Let me just check that the texture that I ended up making, well, Cat and I ended up making. Has the three mouth in the same position as the original. So the mask originally has the three mouth like this. So the three is in this position. Cat drew a much nicer blush in my opinion. Wait, she probably redrew the three as well then, but did she draw it in the same position? That's the question. Oh my god, middle click X is fast in. Whereas it pans in... <laughs> it pans in Unity and it rotates in Blender. Okay, let me find her texture if I just make a copy of that. Let's look inside here. Assets. Extras. This one. The mask. Oh, it won't be here, will it? It'll be in... Wait, let me look in this one. Because I've made this one safe. Assets. This one, I think. Hopefully I'm not about to flash an NSFW texture on the screen. No, I'm not. Okay, the mask texture looks like this. Okay, so she drew the mouth in the same place. And the blush. In that case, it's fine. We can just lose these ones. Because otherwise, if she had drawn the mouth in a different place, like in the place of one of these different uh, designs, then I would have to delete a different one of these and just rename it, I guess. But no. Alright, we remove tongue out. I, wait, let me see which one mouth the three mouth moves. The three mouth moves. I'm, I'm being really silly. Let me turn off the rest of it. This is so hard to see. Move this and that. There we are. And the visor. Get out of here. Oh my god. Flipping out. That's easier to see, isn't it? Okay, so the blush moves. This. 
teeth are what we don't need. So that's this. Well, it'll be the one that's at the front, won't it? Now. Yeah. So this one. Let's go into edit mode. We're going to move this surgical mask. Edit mode. Uh, okay. So we'll remove that, all of these faces. Faces. Boop. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, is it showing that because that's what it was outside? Yes, it is. Let me just click on basis before I do any of this, though. Not having basis selected when I'm editing has bitten me so many times you cannot believe it. I just delete all of these, but boop. So now teeth isn't going to do anything. Frown. Why is frown doing nothing? Wait, what? Blush still works. Three mouth still works. Frown. There it is. Why did that do nothing? When I was in edit mode. There it is. Weird. Select the frown. Goodbye. We've also got the X mouth. Wait, why do I have to be clicking it before it takes effect? Am I crazy? It works now. Okay, I don't really get it. Anyway, I'm deleting it. Bye! And the tongue out. So look, the tongue out doesn't come out as I'm turning it up zero to one. Do you see that? That's weird. And yet when I click on it, now it comes out. And now it's fixed. Now if I click off it, it works like normal. Is that a blender bug? No, there wouldn't be a bug in blender. Sorry, that's too much sarcasm. So hopefully we only have one thing left. I guess so. We've got the blush. There it is. The teeth. It does nothing now. So I can remove that. The frown. It does nothing now. So I can remove that. The X does nothing. I guess I should double check with the three mouth. Yep, that still works. And the tongue out. It does nothing. Nice. So just the basis, the blush, and the three mouth. Nice. It almost looks like someone talking when this happens. It's like blah, 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 blah. Maybe it's hard to see on the stream, but this is like morphing as I speak. <laughs> and that's what someone sounds like when they have a mask on, apparently. According to me. Uh uh. Okay, let's merge the mask into the um well just merge this the entire this thing. The the person thing into wait no let me remove the bones first. If I remove the bones, is it gonna like jump to a weird position, I wonder? Let's put the face on so we can easily tell. Yes. Oh, I guess I need to apply the pose first. Calm down, music. Okay, let's apply it in its current position. Boop. What if I cannot be applied to a mesh with shape keys? What the fuck? So I just have to delete it? Okay, well, deleting it didn't mess it up. <laughs> Wait, then, then why did it disappear when I deleted the bones? What the hell? Hang on a sec, is it deleting the entire goddamn thing? Do I have to like, go into edit mode? And delete these individually? Wait. 
Wait, what is what is going on here? I'm trying to edit this armature. So hopefully I can delete this bone. Nothing bad happened. This bone. Nothing bad happened. This entire armature, please? Hmm. How does one just delete the goddamn armature without the whole thing disappearing? Like, why is there even an armature? What is this? Unlink? Undocumented operator. Unlink. <laughs> Well, let's see what it does, shall we? Not yet implemented. What a great program Blender is. Uh, wonder if they've implemented that in version 3.5 yet. Mm. How do I get rid of the goddamn armature? Does it have to have an armature? Okay, whatever. Let's remove... Stop! Jeez. No, don't remove the cheese. Let me remove this vertex group. <coughs> I'll, I'll take the pads, Natalie. Let's just try to join these meshes then. We'll join this mask mesh to the... Wait, no, I don't want to join the meshes yet. I, mean, I guess I could. Fine, let's join the mask mesh. Let's join the mask mesh to the... Uh, let's join the mask mesh to the... Um, actually, you know what? I will keep the... I'll keep one of those bones. The bone is going to be the one that... Can turn on and off the mask. I forgot I was going to do that. Okay, we'll keep the head bone. I'll name it differently though. Let's call it... Mask... Yeah, just mask. Keep it simple. Uh, let's call this mask. What? Let's call this mask. Uh, I assume it's weighted correctly. If I go into pose mode, can I pose the mask position then? No. Oh, right, because I deleted the modified in there. Hold on. Let's see if it works. Armature. Boop. Nice. The whole thing moves, right? Yeah, nice. Okay, um, I'll just make this bone smaller because it's obnoxiously huge right now. How does one do that? <laughs> I forget. Might as well even move it closer to the mask. It's going to disappear in this direction when it's scaled down to be hidden as well, so... We're messing around... Sorry, we're messing with spectral wavetable creation. That sounds cool. I don't know... How can it be spectral if it's a wavetable? Aren't they like two different things? Managed to create a really nasty sounding rhythm layer. Probably the best preset I've ever created. That sounds cool. Wavetables are so cool. I've never actually played with one. I've seen people playing with one. With them. I've never actually used one, you know, where you can like morph the wave. I kind of want to like try coding something like that maybe. It sounds fun and easy to implement. In code. Also, welcome, Donkey Pounder. Nice to see you here again. Pat Pat. Hope you're having fun. Oh my god, that panting cat is so cute! I am stupefied. Creating a bunch while watching. Oh my god, I hope my music was not too distracting for you. I hope it's quiet enough. It's down at minus 22 decibels. Uh, 
All right. Mind you, I'm usually not reaching zero decibels unless I do something like this. Actually, even then, I think I only reached about minus two decibels. It tends to be like really short, sharp sounds that make me suddenly hit zero decibels because the compressor can't react in time. Well, that didn't quite reach it. What if I clap? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> that peaked it. Clap is faster than pop. You learnt it here first. <laughs> the blah emote. How's the un doing? Uns, uns do, uns. How's uns doing? No, that's annoying to say. Stoop. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm trying to think of ways to shorten it. Oh god, it's a hype! Hype song's beginning. Right, modifier is on. Let's go to pose mode. See if this works as I would expect it to. Yep, 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 yep. Very nice. Let me just make sure that scaling is also being applied. What's going on? Why can't I get out of edit mode, please? I pressed tab, it didn't work apparently. Bone envelopes. So hopefully now. Oh my god, this is <laughs> really loud, actually. Yeah. So hopefully, uh... If I scale the bone itself down now... The whole mask will scale down. Wait, what? Why is the... <laughs> what is this? Wait, is this the entire thing? Oh, it's the entire thing. Why is the entire thing 0 0.067? Scale! Why is it also rotated by 0 0.00009 degrees as well? Okay, pose mode. The bone. I want to adjust the bone. The bone size. Which thankfully is set to 1. So hopefully if I scale the bone size down, the whole mask will scale down neatly into the middle. Yeah. That, that works for hiding the mask. So I'll make an animation to do that in, uni in Unity, eventually. Wait, I just realized you have ears, Cat. They're like really flattened ears, but they're still ears. Is that just normals making them look... Like this? Hmm. I think I can. I think I can fix your ears a bit more, can. Well, one thing at a time. Now let's apply the this all transforms. Apply transforms. Boop. Thank God it didn't mess this up. If I go in pose mode, does this still work? It does. Nice. Does this still work? It does. Nice. All right. Let's see if I can do this then. Merge the this thing into this thing. Guess I've got to turn it on first. Join! Did it do it? I don't see it down there anymore. Okay, it is in there now. Nice. Surgical mask is here. Modifier is now probably broken, so let's point it to this. And we'll parent the mask to the head. Didn't work. Gotta be in edit mode, apparently. Keep forgetting. Mask. Head. Parent. Alright. Should be it. So we should be able to move the mask now. Well, we should be able to move the head. And we should be able to move the mask, in fact. What the? Oh, I made it edit mode. Okay, so I'm turning the whole head and the mask moves as well, very nice! If I just want to turn the mask by itself, which I won't do, I'll just be doing this instead. Oh god! This, sorry. 
Wow, this is an Angie song, isn't it? Okay. Now we only need to combine the visor. Actually, I think the visor is... No, the visor is outside this. Interesting. Um... Hmm. I guess... I guess I could... Oh, I just, I just remembered how hard this goes. <laughs> oh my god, I can't even track my head. I'm, I was shaking it so much. All right, fine. This is like actually supposed to be doing stuff music. <laughs> All right, let's merge the visor into the armature. Here we go. Boop. Ready? Join. Didn't work. Join. Didn't work. Uh, oh, I'm in. No, oh, yeah, I'm in the Craig mode. Why can't I join this? Oh, is it parent? Is it parenting that I need to do? Parent object. Yeah, it's parent. Hi, Kinomi. How are you kidding? All right, visor is inside that now, which is nice. Can't say the same. Can't say hi. No worries. No worries. No worries. No worries. Welcome. To the intense place! Okay, sorry, I'm gonna stop doing that now. I was, I was trying to move my head around as well. It, just, it doesn't work if it doesn't track! God damn it! Um, wait. Hi, it won't even. My face tracking is not even working. Okay, right, we gotta hold the hype. Face tracking failing is not a hype thing, Jeez. so let me fix that. One sec, 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 one sec! <gasps> Okay, it's working again. <laughs> Resume that. Okay, um, thank you for the hydration as well. And the posture check. Oh my goodness! Holy oh, no, my lid! I dropped the lid. There we go. <clears throat> posture check as well. There we go. Okay. Time for the pats. How is the blending? Slow, but um, it is making progress. I still haven't even got to the part that I really wanted to get done today. Like, I'm going to have to get done today, but anyway. More importantly than that is to move this to this screen so I can look at you. While I pat you. Pat, pat, pat. There you go. Pats for the kid. And thank you for the pets as well. Why am I so big? No, no. no problem. Hope they give you the strength to do whatever it is you need to do. Well, <laughs> I'm off. So I just wanted to pop back up as soon as the hype music started. But that was a lot of things I needed to do at once. I think I failed. Bye bye, bye bye. I don't know why I got muted, but I did. Bye. Take care, take care. God damn it, there's an ad happening. Oh no, it's in 14 minutes. Wait, why is it giving me snooze options now? Is this a new thing? I thought they did this at one point and then they took it away. And now they're back again. Okay, nice. For a moment I thought that ads, an ad had come in and it was interrupting me saying, Bye bye, take care. But yeah. Bye. And take care. <laughs> nice to see you. Okay. <laughs> Wait, why does this look so funny? Wait, I can't really do that, can I? Oh, it's spoiling the illusion! Okay, let's make a bone for the visor, so that we can turn that off as well, should we want to. Chonky one, <laughs> little arms, I know, they're like, they're like Fix-It Fred's T-Rex mode, redeem. Nice. <gasps> Why? No Alright, I gotta add a new bone, I should've done this beforehand, but whatever. Let's make a bone in edit mode. 
I should really have saved that as a new file, but whatever, I'll do it now, I guess. 009, um, I like the way it says, textures moved inside Blender, because I mistyped Blender. Let me just recover this Blender file from the backup. When was the previous one saved? Oh! <laughs> Never mind, I'd already saved everyone, I shouldn't have. Can't get it back from the backup. Oh well, I'll bring a new one anyway. Boop! And this is gonna be called... Um, merging... Objects. Not meshes yet. Blender. Yeah, it's more like... It's more like... Oh, I can't easily do it. Blend and then... Regional indicator R. The blender. Alright, let's add a bone to the head bone. Add single bone. Actually, I really don't need it to be connected. Well, I don't want it to be connected, in fact. Where is it? <laughs> okay. I assumed it was going to add it, you know. Why there? Oh, the cursor's there. Why there was a cursor there? Interesting. Fine, I will extrude from the head. Fine, I'll do it. E. E for extrude. And we'll move it in the... This direction, I guess. No, that's going to be confusing. Actually, I'll have it go straight up. Then I'll just detach it. Kind of. Oh, the head wasn't straight up. I didn't realize that. Okay, now I should be able to just click the bone, drag it. Whee! No, not like that. I don't want it to be... That's annoying. I want to be able to move the bone off this. What the hell? Why is it dragging that bone around? I don't remember that happening normally. Kind of like unparenting? U for unparent, P for parent. Separate bones. Okay. Thank you for the pads, Dina. How are you, How are you doing, Dina? I, I can't click the bone. There it is, I guess. No, that's that one. Why can I not click the goddamn bone? What, what, what's so special about this bone? I can't click it. Huh? <laughs> Where is it even? Where is that bone? Is it like a fake ghost bone? Is it not really there anymore? I, I can't do anything with it. Is that bone like not really there? Let me come out of edit mode. I'm back into edit mode. Is it fixed now? No. The fuck is this bone? This is weird, isn't it? Probably its own object. Oh my god. Ah! It is. Okay, can I join it back together now? I'll name it something else. Like that. Reg. <laughs> Fine. Speaking of which, I was watching Made in Abyss recently. Anyway, let's merge that into... Uh, into this. Got to be out of edit mode. Do everything again. Are they joined now? Yes. Here's Reg. Let's move him into head. Or parent. We've got to be in edit mode for this. So let's go to edit mode. Do it all again. Click there. Click there. Parent. No, no. Pe 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 pe. Yes. Not connected. Just keep the offset. Now I should be able to move it. Eee, there we go. I want it separate. I'll move it forward a bunch. Or a bit at least. Because this is what the vise is going to collapse into. Right after I've parented, or weighted the visor to that bone. Let's do it. Visor Vertex Groups. I'm gonna name this... Oh, I should probably rename Reg, shouldn't I? <laughs> Reg! Just sitting down there, not even typed. Uh, not even capitalized. Let's call this Visor... Visor. Here we are. Let's, um... Make a... 
burn. No, uh, vertex creep. Let's name the vertex creep. Vise. No, the vertex creep. Visor. Um, I guess that'll already work. Wait, pen. I mean, for the visor. Visor? Yeah, it's all fully weighted to the visor group. So hopefully now it'll just move around with the visor bone. When do I have selected? The visor one, okay. Oh my god, what the f what? What is that? The fuck was that? What was that? It's not happening now. Was it just yet another blender bug? What was that, man? Did I forget to like apply transforms or something? <laughs> uh Nope, all well, the transforms are 1.0 or 0, 0.0. That's weird. Never seen that one before. Hmm. Um, visor. Oh my god, I didn't realize I could like middle click on here and pan it around like that. That's actually kind of neat. Okay, that's actually really nice for scrolling across so far. Oh my god, look at all this. <gasps> oh, how far can I scroll? Oh, I'm going to regret this because I'm going to have to scroll back in a minute. All right, let's try scrolling back. Oh, that was easy. What the hell? Do, do I scroll like extra fast when I'm going this way or something? Hmm. Or is it looping somehow when I'm scrolling it this way? All right, visor, let's make sure I move from the head as well, just as a sanity check. Head. Whee! It do, it do. Let's say the visor should also pay attention to the... Moon envelopes, and then hopefully... I go to pose mode and shrink the... Actually, do I even need to shrink it? Or do I even need to go into pose mode? Yeah, I do. Don't get the options I need unless I'm in pose mode. Nice! So if I want this to be hidden, it goes... Zoop, zoop, zoop. Oh, we can actually do a neat effect, actually. Actually, actually. We could have it go like... And then like, I don't know, rotate up like that or something. <laughs> That'd be kind of interesting. Into her hair and then it comes down. Huh. Should I position the bone in a way that allows that to work? That'd be pretty cool. I feel like I'm, mm, I feel like I'm worrying about that too much. Hmm, what if I position this bone at the back? Like back there. Which funnily enough is right around where the head bone ends. It's gonna be up like this somewhere up here, isn't it? Okay, so now in pose mode. Yeah, it is doing what I thought it, what I was trying to make it do, but it's a bit. I mean, I guess I could just edit the position of the bone to come out a little bit as well, like that. Thank you for the pats, nuts. Why? Yes. Right, screw it. I'll put the bone back down to match with the, uh, like the end here. Let's put this, oops, nope, let's go to edit mode. 
Wait, why is it down there? What? Oh, because it pivots around the bottom. Oh, that's annoying, isn't it? Okay, I'll just drag it upwards. How's that? Somewhere around there? Pose mode? Hold on. Out of pose mode, into object mode. Turn off transparency, out of object, into pose mode. Okay. Yeah, that looks really well positioned, actually. Alright, so I'll just animate rotation along with position. Out. If I can be asked. If I have time. I mean, I, I want to do it. But I don't have a lot of time. Just clipping into the head slightly as well. Got Visited the creative channel. I decided to play with the octaves, and the results did not disappoint. Okay, let me have a listen. I want to hear this. It's probably going to be really loud for a split second. Um, I apologize in advance. Oh no, it's alright. I caught it. Alright. Damn. Holy shit! That's brutal! <laughs> wow! Oh my god, that sounds really fm -y. Sounds like really fm -y. F -M -E. Damn! That's brutal. <laughs> that's, that's really cool though. Man, this makes me want to play around with wavetables even more. Oh, it is FM. Okay. Or is some FM in. My FM sensors were tingling once you went up an octave. <laughs> um. Wait, what is that? So, so many cute emotes I'm seeing. I have to look at them all. I love that looping bop one. Okay, um, what is it I need to do now? Oh yeah, I was going to see if I could smooth these ears slightly. Face. Let's go to edit mode. Oh my god, that's a lot of vertices for a whole lot of nothing now. I guess it is normals then that I'm making it look weirdly smooth. So let's clear the normals, I guess. Hold on. Oh, interesting. It's not linked to the rest. That's very useful. So let's do that, 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 and that. Let's see what happens when I clear normals. You're seeing like little bits of shading in there. I think it's just normals doing that. But I might be wrong. Let's see. Uh, how do you do that again? Vertex? No, where is it? Alt N was it? Yeah. Here we are. Reset vectors. Okay, no, it was not just. Okay, the, the normals are making the edges look curved like that. But the middle parts are not the vectors. Smooth vectors? Okay, that is actually reducing that. Alright, what I'm gonna do first is remove all of the highly excessive vertices that are on the face. Wait, will I regret doing this? No, I won't because the rest of the face is already going to be merged. Oh, it's already going to have additional things merged, like the mask, into the face. So it's already a non-standard viewed face. Where my mind was going just now is perhaps I should, uh, you know, um, leave the face mesh standard so that if someone wants to run a um well cat 
if Kat wants to run this thing that adds iPhone or um, what's it called again? The Vive face tracker blend shapes for like a better mouse tracking, then it would work. Because I know there are things to automatically add those to VWeb models, but this is already going to be a non-standard mesh, so you know, it's already probably not going to work. But hey, it's an optimized thing of making it non-standard is almost like a required part of optimizing. Okay, so was it a, was it called selective remove or something? Not selective. Uh, adjustable remove. Was it called something? Delete. Limited, limited, limited dissolve. Nice. Glad I could find that. Holy crap. How many did that remove? How many is it removing? Is it removing any? Okay, so originally there are seven, seven, five, four triangles. If we increase this, seven, zero, four, four. It's not really saving much, is it? Six, eight, five, four. We're chopping off the end of the ear there. Oh, look at that. They're not even joined anymore. Okay, you know what? I'm going to join these together before we start deleting them. Let's join this to this. So we'll merge by distance. Okay, 21 vertices. Does that sound about right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I lost count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Okay, precisely perfect. This is just the ones I want being merged there then. This and this, we can merge those ones together as well. Now we just have the one thing here. So we can do the limited dissolve on that. Maybe it'll work even better now that it's one big thing. Not really. 7,700 goes down to 7,400. What about decimate? Sheesh, look at it go. It's removing things from the inside, isn't it? Not the outside. Until the very end. Thank you for the pants. Yeah, this is not removing anything from the inside. Or from the outside, sorry. The out this outer line of things. Even at that amount being removed. Point one. Whoops. One second, Asento. Thank you for the pets and the hydration and everything. I will do it in a sec. Yeah, I reckon we can take that all the way down to point one. It's like it's it's just a part of a head at this point. Point one. I reckon that's fine, but we don't really need to, so I'll make it like point two five or something. Why how much? Point one two five, so it's an eighth. Double checking that the edge, the outline is not changing. Looks like it's not changing. Well, there it is changing actually. Uh, it is changing right on the very edge because these are not merged together. See a little gap there? Guess I should merge these together then. I kind of don't want to, though. Um, right, hydration and post check. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Writing ideas as much as you love drawing them. That's cool. Like, ideas of things to draw? Why don't I select just these, oops, uh, these faces as well? And then do dissolve or decimate. Oh! Is it still leaving gaps? 
Yeah, it's doing some weird stuff around the edge. Oh no, that's not, that's actually a face, that's alright. I mean, it's still a bit weird that it chose to split there, but... I just, I just kind of didn't, I kind of hoped that I'd be able to just, like, shrink this stuff in here, you know? Maybe I'll, maybe I'll select it like this. Let's just select all of the parts that... Okay, now, this is such... I, I'm so thankful to Stewie for teaching me this way of selecting things. It's very cool and time savvy. So, all right, that's all of those selected. Wait, there is something weird going on there. Why are the things like clipping through each other? What's going on there? So, can I like select everything that's inside that? Probably not, right? Well, maybe I can use this... Wait, where was the tool? This? Yeah, that works. Sounds nice. Um, writing about things you're gonna draw. That's cool. I have a bunch of ideas written down, but not the uh, artistic skill to draw them. Not now. Not yet, anyway. <coughs> All right, let's try doing this. Uh, this I made now. Okay, that's kind of nice. That reduces it from 7.7 7 to 7.3. And let's compare that to Limited Dissolve, which I can now unleash on this. 7.3 as well. <laughs> it's just completely flat there. Maybe I don't want that. probably should use limited dissolve because you can limit that based on the angle whereas decimate is just like you know caring less about the contents this is almost like content aware decimate <laughs> okay then obviously that will be triangulated again wait would this be more effective if I triangulated uh or converted to quads first, so oh, they already are kind of quads, aren't they? I'll have to draw out some of your ideas. Uh, <laughs> my ideas are not Twitch safe. Um, Sorry. Um, okay, so all those now. Let's try to smooth, I guess. I kind what I kinda of wanna do is join these together. So if I select these and then merge by distance. Is selected as well. Merge by distance. Okay, that has bridged these together now. So hopefully, if I move one of these faces like this, well, vertices. Okay, yeah, nice. That that does affect both. So now, if I select, okay, this is all linked now, isn't it? Yeah. So if I select. I like this song, why is this not in my usual playlist? Let me add it to my usual playlist so it totally gets ruined by being overplayed. That's a good idea. 
Okay, can I recalculate these normals, I wonder, just so they're a bit smoother? Um, recalculate outside, question mark? I not done anything. Smooth? Vectors? A lot? Ooh, that's actually having an effect on the cheek there. In a good way. Look at that. We don't have this weird edge to the face anymore. That's before, after, before, after, before, after, before, after, before. Oh, that looks better though. And after. Why do you look that bad? Mm, I think that's better. Let's turn this off. Yeah, let's compare before and after without this one. Before. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's not good. That's before. That's after. Okay, it's a lot better after. There's still some problem that arises here, but this is so far back that it's going to be covered by hair, so... Before, after. Can I just repeat the smoothing a whole bunch of times? Still a bit of a sudden transition there, isn't it? I don't think the skull does that really, does it? Before smoothing... Looks more like that. After smoothing... Looks more like that. Is there a sweet spot in the middle? No, it definitely looks better at the end. Well, it's not perfect, but it's better. Compare this to that. This sharp edge down there. Yeah, it's definitely better. Let me triangulate it as well, so I can actually see what the hell's actually, you know, going on behind the scenes. Triangulate faces. Okay, fair enough. So that's what it was doing with the normals, is it? Smooth! It's the same, isn't it? Maybe it's not. Maybe it's better since I triangulated it, actually. Is it? So this is the original amount of smoothing there, and then I triangulated it, and now this is the smoothing after triangulating it. I'm realizing this is really hard to see on the stream. I think it's better after triangulating it. Quite a mesh. Yeah, it, it certainly is one of the meshes of all times. Okay, so what did I want to do again? Select everything except for the thingy and then limited dissolve, wasn't it? So to do that, I used this tool and we clicked like here and we started doing this. This way of selecting things is so neat! It's a bit like quick select on Photoshop, except it actually works better. Jeez. What? Jeez. Why Omni? <laughs> actually, why? Gaseraki. Omni. Chill. Chill. Okay, they're all selected now. We'll select the middle parts. I can't even see what I'm doing now. Jesus. I, I can't... Okay, I can see now. We'll add all of these. My neck is hurting from bending my... Well, neck so much. 
Okay. Let's all of those. And then let's do the limited dissolve. Boop. So before, after 7.3k down to 6.9k roughly. Um, and then I join these together. Based on distance. And then finally, we smoothed these. Well, actually, I triangulated the before. So let's triangulate it. And then we'll smooth. And because that covers some of the vertices that were on the side of the face, not the ear. Like these vertices are right on the edge. I guess that's why. The smoothness extended to affecting the edge of the face as well. So that we have to get rid of some of this sharp edge. Let's try it. Smooth normals vectors. Look at that magic at work. Why does it look so much better here than here? Fine, let's try smoothing it before triangulating, I guess. Undo the triangulation, there we go. Why do I try to do it a different way when it worked well when I did it the first way? <laughs> Why do I be stupid like that? Just stick with what you know works, you jeez. Triangulate. <laughs> okay, that's actually really good. <laughs> Triangulant Made serum crash. No! I'm gonna be using so many more bites of memory. Oh, because I've hit 255. Oh no. Now we've got to go to 16 bits. Oh no. I can no longer sound like this. Um. Alright, smooth. Was I actually smoothing this as well? I guess so. Um, and now we'll triangulate. And do more smoothing, because that's what I did before, and I liked how it looks before, so I'm just gonna do what I did before. Hope that the magic works again. What does it look like? Not the same. Hmm. That looks like shit. I do not know as much about human relationships as I thought. Same. Wait, what if I just select? Wait. Why can't I? Oh. This and this looks so similar to me, these two icons. I had the wrong one selected. <laughs> oh, it's true. Okay, it's, it's not helping even if I include some of the faces outside that range. Oh, is it because I... Maybe because I didn't to this. Nah, it's the same. It's the same, goddamn. Wait! Did I even join this ear to the cheek? I did, okay. <laughs> Calm down, Nick. It was fine. Alright, anyway, that's, that's, that's how it's gonna be. <laughs> Why does it look so weird? That looks so bad. 
Isn't that worse than before? Isn't that worse than before? Let me undo a whole load. Okay, no, it's definitely not worse than <laughs> Okay, that's how it was originally. Oh my god, okay, it's a lot better than that. So that's how it was originally. And so it is now. Wait, it used to be lighter. Oh, no, it didn't. Okay, whatever. That's how it looks now. Done! <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> but... Oh! This... That, a wrap around to zero white cheeses. Yeah, that's what we could do as well. I really like this song. I'm gonna crank it slightly. There you go, that's it. Surprisingly lewd. Um, okay, so the visor, let's turn it off for now before I get banned on Twitch. Let's rename this to Mask. <laughs> Fussy.fbx, <laughs> yeah. All right, finally, let's get on to the, the fun part of... Uh, let's try to make the roller skates not so terrible, shall we? Blend, please, you're trying to get me. Band. Okay. I guess I need to turn off the bones. So look at this weeny... Uh, not good UV map. Please don't make things like this. Please don't put loads of tiny little details like this so that then when you shrink the texture down, the red is going to bleed into the black. Please don't make identical islands, uh, you know, for that are like at different positions on the texture when you could just reuse the same island. All of this is just white. You could literally com select. Well, let me show you what I'm going to do actually. Here in a second. Gotta be on this one. Hold the rage for just a moment. Wait, there it is. I'm just gonna past it. All of this. Yes. This. Oh my god. Let's do it my face. Stop. This. And this. And, well, all of this. Okay, there actually is a bunch of stuff that's. To be fair, there is a bunch of stuff that's using this white area. I thought it was only one thing. Um, but it could be more. Because that wants to be white. All of this wants to be white. I guess that since they are doing a bunch of things on at it on on the same section at once, I feel less bad about them doing this. Because I guess you might want to customize just single parts. But um But but we don't <laughs> So uh we will just take all of this, yes, all of this. Yes, it has a very handmade feel to it. We'll take these and these, all of these. Yes, you too. Look at this though, look at this! Why would you have black feeding into red there? What is this? Um, okay. I'm nearly done, nearly done, I can stop ranting soon. Just kidding, I'm still using Blender! They either interact uniquely to allow for more specific edits, or they just didn't know about certain things. Yeah. So this is not quite the same colour, is it? Hold on a second. Ah, okay, this is grey and this is white. These are actually slightly different. Hold on. 
Let me just remove this. So these are white. All of these, I think. Wait. Oh, all right, one sec. Paint time! This is... 237, 236, 234. This is... 237, 236, 234. This is... 237, 236, 234. And this is... 245, 245, 245. Okay, so all of this is white. And the rest of this is grey. Um... Thank you for the buzzer check and hydration. <coughs> as well as Pat's. Sorry about the gremlin sound though. This is grey as well. Thank you as well, Cabbage. Maybe we should add this to my karaoke set, actually. I really like this song. Like, I can go away. So all of these are white and all of these are grey. I'm gonna do something better than just move some of these. Well, uh, eventually maybe. Depends how much time I have. Okay, so all of these are white. I'm going to shrink these down to a very, very small size, but not zero. So if I want, I can restore them as much as floating point precision allows. Let's make this 0 0.1. I'll make it even smaller than that. 0 0.01. So these are all the white things. Uh, certainly used to better in some ways after using MDX. Uh, sorry, 3DS Max for several years. Fair enough. Seeing how some items are laid on top of each other, I'm leaning towards the latter. Oh, how they're laid on top. Yeah, 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 yeah. They're not like rotated, so they're like lined up exactly. Yeah. I don't know. Let's use this tool. This is maybe easier to select a bunch. Wow, that's a lot faster than me drawing a million boxes, isn't it? Let's take that. take all of this as well. Wouldn't it be really cool if there was a blender function where you could just like, a bit like a magic wand selection, but you click on the color of the texture and it selects all of the vertices or faces or whatever within that region. Or the color spanning the whole image if you like turn off contiguous. But I know Blender is, I don't understand it. I know Blender is scared of Treating colors, uh, treating uh, colors of pixels and vertices and stuff in the same thing. Look at this mess! Ah, like a hay bale or something. Okay, uh, let's add this. I feel kind of bad because this is actually someone's work and I could never, ever, ever model something like this. Well, I could do the wheels. I could do all of the like mechanical looking parts. Okay, let's scale this down to 0 0.01. Put this in this section. I have a UV editing add-on or two now anyways. Ooh, that sounds nice. Me, me, I can model something like this. Nice! Oh my god, I feel bad being like this silly... unskilled person. Oh, this is so, so, so lucky. Look at this, look at this. Let me turn this off. Wait, why is there like a red line there instead of black? One sec, what's going on here? The fact that they split these here along this line is so, so nice for me now. Because uh, I can just move all of these into like the steep crimson colored zone. And all of these almost white things into another one. Look at that. Oh, I'm so glad they did that. Oh, look, it's all the way along as well. Ah! Oh, thank God for that. Otherwise, I would have needed to like do some slicing of the of the of the shapes, I guess. Or um, heaven forbid, preserve the entire huge texture, which I really was not ready to do. This, on the other hand, is a little bit worse, but you know, for what I'm needing. But I found 
Junjun, how are you doing? Um, I hydrated, right? And I stretched. I think I did the things right, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. There you go, I'll do it for you. I'm sorry, it's a tier 3 emote. There you go. I Because I don't have enough slots. <laughs> I would rather have them all usable by followers and not even subscribers. But I've used up all my follow slots, I've used up all my tier 1 slots. Okay, and I still have ideas for more emotes <laughs> that I'd like to commission. But, yeah. Don't have any use for them. Well, I guess Discord would be a use. Okay, so let's select these faces. Can I use the control click thing to automatically? Oh my god, yes I can! Ah! Oh. This feels so nice to be doing this. Oh, okay, I didn't manage to join those two together. Wait, oh, because there's stuff in the background. Okay, I will just use a lasso. Um, there's, they're like layered. Probably one shoe and the other shoe. Oops. This feels so nice to be doing this, oh my god, now, compared to, you know, the stuff I was doing earlier. This is, this is the part that I actually like. I like Atlas thing. I have a weird feeling that I was saying aliasing earlier instead of Atlasing. Please someone tell me I was wrong. Well, I am wrong. I want to be wrong now, I don't be wrong. Later. Wait, hang on. What's going on here? Look, there's a... Oh, right, okay. The vertices. So it's drawing a dot on every vertex and a dot on the faces. Interesting. When you're in mesh editing mode, if you have face select chosen, then it doesn't show a dot where the vertices are. I was thinking, wait, why is there a tiny face here? Ah! Thank you, Nooch! The slot horrors. Yeah. <laughs> Return from your archery session. Next week is the last one because it's getting too dark. You don't want to play darkery? Darkery? This one would this would work better if I wrote it out because it looks like it could be pronounced either way. If you spell it this way, it looks like it's French. Um, just return. Okay, yes, nice. I'm glad that you're stopping before it gets too dangerous. Before you can like. Dodge the rain of arrows coming down. <laughs> All right, there we are. That's the last part. So let's have a look on the model. Where are these? I'm imagining somewhere around the rim. Ah, it is the this. Wait, wait. Did they like on purpose put a weird red thing there? Like this part here? Is this part here? Why, why would they do that? Why would they do... Okay. I was worried that I was going to have to keep uh, this line here. This red line. But I don't think it's meant to be there in all honesty. Or at least I think it would look better without it. So I am going to shrink this down to 0 0.01. Slap it on here. Okay, that covers all white parts. All white parts are now done. Okay, let's do all the light red parts now. So that's this island here. And another one that's underneath it. Why do I keep forgetting that? I'm glad that they at least did that, you know? Didn't make too, like, do you know what I mean? They made it so that the texture affects both boots. They didn't make a separate UV map for, wait. It's only that case because I did a thing, I think. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it was originally that way. It's only too dangerous because you don't want to get hit by a returning arrow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. That's what I mean. I was half jo joking when I said it, but I remembered that you did mention about firing arrows up high. This part I'm not looking forward to. Well... Whatever. It's probably not going to be too bad. What is that, actually? Oh, these are the shoelace holes, aren't they? The eyelets. 
Mm. Okay, no, this actually could be bad because look, this face here has some of this. But its size on the UV map does reflect its size on the model, so this might be okay if I just make one hole on a red background and map all of these these little regions around here. Yeah, I think this will be okay. This will be a type of editing I've not done before. So, you know, fun. They did actually, to be fair, put these dark things around here. They're not quite lining up though, are they? Mm. This part might be much harder. I mean, if Cat doesn't mind losing this little dark outline around there... Then this can be uh, at this very efficiently. What is this region here? Okay. We might have to like lose. I can't understand slightly. I do like this song, but it's, it's a bit loud. Mm, basically, this whole region here. Is this its own island? No, this is probably its own island. Yeah. Where is it? Other one. This whole region here has this little dark bit around there, and I reckon having this dark bit here is actually kind of nice. Otherwise, you've got Light red, meeting light red. It'll probably be hard to tell that this becomes the tongue of the shoe in this area. Mm. Let's just do what we can first, I guess. What is this part? Oh! <laughs> okay. Hmm, do you need to worry about this? Probably not. I feel like it'd look more natural without this. Over here they have like a line drawn. Oh my god. Over here we have a line drawn around that outside. What is that part? Oh, it's literally just drawn on here. So this whole thing is the sole of the shoe, right? Yeah. Mm. What's this part then? So that part is this lighter part. <laughs> Ignore how I did that selection. That was very strange. So what is this part? Oh, so it only looks dark because it's in shadow from the lights. That's probably fine then. I mean, if you're thinking of an actual shoe, they probably would make it like all the same material, right? I doubt that they'd actually switch to a darker material right as it goes underneath. So I probably can just squash this all down to one tiny thing except for the fox. The fox is really nicely... Pretty, uh, pretty square section, so... Hmm... So if we just keep this section... Um, I'll edit the texture there so that's not... Got the dark part there. Everything else can become dark, I think. Reckon? I reckon all of this... Come dark. It's everything outside the fox. Including this. Sounds a bit weird, isn't it? Outside the fox. Uh, okay. Oh, need this one as well. 
Okay, so we're leaving the fox alone. <laughs> this reminds me of cats. <laughs> Redeem, shut the fox up. I'm leaving the fox alone. Sorry, weird sense of humor, sorry. Let's shrink this down to 0 0.01. This is light colored plastic. Is that the same color as this? I reckon it is, but let's double check in paint. This color is 193 and this is 193 Okay, I'm really, really, really grateful for this author to actually reusing colors. That makes it possible to add this without, well, any change in colors by moving a lot of things into the same region. So this can be moved over here as well. Okay, uh, what the fuck is this? Ship. Uh. What is that? Is it like inside the ship? No. What is that? see anything selected over here. Am I crazy? I mean, it joins onto the eyes. The part with the eyes. So my guess would be that it's like... I feel like the, is there like some folded over inside region? This bone is really annoying. Ah, it's up here! It's this region. Okay. Hmm. A dark line drawn there would be nice. So we could just move this, these faces. Where do I move those? Oh, that becomes sharp there. Maybe it's time for me to try to use a knife tool. For the first ever time, I think. How does a knife tool work? Uh, do I have to be in this mode? Can I do it over here? Annotate. Don't know. Add. The K key. Do you know? K key. Um, thank you with pets. Let me hide this region and this region. No, oh, not that region. Oh, <laughs> this is apparently connected. That's annoying. Wait, what's British? Okay, okay, has indeed selected a knife. Do I like click here and drag or something? I do. I'm going? What happens if I now join it up to the end there? Is it done? How do I like apply it? Enter? Yeah. Oh my god, that just did exactly what I wanted it to do! Holy crap! Okay, this knife tool is powerful. It's messed up the normals though. Hmm, why did it mess up the normals? I hope it prefer the... I hope it, I hope it would preserve the normals. Whooped this line here as well. Cat with knife, everyone run. <laughs> ah, reminds me of that um, meme of the cat jumping out of the wash basin with a uh, with a knife in his mouth. We know of that. All right, let's try to Stewie. Hi, hi. Don't make any sudden movements. <laughs> the knife is pointing towards me as well. <laughs> That's perfect. That's actually perfect. <laughs> yeah, the the bottle is my knife. It's like, wait, uh, which is the, the? Let's imagine that this this end here 
Ignore my broken fingers. Oh, that's nasty! Imagine that this is my... is the knife, the sharp pointy end. Uh... <laughs> Don't make any sudden movements. Uh, 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 I'm trying to make a derpy face. Oh, uh, never mind, this is just looking, uh, lewd. How's the blending? It's going all right, thank you. Uh, I just learned about the knife tools. The knife tool. I like it. I just accidentally measured something. Oh god, how do I delete the measurement? Shit. The funky technician is back. Oh, okay, just disappears when I do that. Does it come back if I put this on? <laughs> it does. How do you delete things? Do you just infinitely add them and they can never disappear? It seems like a... An annoying thing. How does one remove these? <laughs> ah! Ruler. Measure. What is this tool called? Measure. Oh, I guess I guess that's what it looks like now. How does one remove these things? Click one and press delete. Uh, when did I last save? The funky technician is back. Shit, that was a while ago. Fuck. Alright, fine, I guess I'll manually... Ah, oh, screw it, I can't bother. Um... Yeah, because I thought, surely, we're not going to have a silly system where you have to do this to delete them manually, right? No, no, that's not happening, that's not happening. We're just ignoring them. Alright, let's hide... Oh... What do you learn about J? What is... What do you mean? The join thing? Report error in valid selection order. Alright, let's hide this. And this, and this, and this, and this. And this, and this, and this. Wait, what? I feel like I hid too much. Hold on. Oh, do I have... I do not have x-ray mode on. Why don't I delete everything? Alright, Alt H, bring it back. Hide that one. This one. Why is that one face? Like, is there like nothing behind that? I guess not. What the fuck? Huh? There's nothing behind it. Just in one that one, sp the, the one spot. What the hell? Okay then. Um, connects edges. Uh, J for Jaffa cake. <laughs> um, I don't think I know about that. <laughs> Sorry. Mm, I think what I'd like to do is recut this so that. Yeah, you know what? I'm actually gonna do that. I'm actually gonna do that. Just watch me. The mad cat. I'm gonna knife from here over to there over to wait what how did I just put two in the, at the same time what the fuck wait is there no way to undo if you make one one click um, if you want to connect two edges with an edge the bisect two edges with an edge that bisects a face. Two vertices with an edge that bisects a face. I don't think I understand, sorry. As we showed you what's happening. Please tell me I can rotate. Oh god. Boop! 
are my stats? No. Oof, I made a few more triangles, didn't I? So hopefully... Hmm... Is it possible to, like, slide a vertex without ruining its position on here? Wait, does it actually do what I want? What the hell? Okay, it does actually slide it along. Oh my god, it's Nanavi. Have we been through all songs already? Fine, whatever, I'll just let it play again. I really like it anyway. I just want to move this vertex down to there, for example, but at the same time have it move this like over to there so it still looks correct on here. I just want to move in both spaces at the same time. No! This song is such a banger! Can't believe. How can one song bang so much? Doesn't it get tired? She does! Um... Okay, so this can all be red down there. Alright, let's knife this again. Wait, can I be doing this? In a mirrored way. What does actually apply on both? What is that? No, oh, that's not. If I knifed this from the here to there. No. I never never get the mirror mode working <laughs> probably. Um, okay, so we'll Knife from here down to there, down to there, down to there, down to there. Then the idea is. All of these faces can be moved into one dark region and all of these faces can be moved into one light region. I should triangulate them first though. These ones don't look good. I wish I could knife them in this space. Hmm. Don't take that out of context. <laughs> uh. Join the hair to the Oh now I see why you said <laughs> Now I see why you said British <laughs> That's funny Took a while I got it in the end Really, I'm racking up the number of vertices, aren't I? Oh, we've got enough to spare. Anyway, I can probably reduce verts in some other places. Like, you know, these areas. And thank you, Asento.
<clears throat> oh my god, I can't. There we are. <laughs> can get the lid back on. Oh, uh, posture as well. I've never taken a commission for anything, but I'm not, like, averse to the idea. I just don't think, uh, I don't have confidence is the problem. I'm scared. I don't like the idea of taking on something that I can't do and then having to let someone down. I very much sort of just stumble my way through a lot of things, you know? And at the end it's like, oh! I was able to do a thing. If I if I knew in advance that I could do it, I wouldn't mind so much. I wouldn't mind at all. Is this a souped up model or made from the ground up? Ah, uh, I did not make this model. I'm just optimizing it, that's all. And piecing it together from bits and pieces. Kit bashing. Well, more like re kit bashing. Something that was already bashed. <laughs> um. Yeah. Cat drew the textures, by the way. She does take commissions. I don't think she takes commissions for texture work. But, I, you know, maybe she would. I don't know of her taking commissions for... Are you, are you bashing me? Because of the, the, the... You know. Because bash... It's gonna add like a flipping thousand vertices at this point, at this rate. We're looking into getting a 3D model for VR chat, and I'm just kit bashing at this point. Well, this is how. <laughs> ignore that. This is how this model came to be. The one I'm. You know, my own one. So. Um, yeah. Just make sure that the um, person who made the model. So this was originally. The base of this is from Booth. But yeah, as long as you make sure that, you know. If you're going to be using it for streaming, which uh, you're not, you literally just said VR chat, so ignore me. But if someone is, um, a lot of the authors on Booth are fine with you using them for like streaming and um, you know, kit bashing and stuff, as long as you're not distributing anything and you're not using them for a. Uh, uh, they're okay with you using them in places where you're making money, however, not. Commercial use, as in like by companies, but individuals is typically okay. But usually, these models will have like a when they're on booth, they'll have like a oh my god, uh, an image that says all of the license information, but whatever. Wouldn't be opposed to doing it for streaming, but VRC mainly. Mm. I would just, you know, to be like a, a a nice person, I, and <laughs> as well as you know, following the law and stuff. I would just, um, yeah, just make sure that the model you want to use, the author's fine with you using it that way. Yeah. I think that's the only place I need to slice. Um. Knife to there and there and there. I've never optimized in this way before, though. This is actually adding quite a lot of vertices. I'm hoping that I can cut it down. Later. Yeah, I really hope I can do that. <laughs> I 
Ugh, got to do this for the other shoe as well after this, I forgot. But basically I'm sort of sacrificing the, the polygon count for the ability to have really, really compact textures. Which will save on the VRAM more. Alright, that's one shoe cut. Refactoring the geometry. I kind of am, you know? That's not a bad analogy. That's pretty neat way of putting it. <laughs> kind of like that. So now we should have. Oh wait. Look over here. Oh my god, I'm actually pointing at my screen like an idiot. Thankfully, I have a mouse pointer. Look at look in this region. All of this is in darkness. I went a little bit out here as well. Wait. Uh, what is this actually? What is this area? Hold on. Face select. That is. Down there. Alright, that'll be fine. So all of these faces can just be dragged into one tiny, 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 like 16 by 16 pixel or something region of this color. Instead of having this enormous hundreds of pixels being taken up. One thing, does this shadow thing go all around? Try selecting the whole area that is bordered by it, pressing I to insert. Selecting the whole area that is bordered by it and pressing I to insert. Hold on, let me try it on the other shoe. Thank you for. Oi, jeez. God damn. Hi, Enlen. Did I do this shoe? Did I do this shoe? I can't remember. No, I don't think I did this one. I sound, I sound did excited before I got hit, yeah. You got this, Yuk. I believe in you. Thank you, Fred. So, hold on, wait. Select this region. I love this selection way, by the way. This way of selecting things. Select all of this region. Sometimes I want to select this way now. Okay, just works, nice. Okay, select it. So like that. Right? This is the region that's... Let me try that again. Ganbat. 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 Gan, 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 gan. <laughs> Up to the holes. Oh, uh... A whole red area. Okay, let's just pretend that I've done that. <laughs> but, alright. Now what? Press I to insert. Uh, in one direction a monster breaks loose, in the other direction it doesn't. But yeah, hi cat, hi hi! Very slightly inset. Okay, how do I, how do I... Oh, I see. But unfortunately it's like not really, uh... Wait, what's that done? Oh, let's raise it up? Can't even make out what's happening. Don't say the weird part of this. Oh, oh. Okay, I'm gonna continue doing it the way I need to. I'm really, really sorry, because I, I need to get this done. And, and there was a way that worked. I'm sorry, Stewie. I had like a plan. I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. Me. This, this music is hype as hell. No whack through night. Cat, do you want to join me if it's no whack through? 
You've even got a different playlist of music. Deadline in two hours. No, deadline's in... Deadline is legitimately... Oh my fucking god. Ah! The deadline is actually in 24 hours. <laughs> As in, like, actually fully working tested in VR chat. And here I am not even fucking finished. <laughs> I should really get this. Uh, yeah, I don't think I've got this. I don't think I've got this. God damn it. I don't think I've got this. What the fuck? Um, do you, do, do you want to join anyway, Kat? Just delete this one as well. No, there is a whack through tonight. Okay, well, have fun. I won't be able to watch it because I'm doing this for you. Can I at least watch it afterwards? Um, Alright, that's a knife from here. To. Wait, did I do this side? No. Wait. The outside. No, I didn't do this side. Let's go from here. Boop. Boop. Uh. Boop, I guess. Um. I am saying I won't be able to. Oh, shit. I need to be quiet. Shit. I didn't realize the time. Fuck. Yeah, I need to be quiet. Whoops. Okay. Sorry. Gotta be quiet mode. Wow, the time has gone so quickly today. Yeah, people are trying to sleep. Uh, I'm saying I won't be able to watch work because I'm doing this. Sorry, cat. Would I be able to watch it later, afterwards? Or something? Drag it from here to here. Yeah, that'll do. I don't know. <laughs> Cat. How long I'm streaming for? It really depends on how long this takes. If I stop now, it won't be done in time. Sorry. Oh, oh, when I say later, I don't necessarily mean today, by the way. Like, any time. Just like if you're okay with replaying things. Some other time. Eleven PM your time? Uh... Yeah. Okay, did I recut this? Can't tell. This looks different on this side. Did I cut this here? What am I even trying to do? Sorry, it's gone 10 p.m. now. Look, look, look. The time! I'm actually pointing with a single finger, not two fingers. Well, actually, I was pointing with two fingers, but they were on different hands. I was pointing with two hands. How's the cam doing? How are you camming? <laughs> Wait, that means something else. I can't work out whether I need 
to slice this here or not. Yeah, probably should. Let's go from here down to there. Yes, let's do that. Okay, down to there. Hide all this. The time I know. We'll slice down to here. Uh, where should I slice down to? This going so far out here. Did I actually do this? On the other side? <laughs> Can't remember. Oh no, it's another really hype track. I mean, it's not a bad thing. I'm just gonna try to not misclick too much from the hypeness. <laughs> That'll do. And then the rest can follow around like that. At this point we need another slice for the black stuff. That'll do. I think... Wait, am I being really stupid? I'm being really stupid. just split this out and mirror it instead of trying to cut two identically. I'll just take the left shoe and mirror it if that's the thing I can do. Even though they're both working right now, right before I make this drastic decision. How's the camera blending? Before re-splitting shoes, weight painting, I'll just change the names of the bones. Hi, F. Paul. Welcome, welcome. Just 15 minutes in the past. Yeah, yeah, Fox, don't worry, just watch it. If that's what you, you've decided you're doing. Watch immediately. Okay, that slice is done now. Uh, I've sliced this side, I've sliced this side all the way around to the top, and this side all the way around to the bottom. Okay, I think that's all I need to do. I think that's everywhere. Yes, from now on it's just simple colours. So I'll get one of these looking how I want it and I'll delete the other one. Alright. Whee! Goodbye! Uh... Is this what I want to do? I hope so. Uh... Yeah, because the model is centered, so I should be able to flip around the origin. And no going back now. Just kidding, there is a... Totally a... Way to go back because I'm saving this. Hi, Binkin! Abby, Bin, Binko, sorry! Welcome, welcome! Oh, Benko! Benko! Oh my god, shit, I'm so sorry, I'm misreading your name like a absolutely horrible. I'm sorry! I'm sorry! Now I need to add skates. You play that jet set really well. Wait, the song? Thanks, Jimmy. Mm. Thank you, Ben Benko. I did not make the model. 
But I'm trying to optimize it a lot and make this UV map a lot, 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 lot better. So all of this stuff can now just be moved into one place. Oh my god, this is kind of tight, isn't it? So all of these faces... I wonder if control would work here. It actually is working. Holy crap. It's following the path around as I'm clicking. Oh, I don't want that one selected there. I don't want that one selected there. I don't want that one selected there. Alright, I think we're not going to be using control. <laughs> so. Justo. Oh my god, I haven't triangulated. Hi, Spitfire! I'm gonna give you a, a aggressive pat. Okay, never mind, you're patting me normally. Okay, I will. Sorry, I thought you were throwing cheese at me and then asking for pats. Pat, pat. You cheesy person! Hi. Is optimizing the only thing you do? Be more talented than I know. Uh, I've made. I can't do artistic things, in my opinion. Anything that's meant to like look cute or soft or fleshy. <laughs> what I'm saying is like I can model really angular things. That's what I'm trying to say. In a very sus sounding way. Okay, now that's fine. We can do that. With cheese or not. Well, I can't throw the cheese at you to cheese you. I'm afraid. And this and this. Okay, so this is all a dark region now. I'm actually gonna do this side as well. Oh, this is a... Wait, is this a... like one face? Oh my god, the dot for the face is outside the face itself, I've never seen that. It's just reminding me that I really do need to split stuff. This area here where it goes red is actually out of view. It's underneath these, so it doesn't matter at all if I select that part as well. And make it dark red. But yeah, I only need to not forget to triangulate. I mean, that's it's that, isn't it? That little dot there is. Yep. Oh no, this one. Yes. I guess clicking Control to select through the faces would work a lot better after it's triangulated as well. Those ones. This one. 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 All right. That should be all of the dark parts. I can put a poster note in my head and pretend it's cheese. <laughs> nice. Uh, hard surface? Yeah, I guess so. Um, yeah, I do much more programming stuff. When it comes to modeling, I'm blended scary. Okay, I think. If I shrink this down to 0 0.01, drag it over there, into that dark region, this is now what it looks like instead. So sometimes it's like a perfectly hard line, which in my opinion looks better, but whatever. And sometimes it's this soft line there. Wait, why? Oh yeah, right, I know. I think that still looks pretty... Oh, what the fuck is that? What is that? What is that? Did I not slice this part? God damn it. Is that 
have fire on to slice? I guess it is. Cheese. I'm, I'm not cheese. I'm very surprised it allowed me to slice that while I was already selecting things. That's quite impressive. Slice the cheese? Ah, oh, you probably should actually. I can't slice the American cheese though. Sounds like you're just gonna hurt yourself if you try. Okay, let's try again. Let's size the point zero one. There we are. Now how's it look? Got a dark edge all the way around there. This part looks good. Dark edge goes all the way around. This it's a little bit uneven. But I mean, I guess it originally was anyway. Yeah, oh, it was even less than that originally. I guess it stands out a bit now that it's sharp lines. Instead of, like, looking like it's painted. <coughs> Look at this! Uh, this is how it originally was. This is not me who did that. Okay, so now this can all be a light colour. Well, I'll worry about that later, actually. Um, actually, no, I won't. Let me move everything now that wants to have these dark holes. Or that doesn't want to have the dark holes. So all of the faces that are completely free of the darkness. <laughs> so like something from Star Wars. Someone who hasn't seen Star Wars and will not. This, 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 this. No, not that one. These, the. <sighs> That's close. These. Uh, actually, no, not this. This. These. Yeah, just that. This one. This. We'll do this. We'll move that into its own region. That'll be fine. That, that, that. This. This. That's all of that region that's outside the holes. <clears throat> Do we need that? I'm gonna not include those. Got a lot of space being wasted otherwise. I guess I could just knife around them, the huge ones. Oh my god, I just went over to OBS and was trying to pan this view. On OBS. there's actually nothing in the middle here so I could just drag this to like a whole a, a dark area like it doesn't need a circle in the middle mm. coming in the middle of the circle dark oh the middle of the circle is not dark is it no the middle of the circle is not dark never mind <laughs> I thought the middle of the circle was different because of these I'm going to be very quiet right now. That's why I sound like this. Because people are sleeping. <gasps> Thank you, Steve. 
Okay, let's select these. I'm a bit worried that these aren't going to be able to save much space. Doing it this way. This is a lazy way. But I kind of need this done in time, so... Okay. This one? Is that okay? I wonder. Okay, and now I should be able to shrink all of these down to like 0 0.01. And all of these can be in this light area here. And so can these. And then I can just make some overlapping circles, hopefully. So... All of these. If one of these holes doesn't quite work out. If one of these triangles covers both of these holes, I'm going to be screwed. And this one does. God damn it. How annoying. Which one is this? This one. <laughs> Oh, but it's going like really far outside it anyway. Like it shouldn't even be going down that far. What if I just cut it off? How does that look? <laughs> Not great. Not great. Annoying, isn't it? Guess I'll just knife in. Boop, boop. Problem solved. Boop, boop, boop. Problem solved. I removed one too many things. Ah, uh, but that's fine. Boop. It's only hidden, it's gonna come back. It's gonna be a twenty vertices just for these shoes that is obscene that is obscene that's vile Blech. 
I don't know any better way to do it there. What is this? I've already messed up something here, apparently. Yeah, something in there shouldn't have been moved. Oh, fuck's sake. Which one is that? Ah, oh, and this one. She's going to be a separate material? No, the same one. That's why I wanted to use the least amount of space as possible. On the texture. <laughs> Clearly not vertex-wise, unfortunately. It's on the other side of the lace, I guess. Okay. And this one's peeking out too far. I can let this, like... this slide but no but how optimized one could get this model with way more time um yeah surely more than this <laughs> okay what i'm thinking is that this oh my god i can't Wait, has it forgotten my near clipping distance or something? I guess not. Oh, yes it has! That was meant to be either that, wasn't it? There we are. I guess, uh, what I was thinking is that all of these faces could be like joined in the middle and then this could just become like you know two triangles instead of all of the other stuff i don't know how you'd do that though i just sort of want to fill it was it f or something to fill the face no do you know what i mean just fill in this gap with one thing dissolve the edges <sighs> Maybe I had something else selected by mistake. To fill the gap, yes, yes. I really love this song. Select the loop. So like the outer, outer part? Like this. This, this, and this? Then F? Okay. Okay. I just want to remove the other faces. Uh, I guess just hide this. Just around the hole, not that one. I was gonna hide that and then delete everything else. 
Select a circle around the hole. The circle around the hole? Oh, is this not UV mapped? Is this not here? Oh, it's not there. What the hell? Okay, that's not done what I want then. <laughs> I just want these to be like joined to each other. not here. Where is it? It's down there, of course, where Vendor loves to put crap. <sighs> but would that even save space? It should just be two triangles, right? Yeah, no, that's like three triangles. Oh, because I, I did it from the texture side this time instead of this side. Merge at center. Faces, edges, vertices. What am I wanting to do? This? This? the mouse on this side. Failed to find merge at center. Oh, UV merge, what the hell? <laughs> what is that? They've gone somewhere else, they're no longer here. They've gone down here, probably. Oh, they're over here now, apparently. Right, because they're in two places at once. This area here is just half of this, half of this. Okay, I don't think this is gonna work. <laughs> Let's just keep doing it the other way. Don't worry, I, why, why it was me who was asking if there was another way to do it, but... I'm not sure it's possible. Without like writing a Python script or something silly. Or actually me bothering to learn how to use Blender. <laughs> okay. This, 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 this. This. We'll merge. No, we'll scale down to 0 0.01. That over there. <gasps> oh my god, it's a theme of patting apparently. There you are. Pat that. Pats for the cab. I just accidentally added a subdiv for the wrong place and my process got sent to the Shadow Realm for five minutes. Oh no! On Blender? <laughs> <laughs> Rip. I think that looks okay. There's like a little bit of a line there and a line there and there. But bear in mind, they're gonna be laces, so it's harder to... Well, okay, still notice that one. Why is this one so bad? Oh. <laughs> yeah, that'll do it. How do you 
unselect. Oh. I mean, no, I want that one, I don't want this one. I'm glad I didn't run out of memory. Oh shit, sorry, 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 I didn't realize, thank you, Stewie. I did the VTuber thing. Well, not even VTuber, I did the streamer thing. Am I a real streamer now? Okay, that's under the lace, so I don't care about that one. No! No! Oh. My hands are missing. I'm holding shift instead of control. Nuke orb deployed. <laughs> Flying across the screen. Nice. What is this? What is this one? I don't like this. Is this already cut off? Oh, it's because it's hidden, isn't it? Yeah, so it's because it was hidden. Let's not select that one. Oh, nice. Oh my god. Okay, whatever. <sighs> Add this one. What's going on? Oh, there. Is this one selected? What the fuck? Wait, what is this? Oh, it's up there. Oh yeah, that's pretty bad. Oh, but it's behind the lace. Okay, whatever, I'll do it. Oh, wait, no, this is a better place. Mom, mom, mom. Okay. Nice. I think everywhere's safe now. What is this one though? Is that one behind the shoelace or something? No, it's not really. I'll knife this one brav as well. Oh my god, this one's difficult. Uh, I don't know what I just did, but I don't think I meant to. I undid it, don't worry. I mean, I didn't apply it. Okay, so let's undo that. It's all good to go. Minted! Hi! I feel like I see you doing some different, super different, there, doing different. Oh my fucking god, I can't read. Okay, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not talented at reading. I feel like I see you doing some different skill every stream. It's not even a difficult sentence. It's super inspiring. Thank you very much. Uh, I don't feel skilled at this. Okay, I've just somehow got a whole bunch of other stuff selected in the meantime selected. Something down here as well. I'm I'm really not confident with Blender. But but thank you very much. Also highlighted. I 
happy if I can inspire though. Okay, now all I have to do is like put all of these on top of each other. And then it's soaring. This one's a bit of a waste, but whatever. Oh my god, look at that. That looks so cool on the shoe. On the right side. Okay. I really hope that most of these holes are the same. Because they're clearly very hand drawn. I think I'll go with the smallest, one of the smallest circular looking ones, this one. I think I'll put everything on there. Because it's not going to be too big to encompass the whole uh, this orange mishmash. But how are you doing, Linted? Cool to see you here again. I mean, like, well, as usual, but yeah. Alright, that works. That works really well. If I do say so myself. And even, even if not all these do fit, I can just redraw this one circle so that we have a circle. I think drawing one circle is something I can do. <gasps> oh, this is pretty good. This was too small before, but now I bring it over here. Oh, it's too small for this one as well, isn't it? Just barely. Could I be an absolute rebel and just stretch it slightly, this one triangle? Which one is this? This one. It actually looks fine. It's probably just behind the shoelace that's messed up. Getting over being sick. Oh no! It wasn't the C word, was it? Oh, it's there. Then it should be messed up. Oh, it's fine, actually. I have another friend who has COVID right now. Actually, the person who's... Have a time making mm, now. Nah. Oh my god, okay, I didn't think this through. There's so much stuff on top of it that I can barely see the texture underneath anymore. This could become an issue. Chat loves Yuki. <gasps> what the fuck? Stop saying that. Don't put words into other people's mouth. Thank you though. <laughs> Sorry, I can't handle it. No. Fromage. Uh... Oh, what? Stop. Yeah, I can just I realize I can just turn off the other things temporarily. This is so satisfying though, doing this at this point. Because this is where real space savings are happening. Alright, it's gonna be messy again. Hide those. Only three left. Yeah, I hope it wasn't too bad though, it? The space thanks you. <laughs> That's kinda cute. Hoping other people's computers will thank me. Not literally, obviously, but hopefully it'll make it a lot easier for one people. In VR chat, not the most people. Well, okay. I happen to be hanging out with a bunch of very. <laughs> but there they all are! Amazing. And look! You'd never be able to guess! Hold on. Let's take a proper look. Take a close look at that. Roll up and skate, blade skin. Hmm, it's not perfectly centered on some of these, but that was the case before anyway, so. Oh, some of those are so thin though, what the fuck? Wouldn't funny, definitely don't recommend. 
Oh, it was. Uh... Oh, you, oh, sorry, I, I missed that. I've ordered it for three and a half years and finally got me. No, I'm sorry. No, not 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 cheese cabbage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've had a. I had it last year. Wouldn't recommend it either. If you've got the opportunity to try it out, I wouldn't recommend. Oh, okay, it's hard to make it big because that's gonna happen. What happens around this side when I do that? Hmm. That looks... okay, this, this part looks really bad. Oh, I use it for like my streams of punishment and do like it. Which way are we moving this way? I can't get too far away, it's affecting <laughs> such a weird situation. I reckon that's fine. This, well, what what is going on here? What is this triangle? Why is it selected? Can I just not have that be there? I can! Nice! Look at that! Boop! Okay, so it says all of this. Well, how do we do it again? Oh, okay, we selected this. And then we selected everything that's not in that region where the hole is. Therefore we should only have this left. Oh my god, what happened? I think I made it go inside out. This is so trippy, I'm like moving it to the left on the hair. It's moving down over there. Move it down, move it right. <laughs> oh my god, it's so weird. It's like... <laughs> yeah, it's really weird. Oh my god, okay, the hand goes up and it goes left. Okay, is that better than before? You're gonna so right. There's some very thin ones on this side as well. Ooh, something weird's going on there. Well, I guess. Wait, why is that? Maybe normals need sorting out. I'm glad. I'm glad you're getting better. I have got better. Wait. And finally, we'll do this one. <sighs> okay, so now let's just quickly optimize all the rest of it. This part was underneath, right? Where is it? Oh, <laughs> yes, there. All right, I'm totally fine with that. Just becoming a sort of colour. Am I? Oh, I just shrunk on the wrong side. <laughs> oh, hold on. There we are. It's 
sein. Before. After. Or before. After. I think that's fine. Move this over to there. We could even move this into some of this red region there. If you want to get really annoying with ever wanting to make an adjustment. Uh, all of this region is... Wait, what is that? Is that a screw or something? Single vertex. Oh shit. Hard stars kicking off again. Where are you? Ah, oh, there we are. Ah, it was this. <laughs> Alright, I think that's fine. I think that's fine. We don't need that dark background. I think it looks worse than the dark background anyway because it's so resolution. So low resolution. Alright, it's time for control click to make this an easy thing to do. Wait, what is this all then? Oh, it's part of the screw. Alright. Wait, hang on. What is this dark stuff around here? Where is it? There. Oh, it's this little dark thing here. Where is that? Oh, this is kind of weird. Look, this here is dark, painted dark. As you come around here, mm, I don't know. Bye 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 bye. Work. No worries. Thank you very much for the like last year and help. Alright, all of this. <laughs> Thank you. Bye bye. Okay, what does it look like if I move this? Or just these? I'll worry about the others later. Could I know for sure all of these ones will be fine? Let's try doing it this way. Nice. This is so satisfying when this works. Go on these as well. Screw, isn't it? Okay, all this can become absolutely tiny. All of these can go. Okay, it's the same shade of red, right? This versus this. Yep. Okay, what if we put all of this into the dark region? <laughs> the dark side. Which parts are even selected right now? What is selected? We noticed there's an option to like center on the screen on this view. Oh, there it is. Wait, where can I see it from? Oh! Yeah, no, that should all be light. And bring the other one back. We'll do it all together. Oops. Move, not scale. Ok, 
care? Oh my god, look, it's, it's, it's cleaning up slowly but surely. Okay, so all of this is meant to be dark as well. Let's do this darker. What color is that? Oh, it's just a dark red. Same as... Well, same as these circles, actually. I guess I'll put them in the middle of that circle. Very small, though. It just looks black from this distance. Okay. Um. Is this the, is this the same color as this, or is it slightly darker? Let's compare and paint again. 38, 33, 33. 38, 33, 33. All the same. Very nice for me. <coughs> I kind of like you, Ving. I don't know why. Maybe it's because I'm not artistic. And this is like a very methodical thing. Maybe if I was artistic, I'd be like, God damn, this procedure of you, Ving, is such a pain in the ass. I just want to be able to express myself. But, uh... Yeah, like, like I can't, so... <laughs> oh, well. Uh, okay, so we've got that, 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 and probably this, I'll double check that. Fair enough though, I can understand why people wouldn't like this, I think I'm just weird for liking it. I think it's just that it's one of the things that I'm able to do. It feels good to be able to say that I can do a thing. <laughs> Sorry, this sounds like way more dramatically pessimistic than I'm trying to sound. It just happens. I think it's a British thing. Okay. Select all of that. Is that all of them? No, not quite. Is that all of them? Yes. Alright, let's scale all that down. This wants to be a really dark grey. Let's make this the dark grey region for now. I'll just double check that these are the same colors. All of these blackish kind of thing. Thirty-eight, thirty-eight, thirty-eight. This was thirty-eight, thirty-three, thirty-three. It's actually different. Eight, three, three. Eight, three, three. Eight, eight, eight. I don't know if you'll be able to notice the difference, but 944, I'm going to class the same as 833. Sorry, I'm going to be a rebel. I'm going to overrule that one, Chief. 944. 944. 944. Okay, so. This, 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 this. That was 888, that's different. That's different as well. And this... 833... This... I should be just using Photoshop, I would need to switch tools all the time every time I wanted to check a colour. Seems like overkill for Photoshop, but whatever. So those are those, and everything else... Yeah, that matches this. Okay, so we want all of this and this. Whoops. Wait, no, those are the special ones. Ignore those two. We want this, this, and this. And all of this mess. <laughs> Thankfully, I can just do this one. Oh, what's my selection? And this and this, hopefully they all move nice. These can go and join the friends up here. Why does it look red there? Why is it looking red? What the hell? 
Wait, what are these red dots? What does red mean? They're too close or something? Like within the same pixel or something? Hmm. I don't know what red means. Never seen red dots before. None of the other ones are red. I know that like cyan colored is sharp. So, you know, don't smooth across the boundary. Pinned? What does that mean? What that? Oh, man, I just meant something else. Sorry. This and this. There we are. You can be there. These two ones there I forgot to select, whoopsie. You can also... Wait, why is there always something still selected? Keep forgetting to deselect first. They can join... This? Need that now? Oh my god, what the f- what is this? What is this? No! It's not like a round rim somewhere around here, is it? Can't actually see a round rim. Okay, what is it? Let's select it and find out. What is it? Can't see it anywhere. Oh, is it shoelaces? What is that? Okay, whatever. Uh, okay, so these white ones were a different colour to this slightly darker grey one, so... Fine. I'll just shrink this down. Pins just keep a vertex in place generally, like if you're a deformer in Ireland, but wanted some points to say where they are. Oh, okay. Wait, does that mean I can't move them? assuming that's what they mean, yeah, <laughs> fair enough. No worries. I just wanted to try it, I wasn't trying to show you up or anything. Just curious, I wanted to learn as well. Alright, let's compare all these dark brownish colours. 100, 12, 17... Oh my god, that's a very different model. Oh yeah, I can actually see the colour changing there. Okay, so these ones are 112, 17. Okay, let me just remove these. Oops, not that many. So these two are the same, this and this. And these are probably all the same as well, let's double check. 80, 20, 24. 80, 20, 24. 80, 20, 24. 80, 20, 24. Okay, so these are all the other ones. So these ones. And then this 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 and this. What the what have I done? <laughs> oh I'm on vertex so like oh god, okay I'm bring that one back as well. I remember my joy when I discovered that, wow, you can do it by face and things that share a vertex can like be in different points of the UV map. I thought it was something that wasn't possible. For a long time. Alright, uh, pff, actually still looks like it's got a lot left. Is this just the same red colour? It is. Okay, you can join the red patch over here. Zip. The power of being in multiple dimensions at once, yeah. 
I think these rings are all just this red as well. Yeah. Red ring of not death, but uh, wheels. Red ring of wheels. Why is it not going all the way to the edge? What is this <laughs> nonsense? Is this the rest of it? Holy crap, look at how detailed that is. Okay, I think that's actually the last red patch. And this stuff wasn't this either. What was this then? I'll have a look later. After I've done this. There was something in this region. Yeah. Oh, that was the thing I just moved there, wasn't it? Mm. <sighs> Alright, nearly done. It's very tempting just to make a tiny cut here. But... Yeah, I think I might do that. Let's knife the fox. <laughs> Don't let cat hear me say this. Uh, if she ever wants to change the logo, okay, this is not about changing logos. This is make. This is about making a final ready-to-use thing. Why is it affecting this over here? That's weird, isn't it? Why is it warping the fox here? Actually, it's really weird that it's warping the fox here, because look! Look over here! That's... Hmm. That's weird. Can I just knife into the middle of a region like this? I can! Oh my god, that's nice. Whoa, look how much it deforms the... Oh, it still looks kind of okay. Cheese time! Why cheese? Why the cheese time suddenly? What's going on there? This can then become its own thing. Oh, right, and you still need to triangulate. I forgot about that. 256! Okay, I guess that's why you're doing it, huh? Oops. Take it from there. Down to there, why not? Maybe it's being deformed because the mesh is being triangulated differently. I guess so. Oh, it's gone back actually, a little bit. Yeah, it's gone back. <laughs> okay. Why don't we just flipping triangulate every goddamn thing? Unhide everything. Play. Triangulate faces. Not too bad, in my opinion. Maybe I'll just do the weird faces. The ones that are not quads. I'll do this one. Yeah, no, <laughs> I'll just do that one. <laughs> Fail to find face. Huh? Oh, I failed to find the option, I see. Okay. <gasps> Thank you for the, for the hydration and positive check. Wait, everything else where there is not a fox? I'm gonna try and get it. Actually, I'll, um, let me just do this as well. So I wanna preserve this, this, this is really wide. I'm gonna knife this as well. It's on the side, isn't it? There it is. I don't know. Our cheese is expanded beyond the, beyond the bite. It has! Wide cheese! W wide, wide cheese. Not wide cheese, wide cheese. <clears throat> I never thought there'd be um, uh, ambiguity between those two things. I may have to stop soon and just have a small toilet break. 
Oh, look at that. It's completely avoiding that face. Just kidding. There's a couple of pixels. God damn it. I reckon that'll be okay. Uh, you reckon that'll be okay? <laughs> I could probably just drag the entire thing along slightly and no one would notice. Wait, that's a totally acceptable thing to do. Because... Oh no, it's not because it'll... Yeah, the fox. Oh my god, look. It's a fox. It's a cat jamming fox. G is underscore T. There you go, that's the one. <laughs> I should love the cat jamming mode. Oh, poster check as well. Did I do that? Sure, if I did, I'm doing it again anyway. If I did already. <sighs> okay. Sorry. Loud noises. You know, since this is such an important feature, I am actually going to. Uh. What's annoying? I'm actually gonna knife the fox here, just so that I can get a higher resolution. This is a good thing. Because I could take it from here down. <laughs> the nose! <laughs> Get squished. Someone's booping that snoot a bit too hard. Okay, the nose came back. Nice. I hoped it would. Okay, so now all of these other things. Let's just see what the color is. Is this. Uh, oh god, I was gonna say. This is 8, 38, 33, 33, which was this color, right? Yes, exactly the same. Nice. The majority of the shoe can join this. Well, all of this, actually, I guess. Wow, look at all that. That's so much. Oh my god, that's amazing. There's almost everything left. All of this. All of this, all of that, and this, I think. Should we? Yes. This. <laughs> no, why are you squishing the uke? Why? What happened? Alright, all of this can be shrunk down, but this one is a weird shape, so I'm going to knife it into... Thank you for the pants. I'm going to knife it into two... Gee. No, I'm going to knife it into two triangles. There we go. Okay, everything else should be okay now. The Uke is more portable in the compressed format. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, hold on. I'm just gonna turn all these weird knifed areas before I forget into triangulated. Ah! <laughs> That's all the uke says when you squish her. Change things slightly there. Oh no, it didn't it just it's just the number of lines has been increased. Oh. Cheese. Cheese. Oh my god. Holy shit, that came yeah, back loudly. Like... What are you doing to me, Kara? Stop. Stop. Cheese, 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 cheese. God damn it. I started running away. Too late. No. Shot. 
What the fuck? This is abuse. Ooh. What is this coordinated attack between you and uh, you and Cat? Oh my fucking god! Snipes here as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's some more here. Is this the same color? What? <gasps> what the fuck? That's what I want to know. What the? Cheese. Thank you for censoring my swearing with the word cheese. You might need a new neck. Yeah, maybe. Who's gonna pay for that to be fitted? I mean, what? I'm not a robot. I'm... It's Nova who's the robot. Okay, that's gonna go in there. This is all this color. Cat, I knifed some... I... Okay, never mind. <laughs> Going well, it takes a minute. Probably gone there anyway. Skill 0.01. You are joining this region down here. There we are. I... I... Sliced... The... So the shoe used to be made up of these squares all the way around. I like used the knife tool... On your fox, but not literally on your fox. I didn't literally knife your fox. I like cut out a little bit of extra space, cause look... This... 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 This edge here was so close... That it like... Was just going into the red. So I cut out a new... Square. No, 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 knifing the fox is a good thing in this case. I know it sounds bad. I promise it's not. I promise it's a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was me. I was just like... Uh, with a knife pointed towards myself. Because that's how the derby you could do. Okay. Lactose filled dairy product. No! Why? <laughs> Why lactose filled dairy product? I'm lactose intolerant, stop this. But cheese is fine. Deadline, deadline. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do when it comes for you? Stop! Please don't talk about a deadline. I'm trying my best. It's very stressful. I don't like it. Motor is fun in this case. Like an upgrade upgrade to the cat. No, wait, what's wrong with my current neck? My current neck can stretch very far. Sometimes. Motor is fun in this case. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I think I'll just knife this here. I think I'll just cut. Oh my god. I think I'll just cut from here to there. And then there to there. And these should be solid as well. Oh my god, it's warped the texture again. Why does it do that? Is it because it's not a quad and the rest of it is? If I were to like triangulate this, would it fix it? Well, manual triangulation. Boop. 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 Hmm. Everything changes a bit, doesn't it? Stretch my neck. <laughs> exactly. Oh, I forgot one. Hold on. Should probably have let it do it automatically because then if I want to put it back in the future, the way it triangulates will probably complement the changing into quads. Really? It splits this? Oh, I see. There's already... Yeah, okay. Right, that'll be fine. That will be fine. Now I can move this and this and all of these. Whee! <laughs> Hi. 
you doing up on? Okay, let's drag these into the red zone. Oh my god, not on that side. This side. Fish moly. What is that? What what is what is this combination of pixels? Take a close look at that combination of pixels. Could probably actually keep it on this for you because this menu area behind me is not super important. Feeling miserably website PHP stuff. So oh well if it's of any consolation, which is probably not. I probably would be the same. Not quite sure how that would be a consolation, but you know. <laughs> okay, so this is the same color as this, so I'm gonna put this into the same region up there. Um, we've got a dark red there and a dark red there, and those are the same. We also have a dark red region up here, so let's compare these colors. This is 112.17. That's completely different to these, isn't it? Wait, what? I don't remember these numbers. Are they the same numbers? Okay. I remember those ones. Okay, so these ones are the same as these ones, so they can join this section. I think that's everything at this point. Oh, wait, no, that's the cursor limit. So we've got this dark color and the design on it. We've got this light color. Oh, well, we've got the design on this light color. Oh, God! The top of the top of it has been chopped off. Shit. Bring that back. Bring everything back. How did I miss that? Jeez. Alright, where did that go again? Down here. Um, and this one went up here. And this red is the same as this red, I think. I'm gonna double check. 193, 38, 46. 193, 38, 46. <laughs> the fish with a thumbs up. This going moved into this region as well. Like right around there. Hell yeah! Right, this is pretty cool. So the entire texture then has been reduced to well, this. The entire texture for this. And it looks pretty much the same. This is the thing I was dreading most about, um, what's the word? Atlasing. But look at that. This whole shoe now. Let me see if we still have that weird normals issue over here. There's something slightly strange going on there, isn't it? Like here. Mm. How's it hitting? It's pretty much done, Stewie, look! The whole texture is this now! Oh, this was moved as well. I think, wait, let me double check, this is the same. This is... 38, 33, 33, and this is... 
38, 33, 33. Okay, so this can become up here. Mom, 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 mom. Okay. Did you delete the feed the other day? No, I didn't. I never did. <laughs> Wait, this is still there. I only deleted the... I only deleted the, uh... The fingers. So now this can be packed down to be flipping tiny. Well, I kind of want this to be smaller actually. This is a bunch of wasted space, hold on. I could just slide straight down from... Oh my god, I can't see what the hell I'm doing. I can't do it through the... for that since both vertices already exist. You can select them and press J. Wait, to do what? To slice? To do the cut I just did. Oh, can I do it on this side? Yeah, where they both already existed. Oh, but I could select them on here, right? And then go over to this side and do the J. What is J? I forget. Okay, so this vertex and this vertex. J. Vertex connect path. Interesting. Are they now is that that's the face that I can move now? Nice. Okay, thanks for the info. Yeah, that's useful. So I don't have to be digging around in the 3D view for it. I'm good. Wait what? Wait. Why is it scaling down to... Why is it scaling down to there, instead of to there? What the fuck? Oh, the bounding box. Oh, I see, instead of median point. Yeah, that's what I'm used to. You can also cut through edges and stuff. Sounds scary. Okay, so these become there, uh, why not? Uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy with this now. This is... Ah, oh, whatever, that's fine. Okay, um, might be time to actually combine that Oh, hold on, I need to get the other shoe back. Uh, roller skates, so let's just duplicate that. How did you do that again? Keep it there. And then I should just be able to scale to minus one on the x-axis. I'm probably need to flip faces now, won't I? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Uh, 
Where is it? Uh, I don't know where the option is. It's not where I thought it was. I cannot see how to check back faces. Red floor access to recast annotations, text info. Oh, there! Thank you. Wait, what? Yeah, that surprises me. Maybe in object mode, if you flip it, it doesn't flip the n normals. But um, in mesh editing mode, it does. That's interesting. I never knew that. Okay, I'm gonna really need to rename. Bleh! I need to rename these. Oh, why have I still got. Okay, hold on. Before I duplicate this, let me just. Check the. Why does this look so weird? <laughs> oh. If you don't apply the scale, it'll show backwards in Unity. I'm not going to pretend I understand that, but okay. So it's just these two. So we do not need root, nothing's uh, attached to that, nothing's attached to that, nothing's attached to that. So these are the two I care about. Okay, now we can duplicate this. Uh, so it's, it's safe to flip this in object mode, or should I do it in mesh editing mode, I wonder? Wait, hold on. Okay. I'll do it in this mode then. The origin is the cursor scale x minus 1. And now the face orientation should be messed up. And now we flip normals. Nice! This is that one, this is this one, this one I want to rename to R, so that it's the right things. It's actually already parented, so this might already work. Let's try it. Looks good. <laughs> I'm so happy about that. <laughs> um. Okay, so if we go to pose mode... And see if this new roller skate moves. Oh my god, it does! Oh, what the fuck is that? So when I made those new vertices, they were not weight painted. I can't weight paint. Uh, this is extremely concerning. Yeah, so the problem wasn't it being duplicated. But it requires artistic skills. I'll have to like make sure that every single Wait, unless it's like an averaging, automatic averaging thing. Yeah, because you've got to like pur purposely hand draw that this one takes up 0 0.8 and the other one takes at 0 0.8 of this one and 0 0.2 of the other one, right? Dab my brush onto? Yeah, but I need to like make sure that it's identical dabbing to the verts around it, right? Otherwise, those particular verts are going to warp differently to the whole rest of the shoe, right? Let me delete that. Let's just do it on this one first. Let's check. Uh, I'm surprised I didn't notice that when I just looked at weight painting. Okay, uh, 
Okay, so look at that there. <laughs> so I need to make sure that this is precisely this shade of orange, I guess. Well, this vertex here. Let me just hide everything that's good, I guess. Can you do that in weight paint mode? No. So somehow I need to make this vertex identical to the average of these three. Sample the color and you can mask stuff. I feel like there must be a script to... Hold on, let me check something. Okay, that's not working. No, I can't really find it. Wait, hold on. No, it's just telling you how to calculate it yourself by the look of it. This... <laughs> Control plus right click to sample the weight. So I need to like sample here, here, and here, I guess, and set this to the sum of these three divided by three. Look, the weight is not precisely one. This is the kind of stupidity that just makes it impossible to weight paint for me. So I need it to be this. Will it there? Wait, how do you actually make it set it immediately so you don't have to wave it over a million times? Did I change a lot when you get to this? It looks really nice to me on the table. <laughs> you can mask stuff to not paint the original ones over. Okay, I need to like hide some of the mesh here because I can't see it. Hold on. Does that carry over to weight paint mode? No, it doesn't. How are you supposed to paint underneath this then? <laughs> uh, uh. In the weight paint mode? Right of where you select modes. This. Click the cube with the vertex selected. This? <gasps> oh my god, that's already better. Wait, can I do this now? No. <laughs> now you can only paint what is selected in edit mode. Okay, well I need to know... <laughs> I guess I just have to switch between really quickly and see. What it is I don't want to select. Uh...
Will I still be able to sample from them? Wait, I just want to to hide. I was supposed to just leave them selected. Hold on. There they are. They're selected now. Wait, so you can only do the ones that are selected? Oh my god. I can't believe there isn't a script to just something that's not weighted. Set it to the average of the surrounding ones. Assuming the surrounded ones are weighted as well, of course. Okay, don't need to worry about that. There is an average brush thing. Average. Uh. Whoa, what is this? Oh my god, I've never had this song in my life. What is this? Wow, I've never heard this. What the hell? How is this in my library and I hadn't heard of it? Um... Okay, so this... Vertex needs to be there. Mm, what are you supposed to use it? <laughs> I see nothing happening. <laughs> Only nothing's happening here anymore either. Oh, well, how's that turned itself back on? Wait, this. Doesn't seem to do what you want there. Yeah, I guess it includes the one that I'm setting in the calculation instead of just the surrounding ones, right? Yes, yeah, so this is like... Yeah, that's what it's doing, I think. Ooh! That's not too bad. Why does it work really well in this direction, but not in this direction? Thanks to Stewie as well now. That looks better. Looks a lot better. But the problem is it's... I've got to do that for every shape, right? Or not? Because it automatically... Look, this is light here. That shouldn't be light. Oh, it doesn't. Oh, of course it doesn't. Oh, 
Oh, maybe it should have been like that. Hmm. I wonder what that looks like if it moves now. Thank you, Stu. Hold on. Sorry. I just wanna... I'm scared. This already looks gross to him, but I guess it already did. Weight painting wouldn't have changed that. Oh my god, what the fuck? Are you seeing that? I don't think it's capturing. When I'm zoomed out at this specific f spot, the whole blender window was flashing. On and off. Like, really quickly. Well, not that quickly. Just at a specific zoom level. We need to have this on the monitor. Alright, let's see. Oppose mode. Uh, I need to see bones. Can't fucking see anything through this bone though. Can I hide this bone? I can. It comes back in fucking pose mode. Why is this program so crap? <gasps> but I can't see the thing that I need to see. It's being covered by a bone. I can't get rid of it. Why is this? Okay, I can see through the bone here. Um. Is that okay? Track thing. Why is it down here? <coughs> Isn't it supposed to be like up where the bone is? Why, why is the rotation control down here? What? Why is the rotation control always down on the floor no matter where, what bone I click? What the fuck? Always the same, no matter what bone was selected. Uh, sorry. Oh, did I? Well, how bad it looks at like extreme positions. That's the real test, isn't it? The further everything else moves, oh look, it's going up. Yeah, it's not moving the same as the other stuff, is it? Where's that? It's meant to be in the show. What am I doing? <laughs> oh, please, just show me the goddamn shoe. Maybe it actually... Wait, maybe that is actually how it's meant to be then. It looks roughly the same there. Thank you for the pants, Fox, and thank you for the hydration, Stewie, and the posture checks, Stewie, Stewie, Stewie. May I ask why you're asking if it's possible to po bleh, paint while posed? Oh my god, I, I need to do this quickly because I'm running out of time. This is not a problem I envisioned happening. Oh, okay, um... I can't... 
These will just have to be scuffed. Despite all the effort I put in, all the effort was actually destroying them. I didn't realize that. That's a slight exaggeration, but making it worse. Okay, so I won. <sighs> this one? Wait, what's. Oh, there is a vertex there. I can't even see it. This one? This one? This one. Uh, this one. Okay, let's just try the smudging. Nice. The roll of no. Uh. Oh my god! <laughs> Out of nowhere, Nano B. What is happening? Why is it? Formaggio. I don't know what I'm changing, but I'm not changing the right thing. Why does it keep changing back to this view? When I undo. Yummy Albi. Oh my god. <laughs> it is this point that I need to change, right? Oh no, there's something. There must be one like around here somewhere. There it is. Okay, I don't want that one. How do I answer like this? Keep clicking it apparently. That is... The smudging is so powerful, what the hell? In a good way. This fall off might not be good. It's like you're just having an effect immediately. Oh, that's better. Uh, smudge power, yeah. Almost completely fix it. Um, hi, Ara. Bye, Ara. I shall look the look while lurking within the lurking. See you. Thank you for the look. Oh God, I forgot to be doing it for the other weights. Vertex group. Do you get copies from the other vertex group or not? There's only copies from the ones selected. It looks like it's okay actually until. Keep at these nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, why is Rainbow Yuxa that? At night time. Looks like it's getting darker there actually. 
<laughs> the fucking contrast. This song compared to the previous one. <laughs> I really like it though. Oh my god, what is that? Oh, Sci-Fi! It was you! Hi, Sai! The, uh, there was a fromage or sound that played just a moment ago, so I thought, oh, okay. I thought, oh, Zai's here, and then I realized, oh, no, wait, it's, it's just a cheese sound. Turns out Zai actually was here. Hi. How's the Zai? Of course it was me, who else would make extremely bad these nuts jokes? <laughs> I didn't even get it. But I guess that's the point. The original actually was mapped in like this radianty way here. So maybe I shouldn't be undoing that. Is that alright? Hi, Zai. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I've bitten off more than I could chew because I thought it would be easy and it's had so many hard points. I don't know what I was expecting. It's Blender after all, but... Zenorin? How does this have a really nice smooth gradient, bottom left to top right? And over here it's like... Something's creeping in over here and... Yeah, I hope you're doing alright. Bottom left vertex? Maybe. Oh! I guess? Yeah, maybe. Maybe not. Blendy's nuts. Oh my god. Okay, maybe that's a bit too violent. <laughs> Scarecrow that was so good, it was outstanding in its field. Oh my god. <laughs> or something, I don't know. Please laugh, I have three kids to feed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I've laughed now, I'm sorry. Oh, it's like, I know you just put the music back up to the usual volume, is that? That's why Robo-Yuke seems so loud in comparison. Okay, there we are. Fixing the volume levels. Okay, because look on here. <laughs> I'm standing in its field. <laughs> Triangulation seems to be the same. Probably just the weights. Yeah, here, look, I'm looking at this thing here that goes from bottom left to top right here now. And we're on this side. That looks about the same. Yeah, okay, I think, I, I think that's better. Was it meant to be so dark all the way up there? Like this is... Maybe it is. Mm. I wonder. Bootla. <laughs> that, that was me booting the... Uh... There's a vertex in the middle there that is making the gradient shorter. This one? Oh my god, this looks so bad on my stream. Hold on, let me just go to Game Catcher instead of Spout. Oh, it still looks that bad, huh? Hold on. Well, I'll go to this view. There you are. Look at that. I'm using the full 8 bits per color channel now. I'm not having to go through Spout. The 
this one? These ones? Wait, what is this? Oh, gradient. Control click to select without the selection box. Oh, okay. That unselected a different one. <laughs> okay. Oh, control and shift, I guess? Yeah, control and shift. Control and shift. Yeah. Nice, thank you. Okay, don't worry, I'm coming back. Hi! Wait, hopefully that'll be okay. I don't see any more horrible standing out unpainted, unweight painted parts. Let's see what happens when we try to pose it now. Thank you, Exia. Wait. I mean, Stewie, not Exia. Exia is the one yeah, that I should yeah, be thinking. Yeah. I am not thanking you for eating me. I promise. <gasps> What did I do as I... I laughed. You can feed your kids. <laughs> Come and pet the Yukonids in the zoo. Okay, let's try to rotate this. Oh! <gasps> it's working. The normals look really bad here, but it's working! Oh shit, didn't see that one. <laughs> Never mind. I'm amazed yet worried. Oh, it's okay. Oh, that's why I need to be locked away. I see, I see. Okay, so it's, it's at the top of the underneath. This little flat piece here. I remember when I knifed that area. Don't say knife mezai, please. Alright. Oh yeah, oh my god. <laughs> that way. And then did it for you. <laughs> That's so cool. Alright, is that it? I wonder if that's it. Maybe I just need myself to be slightly louder to make up for the volume since I'm speaking more quietly. Uh -huh. Oh my god. <laughs> and I guess that that was I. I mean, whoever it was, thank you for, for the bins. Thank you for the suction. Okay. Would this look nicer then, if I were to smooth the normals for this area? <laughs> yeah, well. Indeed. Indeed. Smooth. Holy shit, that made a good difference. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gonna repeat that. A bunch. Oh, it was so promising, then it burned out. Let's do all of the surrounding faces then, I guess. Mm, still not becoming very smooth here. Why? Why? Why are normals a thing? Why do normals exist? Can we ban normals? It's that edge that connects on the middle there. Oh. Material view. Like here? Normalize the banning of normals. <laughs> yes. Just making sure the texture in the thing. Oh. Yeah, it's around the fox. Oh, it's actually going through the fox on the... Well, that's just how the model goes, I guess. Now, in edit mode. 
Is this going to make more unweighted verts? A thin vertical face. Try and get it. <laughs> oh my god, that was loud. With such a emotional sounding song as well. So like the top left vertex of this skinny thing. Or like this pin. Okay. Boop. Oh my god, why am I being bonked now? Someone's too much of a coward to show their face when they farted in mine. Top right. Okay. M. At last. I can show my face. <laughs> Whoa, merge at last? So you're joining these two together? Isn't that gonna mess up the UV? Wait, how is that not... How did that not ruin the UV? It's like the bottom left, and then the one left of that... This? I can't believe you've done this. Merge at last again. Uh, is it because I didn't click? Yes. Interesting. How did you even know that? That's. Ugh. Oh, mind you, there's more areas down here which don't look so good now. Is this another thing where I need to make a split from here to here? Not a split, then... Uh, yeah, try and get it. You can... J... Before... After... Yeah! That fixed it. Well... Yeah, it made it a lot better. Let's look at this one other... Part where I wasn't happy with the normals. Thank you very much, Stewie. That's I don't I don't get it. Is I does Stewie is Stewie the MVP over in your streams as well? Oh my God, look at that. Okay, there's a uh, something here. Oh, well, let me just hide this. Nothing about D, you can't do much over there. Oh, okay. We actually have triangles here. Whoops. This made it even harder to see. It's like this particular normal. Oh my god. Oh yeah, well, don't worry about that. It's behind the shoeless. I wonder if just this one? Can that one just be smoothed? Oh! Alright, I'll take it. I'll take that. This is such a disgusting topology. Oh, I never triangulated it! Oh, no, I did, I did, I did. Just the fact that it was... Transparent was making it look even worse. <laughs> <laughs> you keep your two seconds late for work. Go into the kitchen and make me some money, eh? Also, thanks for putting up with my mischief. <laughs> thanks for putting up with mine. Well, not my mischief, but my nonsense. Thank you very much. Oh my god. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the 690. It was very nice. If you have a very thin face or very short edges... Oh, so you basically want to keep the face density quite uniform on big smooth areas. Oh, okay. Okay. Alright, so we're just going from all of these 
to like just this. Oh, they're not faces, they're vertices. <laughs> ah, it looks like there's something right there that needs to be in the Ah, it's these again. Yeah, I see what you. So in that thin face, I merged it to make a big triangle instead. Yeah, this looks like it should be merged as well, doesn't it? I don't understand how I didn't mess up the UV map. The actual fox icon was fully outside, it didn't change the UVs. Yeah, that, that one would affect the UVs. Unfortunately not. I guess that means the fox ear has now been slightly cut off. Hmm, I honestly don't notice it though. Or at one of them. Boop boop. Merge at last. Merge at first. Hmm. I think I'll just leave it as it is. I doubt that this is even. Oh my god! These might even. These are probably going to be using a shader where you can't even see the, the normals. Anyway, collapse the edge. This one? Oops. <laughs> this one, sorry? Collapse? Wait, what did that say? Hey, does Robert you create? That was interesting to me. I would not have expected her to be as good at that as she was. How does she re... <laughs> Let me find out how she re's. Uh, this is probably going to make her crash a few times. Bear with it. Re! Oh, okay. I thought it would be worse than that. Hakonmerphite sectors. What? Hakonmerphite sectors. <laughs> I see. Merfa. Wait, let me get my shoe back. I lost my shoelace. Okay. Let me see if this poses correctly. I'm happy with it as it is. I never thought I'd say that. Object. Saving, 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 okay. Uh, we click this. We try to pose. We re-enable bones because I can't see chat. We wait for Blender to start responding. There it goes. <coughs> oh no. <gasps> oh, she actually managed. <laughs> it's a uh, repeated percussion. Not percussion. Punctuation that messes her up, I think. So if I had to make, if I, let's say, cat dot 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 dot, wonder what that would do. Cat cat. She's trying. Wait, shit, I didn't. <laughs> no, she's not trying because I didn't do the redeem. Cat cat. Okay, what about... She's still really loud, isn't she? Now she's struggling. I think she's going to time out. Cat cat! <laughs> yeah, we had to have the backup kick in. <laughs> oh well. Let's try just three exclamation marks instead. Is she going to manage? <laughs> I don't think so. Oh my god, why is that so loud? Oh, because volume is a max on me, that'll do. That'll do it. If you just try cat cat with two exclamation marks. Come on, Rover, you can, you can do it. She can't do it. What if I add some additional stuff up? Cat, cat. Shut up. What if I add some additional stuff afterwards? Cat, cat. 
Interesting. Wow, she's like either all completely stuck or not. She's never recovering. Hold on. I'm sorry, I'm just stress testing Robo at this point. There we go. That's what I was trying to get her to do. The old... The old stutter. Cack, kind of. Sponge AI voice, it goes into full stroke mode when there's punk. Yes, 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 exactly. It's the same uh, neural network that it's using. Tachotron 2. Oh, she's really good with that one. It's because it wasn't trained on anything like that. Mine's fine with punctuation because I did add it at the end all the time. But it's not fine if you leave off the full stop at the end. So behind the scenes, if the text doesn't end with the punctuation, it automatically appends the... <laughs> now she's struggling. She was trying to sneeze. I have finished torturing Robo Yuka at this point. Dum -ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. <laughs> it was like. <sighs> Alright. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I don't think she's gonna get through that many exclamation marks. Oh, but I wonder what the backup voice is going to do with those accented characters. Uh, why is it so fucking loud? I turned down the volume. Shush. Okay, now you're at like less than half. Jesus. This voice. Okay, it's quieter now. I'm really sorry. That, that was all really loud. It's hurts my own ears as well, by the way. I, I hear it at the same loudness. <laughs> This is a problem. Right, posing. Swing of problems. Let's try posing. I think it's alright. I think it's actually alright. I occasionally think how quickly our differences worldwide. Would vanish. Okay, here we go. Wait. Zenith? Oh damn, she she scammed you. She actually didn't even try reading past the assets. Uh That was that's what they were called, right? Alright, I think I think I'm happy with this. Well, I'm a bit confused about the normals in this area, but... I'm gonna be honest, it's 12.30am. This needs to be finished, usable in VR chat by tomorrow. Yes, I brought this on myself. Uh, so I think I'll just keep it like that. I don't think anyone's gonna be staring at the extreme detail of the very edge of a shoe. I'm gonna be brutally honest. This is where OCD becomes a really bad thing. This is where the OC becomes a D. <laughs> okay. Zai's ears prick up. No pun intended. Alright, let's duplicate this. Duplicate objects. We're going to mesh editing mode. No, it's not mesh editing mode. Uh, scale, oh, scale on the X to minus one, around the cursor. Oh, that's when I set it to the minus one. Wait, what? <laughs> what? Why only that? Oops, oh my god, I'm flipping getting, this is really bad, I'm getting tired. Hi, Overknacked. I'm getting tired and doing silly things on Blender. Pressing the wrong keys is dangerous. 
Okay, so we flip the normals. Yep. Nuke ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, they're both staring at the time. One of them is really derpy, the other one is <laughs> surprised at the time. Ah, hi, Mark. Welcome back. Okay, so that's good. Bum, 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 bum. And I just set this one to be right. Holy yuke! I can't squeak really loudly. People are trying to sleep. Because. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Alright, that should be it. We'll get out of object mode, turn off this face orientation thingy. <coughs> Holy asthma, yes. I guess so. Holy ASMR. Oh my god, you can't really even make out my hand is just entirely white. Can I just wash out your whole screen? There you go. Amazing. <laughs> pat pat. Light mode pats. <laughs> it's like the music was coming from that screen. When the screen disappears, you can't hear it anymore. I'm sorry, I'm easily entertained. Alright, let me see the bones. Although calling to errands, the bones are not real anyway, so... Oh. Alright, it works. It, it flipping works. This looks so weird. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna... No wait, it's, it's better with them on. I'm taking a screenshot of this, I'm sending it to Kat. There you go, this is a screenshot. No, it's just like a really derpy cat. Wait, let me just... It'll look more silly if I do this. Does that look more silly? I don't even know if that looks more silly or not. I don't think it does. No, I think it looks funnier T posing. Bit of a weird sense of humor. Alright, let's control Z a million times and put it all back. <sighs> Quite some derp stuff made in Gmod. It really does. It really does. <coughs> okay, so what I would like to do now is merge this material uh this uh what am i looking at this wait why can't i see stuff uv editing do i have to click off and back on again oh i'm in edit mode whoops why can't i see stuff in here what's going on oh because i'm on the armature i guess all right let me just merge let me just merge these two together and okay i guess i should make sure that this still fucking works pose mode that moves by itself this one should move by itself let me just test we had each other for one shit i should also have tested this This would be a way that it could fail as well. It looks like it's doing exactly what it should though. Okay. I think I'm happy with that. In fact, I know I'm happy with that. I want some common music. Okay, uh... I think what I'm gonna do is... Yeah, let's try doing that. Mapping of the things together. Oh wait, I'm still on this... Roller skates, there we are. Boop. Hey, there it all is. Okay, so I need to find a space that I can just slot all of this stuff in. Oh, all of this red stuff as well, all of this. 
um, can come down to this area. Whee! There we go. Nice. Not gonna rebake? Yes, I'll do by baking. So I'm gonna go into shading and I'll find uh, one of these other things. Where was it? It was the body. So I should just be able to copy this. This thing. Into any other material, right? For example, roller skates. Paste. Um, and then I need to make an alternative UV map for the roller skates. This is the original. This is the remapped. Is that what I called it for this? Yes, it is. Wait, why does the mask have two UV maps to begin with? What the hell? That's worrying. Um, okay. Worry about that later. So I need to set this one on like that, and this like that. So now, hopefully, if I change... Wait, can I select two things at once? Oh, I'm in edit mode again, what the hell? I wanna be in edit mode. Or do I, actually? Maybe I do wanna be in edit mode. I guess I do wanna be in edit mode. Looks like I can't edit two things at the same time now. Wait, I can! I am editing two things at once! <laughs> Never mind. Alright, materials. Let's hide all of the... Actually, no, I don't even need to edit two things at once. Sorry. Brain slowing down. Please be patient, I have Doohoo. Isn't that what Doohoo's thing said? Okay, let's name this new one as 12. Uh, add the thing, roller skates. Shouldn't take too long. Let's change the image to our remapped body. And let's find some spaces where we can slot this. <gasps> what is that? How did I miss that? Oh, this got changed, didn't they, because of the slicing of stuff. Well, not slicing. Okay, let me just move that. Let's remove that. Um, yeah, let's make a small scale at 0.01. What? Oh yeah, there's two. One for the left for the skates and one for the right. Okay. That should be alright. Let's make a new one now. Remapped. This is the really cool part. Um, wait, why? Hang on a second. Why was I being clapped at? Oh, fact, not. <laughs> I've forgotten the context. Um, okay, so let's have a look at our remapped thing. Find a place to slot these textures. These were all different, right? Let's double check. Yes, these are all different colours. These are the same though, so let me just put these really close to each other. You can really pack in tightly there. Zooming in the wrong places. Okay. Yeah, and everything else is a part of a texture, such as this hole. And this. Alright! Let's let's do it. Make sure to not clear the texture. Yeah. Wait. Shouldn't it bake everything? 
from all the different materials, they should all come together, or does it only do it for the single object that's selected? Like for the body, there are multiple materials. Well, there aren't anymore, it's just the one. But now the roller skates are as separate objects. I haven't yet merged it to the body. Wait! Why didn't I just do that now? I just do that now. Uh, roller skates, body, you are coming together. Ooh. There we go. And, uh... Wait, why did it look like that? Uh... Why does it look like this? <laughs> Oh, because of the UV map, right, the UV map. Um, this, I'll merge them after the remap then. Come back, be separated again. Be separated. There we are. Be separated, thought. Uh, you can increase the texture margin to avoid map mapping the seams later as well. Oh, uh, it's already 16 pixels, so it should be okay. But okay. Um, I'm hoping that'll be enough. Okay, UV editing. Let's find some free spots to put these in. Let's put all these tiny little things in like little gaps where I otherwise wouldn't have space. Don't look too close. I just want to like leave enough space like this distance around this again, so that should be alright. I can put one in there. Wait, actually it doesn't matter if I get very close to the edge. In fact, getting close to the edge is probably a good thing because I will set the texture mode to clamp at the edges so we don't even need extra padding when we're close to the edge then. Can you move from the outside? No, you can't. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna do that. Let's take advantage of that. Let's put these all close to the edge. This is another one. Oh my god, where is it? <laughs> You can go right up there. That sounds incredibly rude. You can come over here. Oh, wait a second, wait a second, there's something I need to consider here. Some of these things I want to be metallic. I want to have a very much, much lower resolution metallic map. So I shouldn't be squeezing these all super close to each other. Um, <laughs> uh, which things do we actually want to be metallic? The, the nuts here need to be metallic. And this metallic. Like, I think that's it. And the screws. They look like they're all the same colour. Let's have a quick look in UV editing mode for this. Rolling blades can. Hopefully. This is all the metallic stuff. No, it's the shoelaces. Oh, we got these as well. Okay, I'll move those over to a different position. This is all the metallic parts in there. And that screw, it's nice. This is... Where is that? Oh, there. Okay. I'm gonna need this to be in a different place. Because this is the metallic. I'm gonna want to make the screws metallic, I think. So let's have a special region. Oh my god, what's happening? Let's have a special region just for these screws. Okay, that's... Keza. The screws. Why Keza? So all of 
these are oh, it's only the front and this one is the side wait where are all the other screws oh here Okay, that's two screws to these. So this is front, outside, outside, and one inside. So somehow, even though I have one, two, three, four, five of these things selected, we're still missing two screws. This one, and this one. There they are. Nice. Okay, so these are those screws. Let's move them all close to each other. Okay, so these are needing to be metallic. So I'll put these into their own little spot there. There's all of them, right? <laughs> it's so tiny. Huh? What? Thank you for the follow, Kiwi. Or Kiwi K? Hi. Welcome, welcome. Uh, this stuff was also meant to be metallic. Oh, that's showing up there as well. What is that? Oh. <laughs> okay. These are meant to be metallic, so I'm going to put these... Oh, they're all metallic. Oh, sorry. So I just need to... I just care about this. Oh my god. This. Is it these? All of this? Or only this is what I mean? Is it only these? This would be better. Okay, so that's also meant to be metallic. So I'm actually gonna drag this down to there. What is this? Something in this region? No. Oh, something that's already in the metallic region. Okay. So these will all be metallic. What? Invalid selection? Oh, L. Sorry. I was trying to select it. press L instead of... Yeah, I was pressing J thinking that it would select things that are joined, but the shortcut is actually L for things that are linked. Look at that, 20 goddamn triangles! Let me make sure they were still within our limits. Blender crashed. <sighs> when did I save? 11 minutes ago. Fine. I'm honestly surprised it's the first time it's crashed out of all of these Blender streams so far. So the screws were here. Let's move them into their own area and bring them back together. So these get to be in their own spot. But in there. This is mm. 
the metallic thing that goes down there. <coughs> there we are, I think that's pretty much sums up everything I did in the last... How long was it? Uh, 11 minutes? 10 minutes? Alright, save. Uh, I have so much stuff loaded that I can't actually don't that load anymore. Can't fit any more on my screen right now. Uh, sorry, in my taskbar it's overflowing, which is really annoying. Okay. Can't say it's a good name. Welcome, welcome, hi. Um, how are you doing? Thanks for stopping by. Speaking of stopping, I should be stopping sometime. But, uh, not right now. This is turning into a late night stream, huh? For me, it is. Not, not the thermometer at the, the, the time. Uh, oh, it's Saturday today now. The, the day has changed to Saturday. I'm glad. 2.54 uh, a.m. Glad you're doing all right. Uh, comfy or nighter? Oh, it's not going to be nocturnal. I'm oh, sorry, it's not going to be an all-nighter. <laughs> it is nocturnal. Eh? <laughs> uh, extremely relatable. Okay, let's start positioning these things. So the things that are meant to be metallic are this and this, right? Yes. So let's put those down into just a corner all by themselves. Um, like right down here, I guess. How big a gap do we need? So it stretches out like this far, there's like one, two, three mouse pointer widths. <laughs> so as long as I keep these six mouse pointer widths apart, that'll be fine. Somewhere around there. One, two, three, four, five, six, should be around. I think it's time I go to sleep. No worries, Cardi, thanks for hanging around. Sleep well. How does September look for you? Uh, 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 I'm not sure what you mean. There's some nice stuff planned, I guess, IRL stuff, but... Mm. But because it's IRL stuff, that means I'm a bit busy, I guess. Wait, why am I still so close to the camera? Sorry about that. I'll get out of your face. That's the white stuff of the shoes, laces and the trim. This was... Some plastic parts. This was... More plastic parts. I mean, for me it's usually fewer noisy neighbour kids, but this year it's less noticeable. Ah, right, yes, because they've gone back to school after the summer holidays. Uh... Excuse me. Uh, I haven't really noticed that much. They weren't super noisy for me. This time. <laughs> Wait, am I changing the right thing? Yes. Oh my god, thank god I'm moving the remapped ones and not these ones. Wait! Shit. I was removed. I was. Hold on. Where is everything? Okay. This should have been on the original, not the remap. So let me remove the that. This now becomes the original. This now becomes remapped. Basically, original is the source. We're gonna it's gonna copy the texture from these locations. Oh wait! Then I need to, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> What's going on? Uh, which thing's which? That's all the shiny wheel stuff. 
And this is the the screws. Okay, that those can come over to there. These can go back to there. Now, the original is correct. Now I can make a remapped version where I choose where I want them to become on my master or remapped texture. This one. Oh, I'm so glad I noticed I'm missing. These can go down there. This is our metallic corner. This region of the metallic map will be black. Or white, sorry. And we can go right to the edge because it's going to use clamp texture mode. I tried modeling something before, it's kind of time consuming. It really is! Um, I thankfully I didn't actually do the modeling of this. Well, I did end up editing the mesh quite a bit, but, well, a little bit. Um, yeah, a friend of mine did texturing and uh, the base model is a V-Roid model. It was like a free character modeling software and then I sort of kid-bashed some other things together. But yeah, I could certainly not say that I modeled this. I'm just making a, trying to make a really optimized version for VRChat right now that will have uh, not many materials. Um, I'm reckoning that I can get it to the good, oh my god where are we, good classification, this column. <laughs> We're all good on polycan um, because that's uh, you know, I'm not adding any more vertices. Um, texture memory is going to be low because there's going to be not many textures. I'm pretty sure I can get that comfortably below 75 megabytes. Probably more like 30. 30 to 40, let's say. Uh, and materials. That's the real one that I'm knocking d down now. Merging together. Which, in turn, is going to mean fewer textures, which means less VRAM as well, so yay! Win, win, win! Night is always calm, quiet, it's comfortable to stay awake, and generally I just can't sleep. I, I can't just sleep until I cannot stay awake. Uh, I, too, have sleep issues. Um... During the summer, they're like wasp hive that broke down. Oh my god, everywhere they go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what was cabbage things so close? Especially if we're doing a high and low poly. I'm not gonna do a low poly version. <laughs> Four pound balancing idea, I guess so. Pretty much work on unity. Uh, I actually that yes, I actually do usually just do stuff on unity. Obviously, this is Blender right now. This is a previous finished version of the avatar, but so basically this is what I'm optimizing, which involved re-putting everything together on Blender as well. This isn't a high to low poly workflow anyway, lol. This would be the low poly. This would be the low poly? Huh? <laughs> Certainly wouldn't call this low poly. Is there any reason to prefer Unreal? Maybe you like C, C++? I certainly prefer C++. Or C and this over C sharp. But uh, Unity is more relevant for me because um, because of VR chat basically. The reason I started to make this streaming setup, so everything that's like moving around here is part of this Unity streaming setup. I'm sure most people are sick and tired of me saying that, but it's true. Uh, and that started from uh, the project for my VR chat avatar. Thank you, Siri. I like had a project with my avatar, as you have to do if you're gonna upload an avatar on VRChat. Unless you're gonna pay someone to scam you to upload it.
it is XJump because VRChat itself is made in Unity and the way that you upload avatars is essentially, it essentially uploads them as like a Unity asset bundle. Like an avatar is essentially a, well it is, an asset bundle. And some metadata in the thumbnail, <laughs> which I don't think are included inside it. Don't know why, but they're not. It's low when your high poly's poly count is in the six to seven figure range. Okay, true. I really like Zig when it stabilizes. Maybe, maybe. I have been interested. Like, it sounded interesting to me. Alright, let's move these things over to their own places. This does not need to be reflective or anything like that, so let's move it up here. It's such a feel-good song at this point. It becomes less feel-good in a moment. I still like it though. Alright, let's take this. Bring it up to here. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I've lost it. Where is it gone? Didn't want to come with me. Sad. Understandable though. Okay. This can come over here as well. I'm trying to keep a big enough gap between them so that when it's scaled down by like 16 times it's still gonna be okay. Not too close to other things. Uh, close to the edge is good though because texture mode will be clamp. That should be okay. Alright, that just leaves this, the, uh, like the eyelets of the shoe, that is. Oh. Oh, yeah, and some other dark stuff in the middle of it. And then this, the black on red fox on the bottom. And this, the red on black fox on the side. And all the other black stuff. Right, I think I'm gonna move this off to the far side. Wait, go do body for that. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh. <laughs> Let's move this up to there, I guess. No, oh, not quite there. Maybe there. Um, and something else can be lower down. Oh, no, I think I have to rebake it at this point. I've moved too much for me to keep in my mind. Uh, how does Zog ever turn this on, right? Yeah. All engines have their quirks, but there's flaws and then there's fatal flaws. Yes. Oh, please upload your high poly models already. Oh my god, yes, please. Six figures is already too much. Yeah, six is where I start. Uh, unless it's like... Yeah. If it's like... Yeah. <laughs> it, six figures is a lot. I can't really say much against it. Well, it depends what you're using them for. Like, if you are making it for, you know... Like a film, it's fine. But if it's in VR gemmas... Tone it down a little, I guess. Oh, a lot of people now are having <sighs> huge models thanks to VR chat. Uh, having the parameter system basically, I guess, so that you can have different outfits. The reasons to not prefer learning a new language, new UI, documentation. Yes. Difference. Difficulty for Unreal games get its file and size inflated. I'm uh, flipping on. Uh, don't worry, Unity does as well. This is the theme of inflated. Uh, you know, I think I need common music now. I'm gonna go to my calm playlist. Sorry. <laughs> right, it's time for some calm. Shh. Okay. Sorry. Um. Wait, what, if Paul? You think if there will be a VR chat successful a big update? 
can't find the message. Oh, there. They'll move away from Unity? I don't think the VR chat devs will. But there may be a competitor. Do hard surface anyway, so my high quality meshes are always for baking down to a low quality. Ah, oh, interesting, interesting, interesting. Speaking of baking, let's do some baking right now. You are supposed to have this turned on, aren't you? It's supposed to be on the already... This is what, like, it captures from rain? I think so. The tooltip implies otherwise, but let's find out. So I have to do this to force Blender to realize that it needs to redo the thing. This is selected on this material. On the roller skates. Uh, let's not worry about the metallic map, I can work that out myself. Wait, wait, let me just double check metallic. <laughs> okay. So originally they only wanted the, the black screws, I think that was, to be... No. Okay, something... I don't remember what it was. Whatever. I'll, um... We'll do it some other way. I don't care about the metallic map for now. I would like to remove metallic entirely, because we'll do it with a map instead of a second texture. Oh my god. Why is his body looking like this right now? Is it because of this? Wait, why does this look so fucked up now? <laughs> Hold on, what? Wait, why is body set to RS metallic? What? Okay. So I think you do need to have this selected when you're gonna take from the material. So I have to put it back to the wrong material in order to bake it, right? Or not? I guess I have to have it on the wrong material in order to bake it. Uh, roller skates. Remove the metallic thing. That should be deleted soon. The old material, the original material, which the UV map is no longer correct for. Need to be on the material you want to make from. Yes! Hold on. So it needs to be like set to the wrong material and the wrong UV map. Wait, why is the wrong UV map not fixing the arms? The skin of the arms should look correct on this one, right? Uh, I don't know why the... The arms are broken on this. This is concerning. Uh, where's body main? Oh, it was 10, wasn't it? Or 12, 10. Body main. Oh, body main is this. Oh, it's a new one! Okay, I should rename that. Body... Remapped is what I should have called that. Okay, so I need a new thing that uses image number 10, whatever that is. Uh, image 10 is visible in here, but it's not visible 
in here for some reason. Oh my god, just let me on it. I guess I will not have that on body remapped then. Wait, where do you want this? Oh my god, this is so confusing. I guess I'll delete that. Or maybe leave it so I can copy it. And I'll copy all of this to a new material. Let me make a new material. Do you have to make a slot and then delete the slot or something? Okay. So... Clipboard is empty. Why? Body Auric should have that, Body Remapped should not have that. This should be set to 10. Okay. So if I now set this to Body Auric. Nice, that's correct. And Body Remapped would look correct if I used this UV map. Okay, nice. I get it now. So that is the body auric, and we will uh, we force this to not get deleted. In. This one as well. Uh, this one as well. Don't care about the metallic. Oh my god, there's still all the hair to do. Uh, you need it to be on the material you want to bake from. Yes, remember that it bakes to a texture, not to a material. Okay, so I wanted to bake from the original body on this slot. Do I need to go here? Ah, oh, okay. So these two things I wanted to bake from. Okay. <laughs> the way the music sounds like it's speeding up because the food bars gradually removing more and more silence. Hi, Fox! Yeah, sorry, this is a really long one. <laughs> oh, congratulations, maybe? RPG Maker uses JavaScript? Uh oh. I never knew that. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I'm sorry. Now I know why I'm sorry. Because I said sorry. Okay, so on this one, this is selected. On this one, this is selected. We go here, and we should be able to bake. <laughs> Let's see if it works. Let me just make sure this is correct as well. Remapped is selected. I'm not sure if that matters. I don't think it does. Alright, let's click bake and see what happens. It is going to remap the body. Boop! Mm, Kuda goes brr. There we are. Let's have a look on the correct thing. It has done nothing! <sighs> it thinks it's done something. It's got an asterisk here now. Does that mean it's new? Okay, I don't know why this has stopped working again. But it looks like we're back into the stage where... It doesn't work again. Do you have the texture selected in the material? Yes, I do. Um, no, 
I know, Cabbage. I'm watching you, but not here anymore. Sorry, okay. Right, I'll try. And are you baking the right thing? I tried to bake the body and the roller skates, and it baked neither. Thank you for the pads. I need them. The... this thing was meant to be on this auric, right? I wanted to come from this... to this. Wait, I don't remember... I don't remember what this giant city head is. What is this giant head? I thought I fixed that. Oh my god, I keep whistling through my teeth. I guess it's a material that's... Wait, do I need to re-add the other textures on here? So they will bake from the head as well? I want to select the new one and use the old one in the material. Select the new one and use the old one in the material. I don't know what you mean. I'm talking about UV maps, I don't know how to select a UV map in a material. But I've just realised I'm going to need to add one here. I'm going to need to add... Okay. Let's do this a different way. I can't remove the thing that I just selected, even though I could add it, what the fuck. I'm going to do this a different way. Please hold. I'm not going to rebake. Well, I guess I will rebake the thing that's already in here. So that's give me a, give me a sec, one sec. I need to set this all up. Hold on, sorry, 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 sorry. So this material. What is auric body and auric body skin? What's the difference? What the hell? On earth? <laughs> guess I don't need this one then. I guess I should be deleting that one. And it's... This one is what I actually wanted. Okay, so... But we don't want this here anymore, so we can cut that. And paste that onto here. So essentially we're gonna bake the original remapped or the, the remapped ah, ah. we're gonna bake the original remapped body onto itself What is happening? Why is this sound repeating? <laughs> oh, you are actually playing multiple times, I see. I was confused because sound alert spot wasn't doing this. Not too shabby! <gasps> Let me pat your head! Ah! Thank you for the pants! <laughs> Wait, no, I can't do that because it needs to copy from the original location. <sighs> oh my god. This is so confusing. Ah, my head. Thank you for the bits. Last five bits? Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, uh, I'm not sure how to do this then. I would need to like re-add all the old materials back. And reassign them to the different material slots. This is a horrible situation. Should I just keep two completely separate versions of this and they'll use the same materials? Might be a good idea. So, the original... The original 
Um, I disable redeems for a moment. It's because I, this is like a really complicated thing that needs to be sorted before the world in like t uh, less than 20 hours. Pat, pat, and I gotta sleep between now and then. They're the pats though. Sorry for having the stream suddenly become serious. Uh, thanks, Fox. Uh, okay, so what I need to... Here's, here's how, how things were. This body originally had four materials... Well, two that I care about, two materials. It had the bodysuit and the skin. And it had this little, this, this smooth red, like, skull cap like thing. That's interesting, what the hell's going on there? Oh, it's just the edge of the, it's just the edge of the, okay. So, that's how it used to be. So there used to be two materials here, on the body. So the UV map, the original UV map, looks like this. Which is basically like this stuff, rearranged a bit, plus this giant thing here that is the skull cap thing, okay? Um, could you just use the new UV map? But I need it to copy from the original texture now. Because I needed to recopy this foot. Um There is this one though, can't Because I'm moving the foot, I need it to be moved. To make space for other things in this area. Just move it in this UV. That's kind of scary. I was hoping I could keep originals of everything and just move things as I need it. Because every time I move it, unless I like, I'm super careful with aligning it, which I wasn't with this, I just realized. Oh, but it's already rotated, so who cares? Put in the right place to match the texture. I can't do that. Like, what? So I have to. I can't. I don't. I don't know where it was. You can't. Like, I'm trying to get this like perfect. I can't... I can't want to just eyeball things. That's just asking for things to be terrible. I'm trying to make, make like a... Like a formulaic way of doing things. Like let the program do the work. I'm not artistic, so... <laughs> I've moved it now. So I need to like remake this material. I have the material still, so... I think. Yeah, I do, because I marked it as forced. You would need to duplicate the remapped one. Alright, let's make a new material here. And it's... The hair back. I'm gonna make an entire copy of everything, I guess. Somehow. Why is it just the armature? What the fuck? What the hell? Uh, can I duplicate the rest of it? <laughs> what the fuck? Huh? Why can't I duplicate everything? Thank you for the follow, by the way. Doesn't copy by default, just what is selected. Okay, if I do this, is it gonna be everything? Because there's like some stuff inside here that's not selected. Can I like expand everything? Oh, select hierarchy. Is that selected everything? Hadn't selected the visor. Hadn't selected the mask. Uh, 
Sonic the Hierarchy again. Okay. No, it's not copied everything. It's still not copying everything. Uh, is there really not a way to like expand the tree? Oh my god, you can't even press the right arrow key to expand everything either. <sighs> Shift click the down arrow. This one? Oh my god, okay, thank you. Is there no scroll? Oh, there is. Okay, nice, thank you. No, oh, not linked, I don't even know what that means. This is just a new one or okay. There's only one, right? I think there's only one. Oh I see, I see. Uh it won't duplicate materials, right? The shading tab stays untouched. It's still not copied everything. Oh, I've lost the body as well on both now. What the fuck? Just pressing undo a whole bunch. Before moving the foot, yes, I've got UV maps. Oh, you mean oh, it saves. But <laughs> yeah, yes. Okay, nice. Uses auric body with yeah, just that and it used the back of the hair. Use to fix the foot. Yeah, okay. I kind of want a system that I can use. Uh, repeatedly, if you know what I mean. I, I can't really work myself right now. I'm really sorry. I'm just trying to do things. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm panicking to get anything ready before tomorrow. Evening. It's so hot in my room right now. What did I say? Uh, no idea. Sorry. A sign. Okay, we've got that back. Um. No, no more history. You are helping. So now it is using that material on here, which is nice. And on this one. Wait, did it even copy the mask and stuff? 
He didn't copy the mask, because it was disabled. This program is shit, I'm sorry, I'm just gonna say it. Okay. Let's really turn everything on, make sure the eyeball on everything is turned on. Hold on. Maybe I should do this first. Why does it not copy if it's not visible? That's so stupid. That's so stupid. Why? Do things just not exist if you can't see them? Because if you press A to select them in the edit mode on the mesh, it still selects them even though they're not visible. I'm not doing well. I'm just ranting, I'm sorry. Okay, I think everything's there now. Rollerblades. This, 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 and this. And this, and this. I think all of the things are there. So I'll try copying them all again. And then... Go back to the top. Shift click. Okay. This is armature source. This one has a body, it only has one UV map, the material, it has another one. It's the back of the hair. And the back of the hair is this. So we select that. And then wait. Oh, it's the stats that are changing. I thought it was changing something on my head at first. Out of the corner of my eye I saw something over here moving. Okay, so that uses that. That's not what I meant to do. Okay, so now we have that. This is the original body as well. So hopefully now we can. <coughs> oh my god, it's going to take so. How big is this file now? This is not the folder I want. This is... Oh! 22 megs. Okay, I was expecting like... 50 or something? Okay, so shading. Original body has this as a target, which is nice. The... Auric hair back... Also has this as a body, so nice. And the remapped does not have that as a source. Okay, everything's good. So hopefully, if I go over to here, and I find this. Let's look at something a bit less crazy. Okay. To make a new save, this is going to be a uh, with source for auto remapping baking bottom. Uh, I'm naming the texture remap, so now that's what I'm start calling it. <laughs> so this one has all this stuff there, which is nice. And wait, which one are we looking at? Oh shit, I should be looking at this one. The source, sorry. The body here. Okay, that has all of that stuff. Good. And it's using both materials. Okay, good. And the roller skates. Which are turned off, yeah that's still visible. Oh, there we are. Okay, the roller skates have these positions on the Auric and these on the remapped. So let's just keep only the Auric for these. Wait, is that right? Should I be using Auric for these? Yes. 
ice is broken there. Oh, that should be the original body. Okay. And the new one has the remapped and just that. Okay. <sighs> so, hopefully, if I save. This texture has this as a sort destination and it's selected. This one has this and that selected as well. So hopefully, when I click bake, both of these things are going to end up on here. Just reload that, I guess. Or like replace it somehow. And you've kind of to jump into a few aspects of blend on short notice. Oh, thank you. Thank you for giving me some credit. I'm not sure if I deserve it. This body has remapped. No, oh, I'm not carrying my body roller skates, so I'm going to make sure they're in the right position. Yes, they are. Okay. So, let's try the baking, I guess. This is like a world, a scene wide thing, right? So, it doesn't matter which of these I have selected, I guess. As long as this is selected. Image is ticked. Uh, let's try bake. Uh, what? <laughs> what? This ended up with the stuff that I don't want. Some of it hasn't even copied. Oh, all of it hasn't even copied. Uh, I feel like everything I thought I knew yesterday is not... I did not know it correctly. Do you need to have this clicked? Do I, does this need to be highlight, highlight, highlighted here? Is that the problem? Okay. want to bake too. Okay. Okay, try again then. I think I have to do this, right, to make it do anything. You need the texture node selected. Okay, I think I do, yeah. If you feed me, I will never leave you because I need the food. What are you baking? I'm trying to bake the uh, original body and the original roller skates. But welcome in, welcome in, Karad. Uh, again, neither have been baked. What are my bake settings? Exactly what they were when they worked yesterday. Everyone was saying different things and this ended up working, so I really don't want to change it. Um, the problem ended up being that this was like, it thought it was the same. It's put stuff in the right area this time, it's just not used the right source, I guess. They don't look right. Yeah, I know. <laughs> what would you have them said to? 
It's baking emit. Yes. Well, that was just taking it from this. So that's that's more worked before. Put color into emission. Put color into emission. Or change it to color. Unfortunately, color's not one. Change the bake type to diffuse. Okay. Wait, I didn't do the image reloading thing. <gasps> Wait! It worked! Wait, hold on a sec. Is that correct? Some stuff has worked. Is this all correct? Hold on. Uh... How do I see the... Oh. Fucking stupid. Okay, it hasn't done something here. I reload the texture. I need it to clear though, because this needs to move. I am, I am having to whisper at the moment, I'm sorry, it's, 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 it's this time. Um, I'll have a look, give me a sec. I'm sorry, by the way, um, um, Sir Karanat, it's, or Karat, 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 um, I'm sorry that I'm like, not paying huge attention. I'm kind of really trying to get a thing done, but welcome. I do appreciate you being here. I can't feed you though, I'm afraid. Uh... The original body run. Right, 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 okay. Uh... Hold on, so this part here... Is originally... Here... Inside... This texture. But, so it should have copied the black region from this one, down into here. Wait, is it because I made it smaller than the pixel and I reduced it to one sample per pixel? No, because it should be sampling from that. No, I don't think that's... Is it using the right UV? Well, remapped is clicked. Go in the material for the shoe. This one. Am I winning? Uh, uh, not sure. On the texture it is using. The one that goes into base color. Yeah, that's this one. Drag the vector input to the left. Vector input? This? The purple dot on the left of the nodes. Drag the vector input to the left. Uh, yeah, it's 2.92? Yes. Add a UV node. UV map? Connected, I guess. The source or the destination? Okay. Is 
This is interesting. I feel like I'm starting to understand slightly, but I thought I did yesterday as well. <laughs> now I go to the other slot. The other source material? This one? Well, this one has a load of stuff. I guess I should select this. Was I? Mm, I'll, I'll undo that. Add a texture node. Is it meant to be this one? Okay. Thought it was. Should this here say Auric? If I do, it'll be thanks to Stewie. <laughs> if you change the material in here, it applies to that material. If it applies that material to the shoe now. If you change the material in here. I can't say I understand. Should I have this set to Auric? This is the old material, by the way. There are two old materials. Shoe material. Okay. Select texture note. This one, right? Like the destination. Don't change material at the top. Okay. Is the shoe and the body just one mesh? No, they're not at the moment. I can make them, but I thought it would be making things more confusing if I did that. So like the body mesh. Ah, I see what you mean now. Okay. I just want to double check roller skate. Okay, nice, I see. Uh, okay... I didn't do the image clear thing... ...on here. Oh, and it's changed again. Wait. <laughs> okay, I don't know what that is at all. Oh god. the body material. Yes? On the body? The... there is only one on the source. It's the original I selected. The same material is being used over here though, and remapped is selected. <laughs> This, the, on the source, Oreg is the one I wanted to come from. And on the destination, the remapped is what I wanted to go to. It's baking on the bus. I'm confused. So wait, has it overwritten? Something else? Oh, well, that looks like it's still there. And that looks like it's still there as well. Both have the same material with the texture selected. Oh! Right! Shall I, uh, select something? No, wait, they're sharing the same material though. Duplicate the material. Hold on a minute. It shouldn't be the same material. It shouldn't be the same material. I've done something wrong. 
One of them should be the remapped. This one should be this. That's what it should be. <gasps> Cat! Thank you for the raid! Hi! There you go, Stray. It should have been that, sorry. On here. Welcome, welcome, welcome! Did you do another stream? What were you up to? Remove the texture node from the auric material. Okay, uh... Dumb fox cat. Welcome, Ali! Hi, Fox Finale! Again! <laughs> Let's see what you're up to. More art? Oh, four days ago, never mind. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> right. What were you up to this time? Welcome, Uni! I'm trying to give pants, nothing's working. There we go, there we go, there we go. Got it, got it, got it, got it. I'm really sorry, I'm like scrambling right now. Okay, so on. Ignore that. So this is on the source body. This is here. Muted stream, just drew Dara's commission. Oh, nice! Wait, Dara made a commission? Oh, wait, it's Auric hair back. Sorry, Auric body skin. There, okay. Those two. Should I just bake again now, stream? Because it's a custom shader. Yeah. I mean, it did work on Emit before. I mean, I can just not have any of this crap. I don't need any of this. This is just like what happened because I made it a... Um, Oh, that's why I needed emit on the body. I see, I see. That's cool though, Kat, that you were doing something for that. Video 10 minutes. Uh, okay, good luck, welcome. I'm very sorry, Kat. I'm kind of, I'm glad that you muted, that you streamed without straining your voice though. Okay, so can I just make this a normal one? I guess I can copy it over from the... Here, right? I guess I can copy all of this. Um... Wait, there's normals and shit as well, though. I'd have to copy all the normals over. <sighs> I should have just fucking had listed in Photoshop as always. This is so confusing. Um, yeah, there are normal map textures and stuff that I need to copy over to the textures as well. Are there normals? For an... Oh, the normal texture, as in principle BSDF, has a slot for this as well. Oh, but it's purple, not yellow. I, I want to take it from what's current, though. There is a normal map node. This one, I guess. Oh, you can take it from color? Ah, oh, okay, 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 okay. Nice, nice, nice. For soggy, oh, I see. Oh, you mute just because of the headache, I see, I see. Oh, welcome in everyone. I'm really sorry I'm not doing well at greeting anybody right now because I'm trying to concentrate on a thing. I'm sorry I'm a terrible, horrible streamer. You should never watch me in your entire life. Okay, bye. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, so I guess I can just copy all of this and paste this onto Why the two? What the fuck? They're the same thing. They shouldn't be two. I'll just do this, I guess, because it won't ever actually delete it. I guess I could have called it Auric Body. Hold on, I know I'm destroying everything at the moment, I'm sorry. Why did it not paste? I cut this and then didn't paste it. Select. Cut. Paste. 
Why isn't... That, that's not what I put on the clipboard. What the fuck? Cut and paste doesn't work? Why does that not work? Control X, Control V? Huh? What the fuck? Is this a blender bug? Or is it a feature? Control C, Control V. Okay. So Control C delete is what I need to do. This program. Absolutely not all coming. Um, bye bye, bye bye Kent. Thank you very much for stopping by. Sorry that it's a weird stream tonight. <laughs> okay, so this one needs to be deleted. This one can have this. This one has this. Now I take the thing from here. Control says delete with reconnect. What the fuck does that even mean? Um. R S. Oh, it's already selected. Okay. Control C. Body. Wait, it has emission as well. Oh, shader underscore numblock. Okay. Oh my god. Oh. I can't redo the emission as well. I don't want Cat to have to redraw the emission. I think I might give up. I don't think this isn't getting finished before tomorrow evening, is it? I gotta sleep before now and then I still gotta have dinner. It's not your fault at all! You've been helping so much! This is absolutely my fault. Just thinking I could do a blender thing in a week. Yeah, to be fair, I didn't think I'd have to redo the making of the model, which, like, took, I guess, like, a couple of days, but, well, a day, maybe, I don't know. <sighs> okay, let's paste this. Why is this hair? Hair? No, it's not that Can I just... I just want to try a thing. Thank you, Kat. I mean, I know I just fucking brought this on myself. You didn't ask for any of this. But I really wanted to be able to do something for you. I thought this was the thing I'd be able to do. Um... Okay, so this is the base. I guess so. Are the roller blades meant to be like that? Did we retexture them? By which I mean, did you retexture them? Uh. Oh, there is a glow layer. Okay, nice. A glow texture. Did I, did I use that or did I use this? I probably used this. Sheesh, it's doing well. Is the new mesh and the regular mesh the same apart from the UVs? I... Uh, think so. I think so, yeah. 
I think so. For the Blender can't load Photoshop things as textures are in. I think you might need the Auric UVs and the new UVs in the same mesh. Can I copy a UV? <laughs> Can I copy a UV map from one thing to another thing? How does one do this? You're very. Oh, what the fuck, you? What the fuck, you need you way too kind. I don't deserve this. I'm failing right now, but thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, Stewie's a real MVP here. I wish I could donate something to Stewie. Donate something or, or copy UV map. One object at the top. <laughs> One object and the top. One object at the top. One object. This? Copy objects. Oh no. The new fix. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Stewie. <laughs> I'm scared of using the new version because when I try to use the new version to. I try to use the old version to open a new version thing, I can't anymore, so then I'm locked into the new version. I watch Russian streamer the work of the Falcon as me, but sometimes he need about a week or two to make a little test, little feature to work. Take a rest. Oh, oh, okay, soon. I'm not gonna go too late, don't worry. I will stop before it gets too late. I, I will, I promise, I promise. Tonight, I mean. F3? But Vulcan, the Vulcan is a uh, copy UV. Wait, it wouldn't be in here, would it? It would be over here, maybe. Copy mirrored UV code. Well, three D people. Copy UV. I guess it's not a thing. Oh, does it need to be out of edit mode? Mm. Copy data. There's copy objects, which I saw before, but I doubt that's it. Okay, uh, let's not worry about it. Let's see if we can set up an Oreg body that works the same way as... That works the same way as the old original body. Which used 10 as the source <coughs> and something else for the normals. No idea what the. Oops. Just before three point five one. Eleven. Yeah, that is the okay, that's the same. Nice. Oh my god, okay, it's three, please don't actually might be called transfer. Don't stress too much. This is I put this on myself. I don't want to make you stress as well. 
transfer. It's doing a lot of transform stuff. Oh, it's a modifier. <laughs> I don't even remember hiccuping. Full black bodysuit cat looks like a cool secret agent. <laughs> it kind of does. Imagine if we just had this, but with your emissive thing. So just like the, the glowing thing. Uh, wherever that is. Oh my god, there's so much stuff. Where is the glue stuff? Oh, your face glows there. Mask is there. Can't see the glue for your body soon. I mean, it's here somewhere because it glows when I open it in VR chat. You put it on the object to copy data too, so on the... <laughs> That's cool cat. Oh my god, that looks so cool with a load of bloom. You put it on the object to copy data too. Okay, hold on. Let me add another one. We need... We've got a normal map already, nice. So we need... Uh, we need to add... Converter? Oh no, sorry. Texture. Image. And this is gonna be 11. Plug that into there. That was weird for a second. Wait, let me turn this off. Does it change anything? I don't see anything change. But that's how you use it, right, Stewie? You put the image into this, and then that comes out into normal? Strength is zero. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, it's up to ten. Oops. Okay, that's normal. That's a good way of testing it. Look, it's really ripped, cat. <laughs> Or flabby cat. Uh, okay, hold on a sec. Object relations transfer mesh data. Object relations transfer mesh data. This is the source. So we want to move it from the here, right? I want to transfer this onto from here, right? Select both meshes. Is this a mesh, by the way? Or is this a mesh? Is the orange triangle or the green triangle? Okay. This. And this. Should I have selected them the other way around, I wonder. Now, with UV... Now, the one with UV is selected, and the one without is active. Okay. Bye, Cabbage! No worries! Thank you very much for stopping by! I was hanging around for a long time, actually. Hi, devil. Have fun. I'll try. <laughs> the tool transfer from selected to active. Okay. Nice. Gonna transfer data mesh thing. This one? Oh, other way? Active to selected. Okay. So we'll do this. This. Okay. Object. Relations... this? UVs? I would assume. Oh. <laughs> Alright. 
this is the destination, there's still all the, uh, you know, thing. And this... <clears throat> I still only see one. Try a thing. Gradually undoing and undoing and undoing. There we are. Okay. Oh, are you thinking of making a second UV thing inside the... in here so it has a place to copy to? Okay. I'm gonna name it the same anyway. I even named the same. I'm renaming this instead. It's like the UV you want to copy on the first one. Hi Neil, I'm trying. I'm sorry. Okay, body remapped and on here. Where do I need to expand it? Body remapped. Okay. Hi David, I am. I usually am still awake though. Don't worry. That's not a new thing. Hydrate and stretch. Oh, okay, should I should. <laughs> Sorry. But hi, David. And Neil. Make sure the one that actually has the UV is active. That's the last clicked one, right? Try it again. It shouldn't matter like this camera icon, right? Ooh, that's much more promising. Okay. Let's look at this one now. gone wrong somewhere. Change the settings this time. Oh, well, I'm kind of almost alive. Oh, I meant this shape though. That was the weird thing. I don't know how many times I have to click undo for it to undo. Is it undone? No. Wait, no. Do it this way. Okay. Hold on. What? What? Something's wrong with the remapped thing. Remapped is like... Something's wrong with remapped. Oh, is it because I have more than one thing selected? Okay, so those two are the same. And... Ah, yes, you're right. It was because two things were selected. Phew! Yes. Okay. So things are actually as we, as we thought they were. What was this other thing you wanted to try in the settings? Settings you can change after doing it. Okay, so this is selected on this one. And on this one. So you select this one. And then this one. Uh, Stewie. Uh, I hate to mention this, but there's a very, very easy way that we can get this back. All I need to do is delete this and reduplicate this. <laughs> I just realized. Yeah, 
Has it originally of you on the first one? Yes. No, I do. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for wasting your time. Oh my god, why isn't it nearly did everything? Then I don't need the second mesh at all? Well, I do, because... The... It, it has, like, multiple materials beforehand, but afterwards it doesn't have multiple materials. Right? Because I'm combining all the multiple materials into one. So for this one, I was going to have it with all of the multiple materials, with, like, the different uh, materials assigned on the different vertices. And on this one, all of the vertices use the same material, and there's only one material. Why did it not delete? How do you, like, delete a thing? It's selected actually everything. Oh my god, is it because it turned off? It's because it was turned off. <laughs> there is a delete hierarchy actually, thank you. Didn't realize. Okay. So, let's make another copy of this. Um, okay. I'll call this uh, Metro Source. Um, this one can. I'll put the materials back for the body. This one wants to use this UV map with this. Oh my god, why is it purple now? What the fuck? What? And this. Oh, there's nothing in here anymore. Did I choose the wrong one? Is it Oric body? Is it Oric body skin? Oric body, okay. Why is Oric body skin still there? I swear to god. I keep trying to delete it. Make sure to change slot and not material. Okay, in this case I... Slot and not material? Changing material applies to the new material. Oh, okay. Thank you very much, Uni. Thanks for hanging out a bit. Take care of yourself. Have a nice sleep. I'm gonna eat a small thing now. I'm really sorry if you're still listening, Kat. Oh my god. <laughs> that was meant to be extremely crispy, but... Kind of melted in my room. Blend my brain too much? I'll try. Hi, Stewie. I absolutely have to stop it like within half. Mm. I guess by 3 a.m., so 38 minutes. Mm. Thank you for the pet dinner. Okay, so uh, we've got the original body and we've got. Uh, 
come changing this doesn't change anything. Is that supposed to change something? I've kind of forgotten. Okay, that does change something. Okay. remapped to use that debate to it. So like just have it like this. Like Okay. Um So this one has the two materials. This one has the one remapped material. This one has remapped selected here. Is that okay? This is what's going to receive the baking. That one doesn't matter? Alright. It isn't? Entire baking happens on the other one. Oh, okay. Oh, it just goes to one image. Yeah, sorry. The text just... Yeah. <laughs> sorry, my brain is being blended. Blended. Um, okay, uh, I guess let me just double check the things. This has this to receive, this, so I could, if I wanted to, choose bake normal and it should make a texture that's this, right? Okay. So just the color, no direct or indirect lighting. That's good. This one also has this. Okay, so this is selected on both of these. Oh, wait, this one, sorry. I forgot I hadn't changed this one. Uh, this one also needs to be changed to 12, and this. Does that actually copy the text? Yes. Add a principled node. Well, I honestly don't care about any of the other stuff. Um, like, this is so much easier for me to understand. It's just a clusterfuck, the other one. To me, anyway. I mean, it's arranged kind of neatly, to be honest, but still. Um, so I'll delete this. Put this here. Normal map takes this. Oh, it's so small I can't read anything. Uh, okay. This takes 12. Okay, that's set to auric here as well. Oh, should I have this like this? Let's do that. <laughs> I feel like we both saw it at the same time. Um, oops. My god, oh. God, I misread your messages. I, I, f I managed to um, make a packed lunch or something. I can't even remember. It was like 20 seconds ago. I've already forgotten. How's the ear doing? So I was doing some... 
Oh, the issue was the first time I was using this. It was doing some recursive packing. Wait, it wasn't like recursing on itself, was it? As in packing a thing that it already packed and then packing that and then packing that. Okay, so we've got these selected. I'm going to switch to UV editing and I'm going to do the reload this and I'm going to... So we're hoping that this gets moved. So Stewie, it doesn't matter which object on the right is selected anywhere, right? As long as this is selected, and this is selected, and then on here, this is selected for the body, and yeah, that's it. The materials are both on here. Why do these look like grey and black? What the fuck? What? Why does Auric body look like dark grey and the hair looks like black? What the hell? I mean, it looks correct here, thankfully. Matters in some bake modes. Okay. So I should be able to bake now. Diffuse color. This is selected. This is selected. The UV map is remapped. Boop. <gasps> oh my god! It moved it! It moved it! But there's... Uh, it's only done the... It's only done the... Um, body. Not the... Uh, hair back. Which is interesting, because hair back is actually the slot that I had selected. Oh shit, you're right, you're right, roller skates were separate. Sorry. <clears throat> it looks like it actually did though. And I think it did actually have it selected. But let's try it again, I guess. It is got the thing here as well. Both objects? Okay, let's try. So UV editing has made one for this, which is nice. Still weird to me that it's not made anything down there. I'm wondering if these positions here are too small. I'm gonna enlarge them a little bit. I go to image reload, but let me try. Not doing clear. Yeah, okay, I, I get I get what you mean about that. Okay, nice. It actually did rebake and it worked this time. Let's see if selecting the multiple objects works. So I don't have to do them all sequentially one by one without clearing between them, but only clearing on the first one. You can just open the bake menu while in UV. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay. So... We don't need to be in edit mode, right? So we can go roller skates and... Body together. Bake. Hmm. Is it only the active one? Oh! There they are! It just hadn't finished baking them yet. 
Nice! Dude! Dude! It works! Oh my god, Siri, I cannot express my gratitude. I swear to god, but you have no idea how grateful I am. You have a small idea, you have a small idea. But it's more than you think. Oh my god, I always have like tears of happiness in my eyes. Okay, I gotta go to edit mode to be able to move this though, right? I kinda wanna move these to the side a bit. I have a prox <laughs> exactly. <laughs> An approximate idea. No, 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 no. Stewie is famously of help to a lot of dev. Uh, VTubers? Question mark? Or just streamers in general? Whisper harder, you Can I go whisper any louder? Kind of hurt my throat. I don't want to do that again. Okay, so now I can hopefully finish off this remapping. UV mapping. I don't think anything's missing now, Stewie. Apart from everything. Yeah, okay. I don't think in terms of like functionality anything's missing. Um, this is stuff that's meant to be shiny. Uh, so the stuff above there can be stuff that's not meant to be shiny. Well, therefore it can go anywhere. The other stuff can go anywhere. All of this stuff. Wait, what is that? Oh, okay. Um, bake the normal map. Oh yes! Yeah, I should do that. Oh, oh uh, yeah, I should do that actually just to test that, that works as well. You're right. Um, let's drag this up into... No, uh, we might as well leave it in the same place, because this needs to exist. So, I wonder if this can fit here. I reckon it can. Uh, I can't. <laughs> yeah, I can't quite. There'll be something better that can fit there. Don't change the UV. Okay. Oh, hold on. Uh, the original one's broken now, isn't it? <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> um. Editing the source ones remapped. Wait. I need to be editing the remapped for both of these, don't I? That's what I really should be doing. I should be editing the remapped for both of these. Because I'm accidentally editing the remapped of this. How do I not need to? Like, if I were to move this over to there and bake it there, then this one would still be trying to read it from the wrong location. Make a new UV, and move it in the new UV. But the new UV wouldn't exist on this one either. Basically, I'm editing this one. Even if I add new UVs to this one, they don't exist on this one. You're saying I don't need this anymore? Wait. 
with just one material. Make a new UV. Do whatever you want with it. And bake it again from the old UV. Which is a remap. I really don't want to keep moving around the same thing though. Like, I, I, I mean, I do want to keep moving around the same thing. I don't want to like have generation loss if I every time I move something around. Because unfortunately it like blurs if the pix, you know, if you move the UVs to in between pixels. Because it takes a bit of color from one. As long as you keep the current remapped, it won't miss too much. I feel like anything is too much. But that might be me being greedy. At least I've been trying to preserve, like I, yeah. Because on Photoshop I wouldn't be doing this, and I was trying to do this as an alternative to Photoshop. Did I try it? Yeah, yesterday. Okay, I don't understand why part of my leg is missing here, because I haven't changed anything to do with the leg. Is it because it's using... It seems to not be used. it seems to be using the... wait. What? Oh my god, I'm in edit mode. Wait, let me just come out of here. Ah, there we are, okay. I was trying to change this. Put it in the material, the UV map node. Yeah, but that won't work when I export it, right? The UVs will be all fucked up on the exported FBX, right? Oh, also, I was wondering, um, how do you choose... ...need to export just one UV channel? Yeah, how do you choose which one? Might to delete the other one, that makes sense. I wish I could just move it up. Instead of... Can you not just rearrange it? Because when you export FPX, I'm assuming it exports them in the order of these. Thank you for the bats, devil. Devil. Oh my goodness. Maybe it exports the active one. <sighs> yeah, maybe. The FPX section of the manual is pretty bad. Okay, well, uh... Let's try it. <laughs> Over time. Moggy body? Don't... It's just a blank rectangle. Like this? Um, I don't know if it's over time. <laughs> They look so bad flying across. I'll drag it in for the benefit of the FOD viewers. Um, alright, file, export. Wait, which things are you even gonna export? I don't even know what it's gonna export. This? Selected objects, I guess. Um, 
doing this? Putting it in a new blender, I guess. I didn't export the wrong UV map. On the sad side, I didn't export the mesh. Mm. I need to really do this and select everything again. Does that actually select everything though? I didn't think it did last time. Okay, let's try. File. Export FX. Yep. Yeah. Okay, that took longer to export, which is a good sign. Giant FBX file or something. It didn't be that bad. Oh my god, I've got too much shit open, I swear, right now. Oh my god, it's not this either. Why don't you have the folder open anymore? What the hell? Oh my god, my task. Oh my god, okay, I'm closing everything that I don't need. This, 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 this. This, 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 this. Okay. Let's find the project again. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, it's only 4.8 megs. Nice. Okay, it's not too bad. Import. Oh my god, I always keep forgetting. Okay, it's importing. What is this? What is this? What is this? <gasps> uh, that's not on here. Okay, this this looks painful. This like hurts me. Okay, let's check the UV maps for the body. It's exported them both. Oh, okay, right, right, right. Because you can't have colliders and uh, empty things. I see. Fuck, I'd have to remake all those as well. Um. Unity is really gonna like that. <laughs> is it just a load of game objects? Just... Positioned around the place? Not even like parented to anything, just positioned in some place. Bender calls that an empty. Okay. I see. Oh yeah, right, there was these dots, I see. So I guess it's just like a game object with nothing on it. <clears throat> Sorry. 
was keeping my head away from the mic while I was crunching. Um... Okay, so... So I can't... I can't, like, share a UV between two things. So if I edit one UV, it's gonna change. It's not gonna change. If I change this one's remapped, it's not gonna change this one's remapped. So... I just have to swap the materials out every time I want to see if it works. Bake to a higher resolution. if that actually solved the problem though because it's still going to sample in between pixels whenever I'm moving mm. <sighs> can I like turn this all off? I really have to do it one by one. Still doesn't actually stop it from being visible. Whatever. Shift click. I don't think so. I wish on the parent. Oh, okay. Oh my god, it hides the other things as well. Nice, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so, this one now, oh, this one now, uh, if I wanted to like move, if I wanted to do this, I'd need to make the two, I'd need to do this, I'd need to go back to this. And remake the other materials and reset all the vertices to correct one. Leave it with two material slots using the same material. Oh! Move one to export. Would that work? Then there'd be vertices. Uh, then there'd be vertices set to use a material that doesn't, like a material slot that doesn't exist. Like, you know, the hair thing here. It's <laughs> <laughs> size to the other one, okay. So this one here should be assigned to a different material, which is... The hair back. Yeah, this is only going to get worse and worse as I gradually merge more things into the same mesh. Hmm, I wonder. Let's say a hair like body. I'm sorry, Nuge. I'm having to concentrate. A sign. Nice, nice. That's all worked. You can more with different material slots of the originals, but have them use the same value, same material. Yeah. I'll have to go soon, Nooch, so yeah. I mean, how long are you going to stream, Muke? Uh... Pretty... Um... 
You can put them all back in the original ma- If you want to rebake, you can put them all back in the original material. Rebake and put them all back in the- Yes! Yes, 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 yes. I get what you mean. Um, so... Ah, uh, UV editing. Body. Uh, and the rollers. Okay, so that's... Interesting, okay, this does have the foot of the correct position. I must have done that before I made this duplicate of everything. Ooh, right the same person. That doesn't sound like a bad idea. Hmm. Let me see who's streaming on my end. On my Twitch. Maybe, I don't know, I'll see who's flying. Uh, oh my god, there are so many people streaming right now, holy crap. How old are you streaming? Who would have guessed? Uh... Rua, Lua, that's funny. There's literally, there's literally... Rua and Blua. Also an adorable maid. I have no idea who that person is. Um, I was on Chocopocalypse. Elkalunk, of course. Hmm. I was on, uh, I've rated a bunch. Mina, yeah, she's huge, so I can't rate her. <laughs> Mordecai Devson. Hmm. Oh my god, it's an hour later for Aulia as well. Holy shit, it's nearly 4 a.m. for her. Okay, I don't mind. She'll probably have a nice person to read. I've rated, I think, everyone in my list uh, who I would have considered reading for this stream recently, so I don't mind. Um. I'll leave it up to Ali, I guess. Alright, roller skates. Okay. So I'm just gonna have to put these back where they were again. So we're gonna scale it up to 10 times. Oh, that didn't work. Oh no, we don't need to. It's oh yeah, we do. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> this music though, oh my god, I love this so much. I'm gonna restart it. This can be my zen as I try to finish this remapping. These are all good. Actually, I'll move those over a bit. Uh, this. I got space here now, so I could put that there, I guess. You can pin the original UV. Uh, okay, 
so let's see. Select it in UV editing mode, then select the whole thing. Select it in UV editing mode. Like this. The whole thing. UV pin at the top left. Oh, it does make them red, okay. But you can still like move them around. So what does pinning do? I'm a little confused. There's other stuff from moving them around. Other stuff? What's other stuff? Oh my god, I was so confused for a moment because I was looking at the wrong UV map. <laughs> Okay, so we need a space for this. And it makes them red. Yeah, yeah, I saw some red earlier and I didn't actually know what that was. And someone said, it's, uh... It's like pinned as far as they know. Oh my god. But, uh, yeah. Then I thought, then I saw, wait, I can still move them around. And I was very confused about the concept of being able to move things that are pinned. This is annoying. This shape is annoying. Oh my god. <laughs> Hi. Um. How how are you barking? Sorry. <laughs> I need to remove some things. That'd be better. Maybe put it... Oh, hold on, there's another one. Uh... Rotate minus 19. That'd be better. That tucks in there better for sure. Oh wait, we still need a bigger gap. Like that. Then... Wait, I can edit both at the same time, can I? Yeah. Then... Maybe... I then did... I know, I'm supposed to be stopping. Oh my god, it's 3am. Okay, I actually should be stopping. Don't worry, I normally am up this late. I'm just not normally streaming this late. Uh, I'm not sure if that's any better, but... 8 hour stream hype. It's been a long time since I've done a stream that's 8 hours long. The longest stream I've ever done, I think, was 8 hours 55, and I felt like crap after that. That was a Black Mesa stream. Because I kept on thinking the game was almost over, but it, it was never over. <laughs> Spoiler, didn't finish it on that stream. Oh, I know, I can put that there to fit, fill in that gap there. And I said, okay, I'll never do a stream that long again. No, that's unlucky you. You've got eight hours of me whining and whinging and complaining and being helped by actually clever people. <laughs> okay, that's an unfortunately nearly okay size, but not quite. Because I could rotate it slightly. Oh, no, 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 I don't want to rotate it. That would be worse for the. Wait, I don't want to be moving any. <gasps> Oh my god! Hold on, I shouldn't have moved any of this stuff. Fuck's sake. Okay, hold on. I need to undo a bunch. Come on, you can put the, put the fox back. Okay, there we are. I have not had a meal yet, no. I should have had one. 
I got up at a silly time, I actually ate like an hour before then, so I wouldn't have been hungry anyway. But don't worry, I will eat. I promise. As soon as I finish streaming... Uh, oh, oh, oh wait, don't worry, I do have a snack, I did eat a little snack. It's, it's not, a, I wouldn't call it a meal, but I ate a snack. A little thing. Kinder Bueno. Or only half of it. One stick. Or whatever. Stuart, this will probably seem very silly to you. If you're still there. Uh, oh, hang on a second. I misread what you said. I wonder how well Blender 3.6 UV pack would do here after you have all them in there. That's interesting if we can do that kind of packing. Mm. But uh <laughs> box. Okay, uh you might find the city, but how I was moving things to make sure things stay properly pixel aligned. Oh no, wait I this has to be rotated anyway, so it doesn't matter. But when I didn't need to rotate how I was moving things, because I, we couldn't find a way to change the increment for snapping, it seems to just be stuck on sixteenths of the grid size. But um, for this, for example, if I wanted to reposition it without rotating it, I would move it like up to around there, look in the top left, I'd see delta x is minus 79.28 so I would type minus 79.28 x and then I would move the y thing <laughs> only in the y direction and see the delta y is 944 and then I know that it's moved by a integer number of pixels so it's still going to be properly it won't need to sample between Pixel blah 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 and whatever. I'm just, I need to stop talking and just finish this crap. Uh, I'll hydrate soon. This is kind of sad packing, isn't it? Oh wait, what if I take it more that way? Uh, hmm. This is horrible trying to pack this. How long were you streaming? Uh, eight hours just now! Hi Coffee Cafe, welcome, welcome. I, I will be ending very soon, I promise, I promise, I promise, I promise. I'll leave it like this for now, I guess. Yeah, let's leave it there for now. That's still a huge amount of space left. I never dreamed I'd get the roller skates that small, so I'm really happy. Um, about that, at least. Alright, let's try the baking. So, I haven't touched the material... Well, I'll just stop check. Okay, this is still selected on the Oreg hair back. Slot one here, that's still selected. And for the roller skits, that is still selected. Okay, all three materials for the sources. Uh, snap to pixels makes it so that the UVs snap to either the top left or the middle of a pixel. But Demonstrate easily because this hasn't been baked yet. Hold on. 
Why can't I see the UVs for this? There we are. But for example, any of these UVs could be anywhere in the middle of a... Um, Yeah, to the movement of pixels, exactly. So this one here is like close to the right side, a little bit less close to the top. If you move that while snapping, it'll snap precisely to the middle. I want to preserve the, the location within that it's currently at. So yeah, just snap the movement by that. But good actual morning coffee cafe. Um... Uh, me, you should sleep. Also me. Video editing at 5 a.m. Why not? <laughs> God. Stop! Stop! Sleep! Wait, we'll all stop and sleep soon. By which I mean, I'll stop. I'll, uh, start to eat and then struggle to get to sleep for like three hours. I don't know. Oh, shit. I've got to wait for my room to cool down as well because it's really hot in here. I can't sleep in this. Oh, God. Why am I doing this? I didn't think about the cooling down part. Crap. Sheen. Alright, so I should just fail to click bake and it'll all magically work, right? Mm, we'll just get so set to that as well. Okay, this should work. So these are both selected. I click bake. And hope for the best. This should move to there, this should move to there. This should move over a bit. It's done, apparently, but this hasn't changed at all. Image selected. This all this stuff? Yeah. That's on, that's on. And that's on. UV selected. Uh, this, like this, is on? I don't know. Is this meant to be taped like this? Or this? I never remember. Right image? Yeah, this is remapped body. I might need to do the old thing where you just have to tell it to reload because it doesn't realize something's changed. So I should have remapped. Clicked. And the source camera thing doesn't matter. Baking is set to diffuse. Uh, shading is taken from Auric. Uh, oh my god, where's the music? I can't calm it down. Shush. Is it taking from Auric on the shoe as well? Yeah. I know, I, I can't do it at the moment, sorry. Um, you bake without cheese. <laughs> I hope so. Uh, let's just do this. Okay. That's done. I. <laughs> uh. Oh, wait, no, that's correct. Oh, this isn't correct. Why is. Is this correct? That's not correct. The foot shouldn't be red. And that's not correct either. Well, I really hope not. It complained about something before, couldn't read it. Texture bake. I don't see an error. Ba baking map save to internal image, save it externally or pack it. Oric body, oric hair back. The first time. Oh, okay, I didn't see, sorry. Oh, when it didn't do it? 
I'll just try it again then. It's, I don't know. Do I need to have both selected and then be in edit mode? For both? Okay, that's made roller skates work. But this is red for some reason. Why does re this thing just sometimes affect what you're seeing on here and other times not affect what you're seeing on here? I don't get it at all. Mm. Well, last time I thought I had both selected. When you don't have it set in the material... Oh, right, right, you mean with the forced UV map selection thing? Welcome back, Jolene. Nah, my sleep's always like this. I just don't usually stream at this time, don't worry. Okay, so... Uh... Materials... Why can't I see anything on here, I wonder? Oh, we're gonna have to select them? It's not bad. It keeps happening to me. Okay, here they are. And this is remapped. Three point six. Okay. I just speak for the streamer. Be careful, Mr. Ring. Ah, I assumed they just meant like, dude. You know, like, and you know, as like a, I don't know what you call it. Word that makes something sound ex emphasized. Should I just try it again now that these are here? I guess I'll just try it again. Maybe it works this time. Stuff was weird before, so... No, the foot's gone red again. Don't worry, coffee. Alright. So if I select this and I select the original... 10... And we just don't look at this because it's silly. The foot should be coming from this area. So I don't understand why it's red. You should be taking it from there. <sighs> the right texture is selected in the material. Hair back is set to 12, auric body is set to 10, and this is 10.
Yeah, it's the same as before, right? We didn't change any of this, so just... It stops working, I don't get it. Mm. What if I just bake in, like, again, but while I'm over here this time? I'll put the colour in a mission. <laughs> Take him it, sure, why not? Why not? Don't worry, I don't know either fucks. Okay, that hasn't done anything. But I guess that's because Roller Skates is the one that's in edit. The yellow thing? Put the colour there. Oh, down into there? How do, how do you disconnect something? Or do I just put it in both? Wouldn't that make it super bright? Drag it off. Oh! Nice! I never knew! Here's slot one. Oh, sorry, that's where else gets this one. Slot two. Could probably just drag it straight from one to the other, can I? Yeah. Um I I don't know what the fuck this is. What is this? Oh, is it because this is should be black, I guess. Yeah. Whatever, bake. <laughs> yeah, for baking it shouldn't matter. Nothing. I'll never get this. This is randomly loaded here, I don't know why I even... Let me put this back. Oh, okay. Let me put everything forward again. We seem to be going into like a trouble finding thing now. This is, I can't, I don't think I can do that. This is a thing that's going to take a long time, isn't it? Because the old way they used to work has stopped. Stop apologizing, goddammit. It's not your fault that this program is so fucking temperamental. Okay, roller skates has baked. Now let's try body and roller skates. Bake. I think I might not archive this stream, it's like super negative energy. Right, there's nothing there. It didn't say, I didn't see any error. Okay. Boop. Texture bake. Texture bake again. Nothing. Didn't even say that it's... Oh, there we are. Baking map saved to internal image. Making map safe to internal image. Now object not selected. Oh my god, this program. No, I wish I wish you could clean clear my room coffee cafe. That'd be really, really nice. Making map saved.
this is the kind of problem that was happening yesterday. It just completely randomly sometimes does it. Now it's black. <laughs> what is that shit? Uh, uh, what is that? Wrong UV selected? Maybe? Try that? This? And an edit mode. Edit mode is what used to make it work there. Okay, that looks correct. Except, not well, maybe it's not finished? Oh. Okay, let me turn on clear. Because I don't know what I'm looking at right now. Uh... Now, somehow, Roller Skates has unselected itself, so it's not done there. Uh, yeah, now it's not doing the hair at all, which is better than having a orange foot. So now it is doing the roller skates, and it's doing the some of the main body, but not this foot for some reason. And is it selecting the material and all that? This is on, this is on, this is on. This is on remapped still. This is on remapped, this is on remapped. Yeah, it just, it just doesn't work. And put it back to combined, I guess. Because at least doesn't make it look too bright. I'll just, uh, I mean, it's a learning exercise, I guess. I've learned to do it the Photoshop way. <laughs> um, this is still selected. What did you find not worked when you upgraded? Uh, I wasn't able to reuse the older version. Well, I, I cat exported the thing actually from the new version and I wasn't able to open it in the older version. But yeah. Well, hold on a sec, I've still got emits selected, haven't I? No, combined is selected now and it's still. Now it's all black. Oh, that's because I haven't. On this. <laughs> no object not selected. No, it's all just black. Combined will do lines? Oh, what did we do before? Combined is what I thought I had tried at some point yesterday. Oh, diffuse was it? I guess diffuse. Okay, we've got most of that and this, but we do not have the hair, and the foot is also not there. So there's nothing over here anymore. <sighs> there's no UV map again. Oh, well, there's no UV. There's nothing there. Should we just try the new one? Is the hair even working? It's, it's black. Is it like overridden the black or something? I wonder. Because yesterday some things were just randomly being overridden sometimes. Uh... Her back is set to 12. Baked with the wrong note selected? 12. This is 12. Yeah, it's been overwritten.
Okay. But all this is going to do is make the foot go red, isn't it? Because the foot's like here in this red area. Well, the foot's going to go red again, isn't it? That bit's still not working. Is the foot using the head material? Wish I could tell, but there's, there's nothing here for me to look at. <laughs> Apparently I'm selecting things on the right, but they're just not there. Oh wait, shit, there's this. Nice. Um. Let's see. Materials, the body, select. The foot is on the wrong one. How did that happen? Interesting. Let me assign the, blood, the thing to the thing. Is it hidden? Yeah, it wasn't. Yeah, I guess when it was less broken? I honestly have no idea how that happened. That's just how... I didn't even assign... Did I click assign? Oh, yeah. Maybe I did. Alright. Uh, uh, let's try it again, I guess. This is selected. This is selected. This is selected. This is selected. Diffuse. That's some base color. UV map. I think so. Looks good. Wait, sorry. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it's correct now. Okay, nice. I mean, yeah, yeah. Wait, I can't... Yay! <laughs> so I just have to guess that that looks correct, because... Well, if I wanted to test it, I would go to... Here and change them both to... The remapped? And then this, and hope this changes then. Okay, nice. I mean, stuff looks good. This looks a little creased there, but in all honesty, this, like, they probably would on real shoes. Remapped material doesn't have a UV assigned. Remapped material doesn't have a UV assigned? That's correct. That's correct. I guess I could do that. But, you know, then it's going to confuse me about why it's using the wrong UV when it's exporting, I guess. Uh, body or body skin? Why? <sighs> How do you delete something? This is bugging me so much. I keep trying to delete one and because I keep selecting the wrong one by mistake. This one? I guess not. So, this one? Yes. And this one takes it from her back. Okay. Alright, this is working at the moment. I'm gonna save this. I'll save it as something else though, because this file name is completely a lie now. Um. Atlas skits, I guess. Make sure to shield the actual auric. 
Auric body is hair back is auric iris some roller skates is so it should be okay they're the three originals auric body is yes f f pay press f to pay respects to the amount of time lost <laughs> all right i can't believe all i achieved was Adlessing the roller skates in eight and a half hours. <laughs> Alright, so save and exit. I literally just saved. Uh, save one modified image is. Uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna save this before I. Oh, maybe it was that image that I was talking about. Wait, let me do another one. <sighs> so if I open Blender now, the other one should be gone, I guess? has gone. Nice. Oh yeah, I've seen that video. <laughs> World's greatest blender at all. I like Captain Disillusion. Alright. It's finally coming to an end. Everybody, you are now free. You're free. Go, go forth. Please, take care of yourselves. Those who have remained here. Oh my god. There you go, that's the poster check for you. I think I just rearranged half my skeleton. <laughs> and I'll do the poster check. The hydration as well. Yeah, I'm very far from the model being finished as well. Welcome, I'm afraid. Maybe. Oh my god, I can't. Sorry, Fox. No. Gotta do the weight bend till over it. That'll be very strange. Uh, Okami, please make sure you have a break as well. You're welcome, Enlin. Everybody's welcome. Thanks for the Yuki. Have a good rest and dream of little blenders. Oh, you know I'm going to. <laughs> you know I'm going to. Yeah, you know, let me re-enable all our games before I forget, especially. I'll even turn on the bauble. It's a special celebration. Feel free to get your rare bauble throwing in. This one's not normally on until it's Christmas time. It's only 64 fangs. have a chance of it landing. Oh, you know what? Let me lower it. There you go. It's only one fang to throw a bauble. Uh, is it working? Hang on a sec. Okay, let me turn this off. It's not working. It's, uh, stop, stop. Don't waste anything. It's not working. Hold on. Uh, why is it not working? I can't even fucking be bothered. <laughs> I'm ending stream. I'm not about to start debugging another thing. There's so much stuff I need to be debugging already. <sighs> Sorry for wasting a few of your points. Thank God it was set to one point most of the time. Sorry for your first one. <sighs> well, let's pass you on to who I was going to be passing you on to, I guess. It's so long later now that I guess I should pass you on to someone else. Uh, if they're streaming, but... Uh, Owly suggested raiding Whitechapel, who is something I've never raided before. Did I say some... 
Let's see something, someone I've never read it before. I think it's a mix of some one I've never read it before and something I've never done before. Um, they are in Tempura Pura, which is the art group that Cat is part of. I guess my hands in the air, like I just don't care. <coughs> Passing us on to someone else, but you said we'd be free. I know, I'm sorry. Uh, alright. Twitch? Alright, fine, I'm passing on to- <laughs> He literally- Literally just wrote BRB on the screen! He literally just wrote BRB on the screen. Or BRK. B right cat. Oh, wait, did he just delete it? He might have just deleted it, actually. Anyway, he's drawing something. Pixel art of someone with long blue hair. Uh, and not a lot of clothes, but it doesn't look like something nude. So, yeah. He's part of Tempura Pura Katsun and Ayabu, yeah, and I guess his ethics in there as well. Uh, a lot of people are cat knows. Um, not a lot of people I know. Oh, White Chapel makes games as well? Interesting. Alright, I'm passing you on. We are going over to here. Sorry, this is probably going to be quite loud. The shout out, I mean, not, not the actual raid. Uh... Wait. I don't know what I just did, but... Uh, oh, I did exclamation mark raid. Amazing. <laughs> My brain is so destroyed. Alright. We're heading towards this person who is like a glass ball with coffee sloshing out of it. I'm, I'm, I'm trying, I'm, I'm, I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. It's like a light bulb with coffee. There we go. I pat the broken glass. I've, I've got stuff coming out of my own fingers now as well. Alright. Um, thank you all very much for being here. Um, sorry this is such a long and weird stream. Stewie, I, I need to repay you sometime. It's not a horror stream. That's... That's... That, that's just, just just how the chapel be. Um, he's drawing something that's very much not horror. Absolutely not horror. Oh, the coffee leaking. I see, I see. <laughs> but yeah, thank you all very much for being here. Um, I was planning on streaming again tomorrow to try to finish off this job, but I'm not sure I can manage, so I'm not sure if I'll do it or not. Not sure if I'll be in any state to do it or not. But yeah, bye bye! Thanks for being here! You're all super kind for being here. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go.